It's gone now. Ah, oh, hi guys. Ah, oh, Jesus. It'll be gone now. How are we doing today? It's Tuesday, isn't it? It's Tuesday. Oh, that was a good one. The second one, though, I really dug deep for that. I hope you appreciate it. Okay. It's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. How are we doing, guys? Hello, 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 hello. Shout out to that mid song from a mid expansion. Just kidding. Today is going to be the redemption arc for Heaven Sword. Right? Today is going to be where Heaven Sword. Uh, I was going to say pops my cherry, but I feel like that's not the right term. Uh, <laughs> where Heaven Sword uh, pulls out the bag. Yeah. Sorry. Sorry. Miss, misspeak, misspeak. Don't type her. Just misspeak. All right, my bad. Soken is mid. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I just wanted to make it Heaven's Sword's mid joke. Look, you guys say it all the time, you know? Um. All right. How are we doing today? What's going on, guys? Hello, hello. Chuck a little aloe in the chat, all right? If you haven't already. Thank you for the resubs, by the way. I'll read you guys out in a sec. How are we doing? Emil from Nier, Dula Peep, Small Apple Pie, Sethiri, Lobosaurus, Tombri Kev, Opus Man 99, Wicked Sin, Sethiri, Surfing Beard, Tung Kneeve. Jesus! This is loud. Jeez, that was so loud, man. Fucking hell. All right, where did I get to? Tung Kneeve, Tombri Kev, Sora of Hearts 22, Kafis Spindle, Kalazarin, Gilganos, Shriek 89, Uwu Sil. Um, we have a Devil Bird, Dr. Marks 87. What's going on? Hello, the girl cage, Ruffy Puffy du Buffy Duffy. Hello, hello, welcome back. What's going on today? Hello, X1. Um, think I said Lobosaurus, but you get a little extra one from me today, Lobosaurus, as long as I can check that tail in the guild in a second, all right? All right. How are we doing today? Azuri, Dragon Freza, Alice, Aretha, Lix, and Mari. We also have, um, Cozy Rosie, Ravio Prime, Kami DK, Blackstar Uzumaki. What's going on, guys? Berry, Mochi, by the way, good call on the Easter eggs, Ravio. I need to go get myself, you know what? I shouldn't. I shouldn't get myself some Easter eggs. I need to be good. Right, guys? We need to be good. <laughs> yeah. Um, hello, hello to Aquarian O'Wither. Welcome, guys. How are we doing? I think I said hi to Berry Mochi. You get the pitchfork randomly. Um, Carbuncle streaking. Woo! Welcome back. What's going on, Nathaniel, man, as well? 80 streak. Woo! 80 streak is kind of pog champ. Kind of poke champ. Um, Citrix, hello, hello. Welcome back in for seven months resub, by the way, as well. Might as well do the other subs while I'm at it. Uwu Sil, thank you for the eight months. Yippee! And also X1 with the prime for 29 months. Sheesh. Putting the others to shame. Yep. Wow sub right there. That's a wow enjoyer. Or a previous wow enjoyer spotted right there, should I say. Um... Tom Brikev, how are we going again today? We have... Um, uh, most people I read. Hold, hold. I think I said hi to Cryfos. Um, Crimson Dragon James. Alu, alu. How are we doing today? I hope you're well. What's up, Gloomy? Hello, hello. Alu. Welcome back. I hope you're also doing very, very nice today. Um, let's have a look. Let's have a look. I'm scrolling. I'm scrolling. Hold, 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 hold. Talula. Hello, how are we doing today? Doing good, thank you. Just running through MSQ so I can do the event currently at level 38. Oh, how 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 high do you have to be to do the uh, FF event, uh, James? But yeah, that's good, that's good. So you're cruising on through on uh, which character? Is this your third character, the Lala, is it? Wait, you have like three or four characters, right, James? But I guess, are you getting them all to do the event then? And then you need to start the MGP grind as well, right? Um, yeah, hello. What's going on, uh, Tallulah? I hope you're doing well. What's up, Symphonian Rhapsody as well? Welcome back, Nathaniel, man. We have Kalazarin. I think I said hello to Kalazarin. Um, Kyle... Kyle... 
Kyle. Kyle Till Desley. Hello, hello, hello. What's going on? Artopedia as well. Solitaire XIV. Welcome back. What's going on, Danville and Phantasm? I am a WoW enjoyer. I know you're a WoW enjoyer. You're very much big of the WoW enjoyer variety. Ha mid is mid. Mid is mid. That's true. That's true. All right. You only have one character now. Started to get. Oh, wait. What did you, did you just get rid of them or stop playing them? So, wait. You have one character, but it's level 38. So did you just start fresh and get rid of the uh, high level ones? Like kind of like a fresh start, start over thing. You did, but I'll accept another hello. Will you also accept a kissy, Kalazaren? That's my trade offer. Kissy for free. Yeah, that's correct. Oh shit, okay, okay. You started completely fresh over. Damn, did you like delete all your gill and everything like that as well? What, what, um... What made you, what made you start fresh on an like? I get the whole mi not wanting to micromanage characters. That makes sense. Me too. That's why I just I just plan to have the one right. Um, what made you start fresh instead of just keep the max level and then delete the like lower ones? I suppose. Like, why did you go that way as opposed to the the other way? Zenobun, what's up? Blah. Hello. Is this a place with more information about the fashion thing? Um, you know what. I'll write a quick post on my Discord about it, but the information is happening on Friday. Um, my stream will start at normal time. Do that information what you will. <laughs> but the fashion show will not start until at least the stream has been up for one hour. So absolute um, earliest will be like 3 p.m. my time. Absolute like, it'll never start earlier than 3 p.m. my time. And most likely a little bit after that. Let's be let's be real. Okay. Um, and it'll be on Oceana. Anyone can join. The theme is mythology. Um, specifically outside of Final Fantasy XIV mythology. So don't come up. Don't come turned up as like one of the 12. Or, don't come. Don't turn up dressed up as one of the 12 or whatever. Because I don't. I don't know. I don't have any interaction with them. I don't like know if we even see them, what they look like, etc. Super camera. Um, so don't like that could be spoilers for me or anything like that. Um, so outside of FF mythology, you can do other game gods. You can do in real life gods, different culture gods, any kind of any kind of culture, religion, whatever. Um, yeah, late stream on Friday. I mean. That's not confirmed. I just mean that like the, the glam contest is not going to start until the stream's been up for a while, so it gives people time to trickle in, right? Um, what's going on? Oh, sorry. What's going on, Sion? And also, Kalazarin? God, why did the music have to stop? There you go. There you go. All right. You get many. You get many. Kisses, please. You better say thank you. Um, got mine picked out. Hopefully you can make it. Hell yeah. Hope so, Debonair. Yes, yeah, open to everyone, so perfect timing. Yeah, what's up, Enska Sleeps? Hello, uh, the 12. They don't exist. They're like the Isle of Val. Yeah, I just know that on the character screen, I selected one, and, uh, that's it. That's it. Wank me. Wank you. Wank this. <laughs> um, for the Xbox release, found it fitting. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. So are you playing on Xbox mainly now? Uh, or you just wanted to like sync it up with the Xbox release so you like kind of get to experience the game with a bunch of new sprouts and stuff, James? Interesting. Fair enough. I respect it. I respect it. Hell yeah. You gotta do what you gotta do. Thank you. I thought you said it was for free. No, just say thank you. It's manners, okay? It's about manners. Dude, why is my camera looking at my goddamn washing machine? Stop focusing on the goddamn washing machine and look at my face. There we go. Uh, mm, mm. I don't know where I got this mug. City of Bristol races, 2017. I didn't even live in the country in 2017, nor Bristol. So I don't know how I got this mug, but easy steal, I guess. Washing machine stream. You know what? I'm going to close that door because it's going to keep doing it. <sighs> Stole from GF. Didn't have GF uh, when I got that mug. 
I miss him already. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I do be back. What's up, Mutant for Hire? Um, kisses for Russ. I don't know where his lips have been. Right here on my face. Planted right here between my chin and my nose. That's where my lips always are present. Oh, the washing machine? Oh. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. Um... No, no, no. My lost memories? No, so I lived in Sweden in 2017. So I don't know how I got a mug from Bristol races. Because I, 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 I certainly wasn't in Bristol and I certainly wasn't doing any racing. Yeah, yeah. What's up, Jamantis? How are we doing today? Right. Why are you, uh... Oh, stuck ass. Right, right. It's the washing machine. I see now. Focus on the cock. You see, I specifically didn't stand up from my chair because I didn't want everyone to spam cocker and say bunda. Because every time I stand up, if I'm putting in the eye tracker, if I'm going back there to do something, everyone's like, whoa, cocker, bunda, this guy's got the cake, which is all true. But, you know, it's the difference between thinking it and saying it, you know? No, we don't. I'd never do that. Gyat. <laughs> yeah, people say gyat. <laughs> God damn it, man. We would never do that. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Us? Us? Sexualizing Mr. Streamerman? Couldn't be. Couldn't be in the Just Rush channel. Right, let's uh let's open up the game right here. Final Fantasy Xiv. Never. Never. Uh Russ and Chat should all grab content warning on stream while it's there for free for the next uh three hours. Should all grab content warning on Steam. Wait. Content warning? Okay, wait, what is this? Steam. Is a game for free? Is it like an April Fool's game? Game is free to add the Okay. What kind of game is it? Alright, I'll uh I'll grab it. Yo Vossenberg and how are we doing today? It looks like spooky lethal company. Oh shit, alright, hold on, hold. It's happening. Uh content warning. All right, let's get it. Film cool stuff for our viewers. Oh, this song kind of goes hard, but I kind of want to watch the thing. All right. Scary to get on. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Get, get camera, back here. This, we need to take this camera. This is Citrus's first game, by the way, guys. Uh, say hi. Content in warning. To Citrus Bird. We need to go in Hello. into that ship, um, film cool stuff for our viewers, and then oh, upload streamers. video and make views, which makes money they're, they're YouTubers. to make more views and more money. So let's go. Hoorah! Solid plan. All right, we've oh, cool. It's actually kind of good down. graphics. So now we're going to try finding something scary to get on to get on film for you guys. Oh, this is cool. Right, so we've just been suggest. Can you touch him? Oh, he's going to blow up. He's going to die. <laughs> oh. I like how you can have a little emoji as your face. Oh yeah, it's like Lethal Company. Minecraft. Oh shit! Minecraft YouTubers, am I right? <laughs> Wait, and then you watch it back? Interesting. All right, I'll add it. Uh, there we go. Yay! Yippee! Okay, I have it. Guys, you might as well go get free game. Content warning. Path of Exile. I don't want that. All right. Uh, where's Steam? Let me close it. <sighs> Influencer noises. Yeah. Okay, let me pull this over here. Do this. Perfect. I'm in. I'm in. Please tell me that's proximity chat. I hope so. Dude, proximity chat? I swear, it just enhances any game, for sure. R6. Uh, Wait, Rainbow Six? I don't have that. Why Why are you saying uh, that? Yo, Adir10, what's up? Any MSQ? Yes! Why are you doing like an ultimate Giga Kappa? 
Kepa Infinite. I've never seen that MO. Also, also, oh, I've got an update to do here. Uh, it is MSQ today, yeah, but we're doing it in about 30-ish minutes or so. So we're letting people get into the stream to chill for a bit, come to the guild, swing by, show me their character, show me their glam, blah, 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 all that good stuff. And then, boom, baby, MSQ time. A whole of patch 3.3 .3 in one stream, okay? It's a level 100 hype train emote. Oh, were you part of the uh, the pirate software hype train? Hell yeah. I, I saw a tweet about that. It was like, hype pirate software has beat the all-time hype train record. It was like level 86 or something. And then I guess because everyone saw the tweet and everyone started tweeting about it, everyone went to the channel and made it even higher. And then it hit 100. And then they had to like make new rewards for it. <laughs> and then he hit like, I think it was like 106 or something. Yeah, so I guess you had to, uh, you had to, yeah, 106.47. So you had to, like, at least give one sub to get that cap at infinite. And you have that now forever now. That's perfect. Great guy. Yeah, is he the guy? I've seen loads of his YouTube shorts popping up. He he looks like a super nice, like, really knowledgeable guy. Really, um, I don't know, like, genuine, authentic kind of vibe I get off him. It just seems like a chill bloke who who is a... Software developer. I think he used to work for Blizzard or something. Is that right? It's pretty cool. Yeah, he's wise and he knows a shit ton about the games industry and stuff, right? Yeah, he's really down to earth and he he's a, has a really good way of explaining things which aren't like condescending. Ex Blizzard, yeah. Wow, guys, you know what? <sighs> he's probably Blizzard's biggest success story. Unironically. <laughs> the best thing to come out of Blizzard, guys. The best thing to come out of Blizzard. Pirate software. Yeah. Yo, Amatoria, how are we doing today? Uh, he went to check uh, an FSOS line stream. Some people got a resub. Uh, and we proceeded Golden Kappa. Oh, shit. I've never had a Golden Kappa train. Ever. I've seen so like I've seen people get them like every week, and I've never had a golden cap train. Can we keep farming the hype train on cooldown until we get a goddamn golden cap one? Like I don't know how it works. Is it like a one percent chance when it pops or something that it's a golden one? I don't know. I don't know what's the percentage chance, but I've never had one ever, and it saddens me. I need the golden capper. Do you only get to keep it for a day, or do you just have it now forever? The golden capper. Uh, he played... Oh, he played 14 as a warrior as well. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Um, there's a reason you can make 10 great companies from experts employees. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Fido. <laughs> exactly. All right, let's get in the game here. Golden's 24. Damn. Gonna go look since still fixing computer. All right, Amatoria. It's a... Uh... You can always catch up on the VOD if the MSQ is something that you're interested in, for sure. Good luck with the PC troubleshooting. Hope it all works out for you, okay? I'm pretty sure you get the Golden Kappa on your first FF subathon. Um, really? I don't remember ever having one. Are you sure? I'm not trying to gaslight you here. I I'm genuinely curious. I mean, you might be right. You might be right. But I, I was under the impression I'd never had one. Yeah, but I could be wrong. Because I remember every time I go, like, actively every time I see another channel, we get one, I go, really mad. Because <laughs> I'm like, I've never had one. <laughs> but maybe I just have. I don't know. Uh, let's put this on. <sighs> All right, guys. It's MSQ day today, baby. I didn't get one. I was in on the subathon. Were you in on the first subathon? Because I had one, like, when I first started FF. I think that's one Sil was, uh, Sil was mentioning. And maybe you might have still been a VOD enjoyer then. Yeah, yeah, I think that was the days when Voss was a VOD enjoyer. But then you caught all the way up on every single VOD. <laughs> and then you're like, well, guess it's time to go to the stream. Ah, it's the only logical next step, you know. Uh, that's Golden Greyface with no space. Should have been mine. Yeah, goddamn Greyface. Isn't there something you can do? Um, there's some like thing you can type in chat where it supposedly like inverts colors or something. I can't remember what it's called though. Tap the vein, go to the source. Yeah. Hit up the heat up the rust spoon. Hey. It it's not like that, right? It's not it's not a drug, right? 
I hope not. I hope you're here by choice. Optionality and whatnot. Uh, isn't it one train per day? Um, in the channel? No, no, no. Like, I was just checking my settings, actually. Like, because uh, I changed it. Or what I thought I did the other day was change my hype train. Basically, I noticed that my hype train was much harder to, like, push up each level than other streamers that I see. So I went to the settings. And I made it easier to push up, like, per level. Um... And then I also lowered, like, the chance to activate by, like, one event. Um, but I might put it back up to four because it feels, like, a bit too easy to trigger with three. So it feels, like, less special when it comes around. Um, but I, I put the put the level up to, like, to medium. I think it was on hard or super hard or some shit. But I didn't change anything else. Apparently, the cooldown on mine is one hour. You can set it to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or eight hours. I just had it. I've always had it on one hour because they don't really get triggered that much anyway. But I've noticed since it became like three events to trigger, it's been happening more often. I don't want it to like lose its um, intrigue or like interest or whatever by having that. So I might put it up to four. Medium trains? Yeah, it's a medium trains. Yeah, it's one train per hour. So it has a cooldown. I think Ponto had it set on two hours. So, oh, hi, Alice. This is where I looked out, looking at you. Uh, yeah, so then people were like, oh, isn't it a two hour call? I'm like, no, it's optional. Like, you can choose which, right? Hey, chat. What's going on, Hattie? Hi. Yeah, so it's on uh, it's on, it's on, on one per hour at the moment. So I'm just going to leave it at that for like now, and, and I'm going to experiment with it. I might twist the knobs a little bit as we go until I get to a place I like. What's up, Pablo? Hello, hello. Pablo Escobari. Yeah. Tap the vein, go to the source, sus. Of course, that's the that's the time you type in chat, huh, Pablo? Yo, what's up, Riflo? Hello, 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 how are we doing? Twist this. Oh, by the way, Solitaire, if you're on, come to the guild and I'll add you on my uh, my gift my gifting character so I can get you your prize thingy. Because I think you're like one of the last people. Apple, I saw your DM, I just didn't get to reply to it yet. But um, yep, you're all good. I will uh, I will look at it later. Um, and I've already got you added, so I can, I can, uh, send it whenever. Just need to know what to do. Take your time. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, I will have, a, wait, let me just, let me just check this right now. Old. Uh, let's see. Pastel pink dye. Oh, yeah, 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 I can sort that out. I can sort that out. All good. Should be fine. Have to protect my business. How is the business going, Publio? What's up, Mean Cupcake? Hello. How we doing? How we doing? Okay. Um. Yeah. Let me let me log on. Uh. Rust just gifting for a second. Actually, I'll be back in two jiffies. Maybe even one jiffy. Mm -mm. Going strong. Very nice. Are you guys ready for? <sighs> heaven sword baby it's heaven swording i i heard that this is like the you know what all i know is like you have like a peak and then you start building up to next so i think like this is the heaven swordiest of the heaven swords and then and then we're going into stormblood build up or some shit that's all i know but all i know guys death to nidhogg Death to Nidhog. That's all I know. I'm gonna chase. I'm gonna chase Astinian down. You know what? I might even dye my armor red. I might even dye my armor red today. Death to Nidhog. All right, Solitaire. Let me know when you get here, or come and like stand in my face or something. Trues. Yeah, yeah. It's really hard to avoid stuff like that as a streamer, to be honest. Like, all I know is people enjoy this patch. That's it. Because people constantly fucking say it in the YouTube comments when I go into a stream. They're like, oh, where are you in the MSQ? I'm like, yeah, I just did this. And they're like, oh, just wait till patch this. It's like, thanks, I guess. <laughs> like, it's so annoying. Like, I, I don't even like, that's why a lot of the times when I go into streams now, I just, I just don't chat because like people always put the spotlight on me and then they ask where I'm at. And then I feel bad if I don't answer. And then if I answer, they tell me stuff and I'm like, I didn't want to know that, you know. Did you watch the patch videos? The patch videos? What's that? No? I don't think so. Just wait till patch 8.3 where... Gee, Jesus Christ. Goddamn Dumbledore at it again. Death to Nidhogg. Yeah. 
It's not mid hog, guys, okay? Alright. Hog. <laughs> uh, Alright, who have we got in the guild today? What QEs? Dude, I feel like my camera settings are different on this character. Is that a thing? Is that something that I've changed? I feel like I zoom in quicker. Unless it's my mouse? I'm not sure. Um, starting over from ARR. Yeah, I'm starting over as a level 2 Lala Fell warrior. Okay, guys. When I said MSQ today on Tuesday, what I really meant was ARR V2, baby. Yeah, it could just be Lala stuff, actually. You're right. Wait a second. Sill? Wait, Mini, you trust Sill? Better have changed the plate. Some lalas are okay. Oh! There's been a change of heart, guys. Finally! The lala mom is back. The lala mom is back. But it's not a phase. I think it's the you will be killed with hammers. That part is still not a phase. <laughs> the kind of um, double-edged sill, so to speak. With the dark hair. The uh the Zayla Sill with the black hair. Gone are the days of the of the rain pink haired Sill. But you know what? I guess she's alright. I guess she's alright. Hi, Cocktail. We're gonna play the 16 crossover. Um not today. Did it come out today? I'm not gonna do it today. Um I was just looking at Discord before I turned on stream and people were saying it was spoilers for like FF16. For me, I don't think I'm going to play FF16 anytime soon to the point where I'm probably going to forget anything that happens in that crossover by the time that I eventually play 16. Like, let's be real. I'm probably not going to play it for fucking ages. It's not even on PC. Um, I've got other games to play first, like 7 Remake and stuff. Um, So, yeah. it, it It's not going to be something that I'm going to get spoiled by, but it's more that People probably won't want to watch me do it because they don't want to get spoiled. You know what I mean? So I don't know. I don't know how big the spoilers are, how major and stuff. But also, I get what you guys are saying. Like, why would they even put them in? <laughs> like, it's Yoshi P who is director of both games. It's interesting that he would put spoilers in when, you know, obviously they, he knows like the culture around FF spoilers and stuff. Don't look in the React channel. The React channel. Oh. Uh, can I not even see the thumbnail or anything? Okay. Spoiler is supposed to be a minor early game spoiler. Yeah, for me personally, I doubt it would be class of spoiler. Um, but it's more that like, am I going to do it on stream and stream it to a bunch of people who don't want to see the spoiler? It just feels like it's something I shouldn't really do, you know? Um, what server am I playing on? Uh, so I know where to cheer you on from. Oh, right now. We're on Spriggan EU Chaos. Uh, which server do you play? Uh, which data center and region and stuff do you play on, Hattie? If you're on NA, a lot of people have made um, like EU character alts for the sake of just like coming to the guild, hanging out. Some of them do MSQ on those alts slowly but surely. Some of them have Lala alts like here. Um, some alts become pseudo mains here as well. You know, Feline is uh, gaming on the alt now, doing everything, doing everything again. We've also got a uh, FC that you're welcome to join as well. Um, but yeah, this is uh, this is my main server, Spriggan Chaos EU, and uh, hopefully they're going to integrate the cross-region travel to like NA to EU, EU to NA as well eventually. Um, but right now, at least we have Oceana as like a meeting up point. Um, Chaos, let's go. Oh, you're on Cerberus. Hey, easy clap. There you go. You can just jump on over to Spriggan. We're in the uh, Marauders Guild in Limsa. So it's uh, the upstairs top part of Limsa up here. Right at the top. Right at the northernmost part. Um, Lala Kabi spotted. Yeah. Fiora Chi Chibi Bloom. She's kind of cute though. She's kind of cute. Look at that. Look at that. Look at the Moogles holding her up, you know. We love our EU alts. Hell yeah. And then we can bring mains and things to... Uh, 
to stuff like the glam contest and the Oceana meetups and things. And and I, I really do, I I think that the Oce so far, at least the exposure I've had to it, the Oceana like travel thing has only had positive feedback. Like no one has been like, oh my God, everyone's just been like, woo, we could finally bring our alts together. Woo, we could finally do events together. Like, I, I don't think I've seen anything bad about it so far. So hopefully Square Enix sees that. Yeah, and it worked. And it just it just kind of worked. And it was like, oh, there's no problems. There's no bugs. No one's getting stuck on that uh, region. No one's getting stuck on the data center. Can't travel back. Not, not having problems traveling to it. Everyone's just like, oh, sweet. All right, it works. Yeah. So hopefully they're going to just see all that, all the stats and all the positivity around it and be like, Fuck it, let's just send it for EU to NA and stuff. And then we'll just kind of, it'll work, right? <laughs> Which should be great. Am we going to crash the markets? Yeah, I definitely think the economy side of it is going to be like the more shenanigans, shenanigans side. Because like I could go and yeah, you can like, because the servers are quite often, like they're quite relative to EU and NA, they're quite dead, right? Um, like at least from what I've heard, like not that many people play on OC because it's kind of hard to find people. So I guess people are like going over there bringing, cause you can bring items, bring gill, use the market boards and stuff. And it's a bit more interesting, I suppose. But other than that, like, I'm sure it's, I'm sure it's mostly good things. Yeah. The only thing I would think to be cautious about would be the, uh, the market stuff in the economy. <laughs> Maybe lock down the markets. Honestly, I'm quite surprised that you can take like even even like cross a data center like light to chaos and even cross server that you can like trade gill around and everywhere has like I think there should just be like a global market board if they're gonna do that. Or like it's weird that you can just hop server till you find the lowest price and then buy it from there. Like it's 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 not alien to it's not weird to me that you can take Gil across server as long as the prices would be the same, I guess. But it is strange to me that you can like take an item across, so, like buy it cheap on one server, transfer over and list it higher and stuff. To me, that seems a bit strange. Like they should just make it all globally one, but maybe they don't like, they seem to have very slow impl implementation of those kind of things. And maybe it's very spaghetti coded and stuff, right? Yeah, shopping on light. Yeah, yo, Trucky, what's up? How are we doing today? Cross data center pie finder. That's probably one of the biggest requests I've seen recently. Like people, people seem to say, Dawn Trail needs this feature or it will fail and FF14 will die. They need cross region party finder or cross data center party finder. Or, yeah, maybe like with sim in region party finder, but cross data center. I, I mean, that makes sense to be honest. Um, I would agree to that, but maybe it's just harder to implement. It does seem weird that everyone's got to like travel their character over to a certain data center to like look in the party finder and stuff. And you can't even see what's in there until you get there kind of thing. Yeah, the whole game is spaghetti code. I think, I think with these kind of games, they kind of, but they don't think that far in advance because especially if they base their design decisions off, off um, essentially like customer player based feedback, right? They can't really think 10 years into the future. So they design it from the ground up, which works in the moment. And then they maybe release a feature and everyone's like, wow, this is the best thing ever. Now I'll implement it on a wider spread. And they're like, eh, kind of hard, kind of hard to do that because the shit we, we made 10 years ago doesn't really allow us to do that thing. So they have to find like some weird way to, to implement it. Just to get a P Yeah, I heard light is where the party finder exists and there's like nothing up on chaos, like almost ever. You're looking forward to Beastmaster more than MSQ. Wow. Okay. Is Beastmaster coming out with launch or is it a later patch? That's def that's very definitely how they work. Yeah. Yeah. See, I'm not a game dev, but at least I can empathize with them. <laughs> yeah, in a patch, right? Is it the point one pat the point one patch, I think. Maybe I heard. Yeah. Um, specifically with this one where they had to remake the game at the drop of the hat. Yeah, yeah, especially, yeah, exactly. With 2.0, they were like, well, to be fair, when we watched the uh, no clip doc, they're like, oh, we basically started working on 2.0 before they even released 1.0. They were just like, yep, this is literally so fucking shit. Let's just ship this out. Everyone's going to be pissed. Uh, let's start 2.0. Let's start scrapping it. But to be fair, admirable that they made content for 1.0 at the same time, just to keep people playing, right? Fair play, fair play. 
Sorry if you played 1.0, by the way. I don't know if there's anyone in chat who did. I definitely know there's a few people that do come into the chat now and then who have done that, but yeah. Vince Pendragon. Okay, I like your aura, James. Hell yeah. He's kind of cool. He's stacked up. He's stacked up like heck. Old. <sighs> Damn, you, he really is a new he really is a new character, huh? <laughs> no plate. TVH all computer gr programs of non-trivial sizes of spaghetti code. Yeah, 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 exactly. Like I've never done any coding ever. So, I have no idea how it works. In my brain, it just my brain is spaghetti code, but also in my brain like all I think is you change like one line or like one word in a in like a whole page of code or do you even call it a page i don't know and then nothing works it's like uh i'm trying to think anything i have like similar experience with but i feel like there's some things i've done which like it, it works kind of like that you move like one decimal point or you move like one thing here and nothing adds up or makes sense or anything like that right Silver Koei, stuck in a cult. Help, you are not stuck. Just kidding, you are stuck, but it's not a cult, okay? It's not a cult, but you are here to stay now. So, grats on the seven stream streak. Easy clap is what they say, okay? You are stuck here out of choice, all right? Wait a sec. Following since 29th of March, but you're on a set. Wait a sec. Wait, you've been here seven streams in a row. Have I streamed seven times since the Oh, you watched the first few then you followed. All right, you know what? I get that. I also very rarely remember to follow on the first time. <laughs> Respect it. Yeah, yeah. Code is writing infinity lines of statements and later trying to simplify it. Yeah, yeah, true. Like, do it a really complicated way and then try and simplify it down. But then when you simplify it down, you might make a mistake and it doesn't work and you think it's not possible, but then you actually realize that you were just being silly, you know? Same. Dude, there's, there's streamers that I watch quite regularly who I've been watching for over a year and I haven't followed them because I, I feel like I'm too deep in to follow now. <laughs> this is the PSA. If you feel like you're too deep in and you've been here ages and you haven't followed, feel free to follow now. I won't judge, okay? You followed off stream, yeah. Follow off stream, but you still see it. Like, I still see every time, like, I log on in the morning, I see, like, oh, I got, like, you know, four follows overnight or something or, like, six follows overnight or something. So I still see the names. And then I'm, sometimes I'm like, huh, I recognize that name. But then I, I don't have a problem with it. Like, the streamer doesn't actually care. Yeah, offline following, yeah. Uh, didn't need follow notifications to start a streak. I don't know, actually. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. I guess Discord notifications, Colors Aaron. Uh, I don't watch streams, I don't follow very often, but I do watch YouTube channels entirely through recommendations. Yeah, me too. YouTube's really good at re-recommending you stuff that you've watched, though, because it has, like, much more of an algorithm than Twitch. I think Twitch's, like, recommended tab... It's like if you click on them and watch them for more than like a couple minutes, it'll it'll put them back and you're recommended like every time they're live. Because uh Okay, I I'm gonna out myself. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna out myself. Okay. <laughs> so I don't know if any of you guys know Pookie, but I always see every time he's live in my recommended tab, but I haven't followed him because I and I'm VIP. I know the guy in real life. I've known him for like two years, but I just forgot to follow his stream. <laughs> <laughs> so now like i go in his channel and i'm like ah shit like i'm not even following but like i don't want it to follow because i, I one day i will pop it like i i think i might sit on it for like another year or so i might sit on it for like another year and then just pop the follow and he'll be like huh what the fuck but Right now, I'm just sitting on it because like now it's got to the point. First, I realized it and I was like, oh, shit. I was kind of embarrassed to pop it because I, I forgot to follow and it had been like a few months. Now, I find it too funny that I want to let it build up more. So like now I'm intentionally not doing it because I'm just waiting for like the better time to do it. Right. Clipped. No, don't tell him. Don't, don't tell him. <laughs> yeah. 
It's like when you've met someone out a few times and never learn their name. Yeah, because like I still watch his stream pretty regularly because he every time he's live, he's in my recommended because I watch it. It's just that, uh, yeah, I, I don't actually have it followed. So, unfortunately. Fix the no plate. All right, I'm ready. Blow our minds. Hey, very nice. He is here. Exclamation mark for questing. Right there. He's ready to pump. I don't like that Twitch followed followed sort list into offline uh sorts uh list sorts offline channel how you how recently you followed them and nothing more useful. Oh really? Oh the offline stuff. Oh is it? I did not know that actually. I never looked through like the offline channels to be fair. All I know is like on my recommended, it's like the same few people at the top every time. And then sometimes for some reason people like fall out of that despite me watching them often. I kind of preferred it when uh, the follow list was like not listed on recommend. I mean, it is really handy just having the people you watch the most at the top like this, but I kind of liked it. I know you can change it to get it to like high to lower. Why is it? Why is it scrolling down? Okay. Oh, uh, okay. You know what? Never mind. It's broken apparently. Um, <clears throat> where it would go high to low, and I would just scroll down the list and find the lowest viewer streamer that I enjoyed watching. Right. Yeah. Billion dollar company. Yeah. Apparently, I can't even change that setting. <laughs> World of Warcraft. SMH. I mean, yeah, most of my following, I'd say like 90% of it is WoW streamers. Wait, let me let me have a look. Yeah, most of it is WoW streamers. Then we've got like uh, Spazzy. Oh, he changed name to Spoozy now. Okay. Then I've got like the big streamers like Miss Kiven and all those guys. A couple of FF streamers here and there but to be honest i don't really know that many ff streamers i'd say i i actively watch like five ff streamers or something but most of it is uh just chatting or wow streamers to be honest and then like a, a couple of variety streamers a couple league streamers i suppose as well like rat and stuff but i, I don't really watch a lot of them to be fair i don't, I don't watch that much twitch i, I watch actually I, I do i do like i always have it on but i don't like, I just have it muted. I open, like, four channels and I mute them all in, in four separate tabs. And I'm just like, well, I guess... Because uh, cause I just find it too distracting. Like, if I'm at my PC, I'm trying to, like, do something. And then I just find myself watching Twitch, you know? Um, What's up, by the way, Mr. Dust? I'm catching up soon. I'll leave you in the dust because I'm dust rushing. Wait, whereabouts are you now, Mr. Dust? Actually, World of Warcraft, Russ, despair. Wait. DJ Farmville, since you've been here for like literally years and years and years at this point, is that like a despair as in I was despair and it was horrible to watch? Or is it like, man, I missed that guy? <laughs> Viewbot Classic. Wait, who's viewbotting? Only wild streamer I follow is McConnell. Oh, he's based though. I love McConnell streams. I, I watch McConnell like every time he's live because he's live so rarely and his streams are just always such a shit show. He's great. Just look, uh, just took down Titan. Oh shit, okay, yeah, you're actually kind of pumping. I mean, what's that, like halfway through? Something like that. Eh, don't know, bit over? Yeah, Titan's good though. What did you think of the fight? What did you think of the story around it and stuff? You're watching streams but not watching them? I mean, I think it doesn't count as a view, right? When, um, when you have the tab muted. You miss the viewer raids. I miss the viewer raids as well. But I miss like the up to BFA viewer raids. I really stopped enjoying the viewer raids in um, like Shadowlands and beyond. Because I just felt like everyone was like bringing their dog shit alts. And trying to take advantage of the fact that I was doing them. And it just made the quality worse. Which made me enjoy them less. Which made the stream like more annoying to watch right. Like, view raids were great when people would just bring the characters and the intention was, like, to do something fun as a community. View raids were not fun when people were like, hey, here's my fresh thing, dog shit ult. I have no idea how to play. Please carry me. Uh, there's, like, a huge difference there, right? FF view raids? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the plan. There's going to be plenty of FF view raids going on. Um, 100%. That's kind of like... I actually think... Like, I don't want to rush to endgame, but I think... My content at Endgame will actually be, like, pretty good. Like, I really don't think... I have, like... I back myself enough in, like, the, the nature of stream, stream, streamer that I am. The experience that I have with, like, doing community events at Endgame. Wow. And I think there's just more to do in FF. 
So I really think that like I'm not going to fall off. In fact, I think that my stream will probably grow even more when I get to max level. But I'm also not rushed to get there because I want to enjoy the process and the journey and stuff, right? But I really do think that like my style of content and like the YouTube videos that I already am like hatching in my brain and stuff like that is going to like grow the channel, the YouTube, the stream even more at max level. But yeah, I don't want to rush through the MSQ to get it. I, I just want to take my time, build up a nice core. And then, you know, maybe people will follow me through the through the MSQ journey and maybe they'll dip, but maybe they'll come back and be like, oh shit, he's doing some view raids and shit like that. View raids, 20, 30 hype. Yeah, like the, the thing is like, there's so many different raids that we can do with viewers, right? Which will be sick. I see a little Lala here, the Liberator. Hello, Pablio. Nice for you to show. Show your face around these parts. Oh shit, I'm getting Coke, water, Moco grass and heart chocolates. All right, this is perfect for us just gifting. This is my little Lala alt for gifting gifts to people. So I can pass on these gifts. <laughs> yeah, plenty of grindy stuff. Yeah, loads of grindy stuff, loads of community interactive kind of stuff that I can do as well, which will be sweet, which will be sweet. We keep saying this, but muting the stream or the tab does not matter. It's a myth. Twitch has said this multiple times. Plus, I can phone up myself. Twitch likes Locus and there's no reason to discount muted viewers. If they did, they would also discount if you muted the tab. Um, yeah, I, I heard the tab did stop working as a mute. I swear Twitch have uh, said that they actively made it so that muting tabs minus is one from the viewer. Um, but that was a couple years back now. So I really don't know how it works. I'm, I'm okay to believe what Bumble said there. I do think though that you can only count as a view in one stream at a time. So I don't know if it's like the one that you most recently had unmuted or something. Cause like, let's say I have four tabs open of different streams. I don't think I'm counting as a viewer in all four of those streams, right? It works for drops. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Yeah, I, I constantly get drops. So I just open up a tab and mute it and sit and leave it open all day and I get the drop, right? Um, Only the best quality. Yeah, it's, wait, was this purified? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah, we need the best quality right there. Hi, Owly. Long time no see. Is she wholesome today? She looks wholesome. What the fuck? Jesus! What the actual fuck, bro? That was a plate. Kissing a mushroom. You might want to change that one. I thought you'd be wholesome today. Bonk. It's a strawberry. Jesus. Yo, Rocky. Hey, yo. Ah, very wholesome. Ah. Okay, that must be... That has to be the most TOS play I've ever seen so far in this game. Jesus Christ. Don't you try and fool me with the goddamn angel costume. There ain't no way. I'll never believe it. And bus driver's driving like they're in a movie speed. <laughs> Kane Kaiser, thank you for the follow. Oh, uh, look, for some reason we get a follow after that. Jeez. It's not that type of stream, guys. This is a wholesome MSQ stream. Can you show it again? No, you can come to the Marauders Guild in Spriggan and you can look at it yourself if you want. All right. I ain't opening that again. Oh, look, Hattie's here. Hi, Hattie. First time plate. Please. Redeem the plates for everyone here, okay? Okay, there we go. If it can't summon, I don't want it. I didn't even get to read the text on Ali's plate because I had to close it so quick. All I saw is something about Ifrit. Look at it again for real, though. You guys can look at it, okay? You can take screenshots of it in your own time. I'm not opening it. Look, I'm streaming to people that don't want to see that, okay? <laughs> God damn. Hattie, that's a cute plate, by the way. We will not look at it for too long if you don't want it. If you don't want us to, okay? All right. I don't have love heart on this character. Um, uh, is that okay for me to open on a bus? Oh, the the Twitch, the Twitter link should be fine. It was the plate that uh, should not be opened on the bus. Mewing streams does not remove you from the view account. Oh, when did they say this? Oh, that's 2020 though. I f I feel like uh they've said an update since, but you know what? Maybe not. Maybe time just fucking flies. I thought they made an update in like 21 or 22 about that. I could be wrong as well. You missed the hourly plate. It'll be in the VOD, okay? I, okay, is it safe to open now? Is it redeemed? Look at all the eyes. 
Howley. <laughs> Howley. Yeah, sure. Sure, wholesome. Look at the eyes. All eyes on Owly, huh? Jesus. Sure. Look at that smile. How innocent. Surely she's so innocent. Yeah. I'm not going to risk it, guys. Minnie, what happened to... Minnie, where's Sil? Oh, hi, Voss. When did you get hit? Were you there the whole time? True blue crew. Oh, shit. You got blue on uh, on EU now. Nice. EU mobile, let's go. Okay, all right. Wait, have we been MSQing on uh, on EU? Hold up. Or did you boost uh, this one, actually? I don't remember. Voss boss. Stealth Voss. Silly left. Yeah, what the hell, Sil? Roulette. <sighs> fair enough, fair enough. Hey, what's up, Meppermint? How are we doing today? Pure. Yeah, I don't know if, if uh, Owly Wood is a pure, innocent soul. Not going to lie. You know what? I almost, she almost had me going until that plate. Back to square one. Yeah. Bumble's the real angel, right, guys? What did zero say to eight? That belt looks good on you. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Sup, fellow Russ. Got a job interview in an hour. Good luck, V-Dash. Go smash it, all right? Turn up 15 minutes early and uh, be charismatic. Easy. Easy, right? I swear, actually, you don't need to turn up 15 minutes early. Just turn up like 10 minutes early. Yeah. Easy clap. Just be charismatic, lol. Uh, should go for a sussy plate. No, no, no. You're the actual innocent angel, okay? You're allowed to don these vestments. But Owly is not. Okay. Did we fix the plate? Did we get to, to fix the plate? God, I'm so low down. I need to log back on my aura. Yay! <sighs> Lovers. No more despair in Mari's plate. Mari lives. New energy. Peepo riot. Death to redacted. <laughs> Yippee! I said nothing but eating fruit. Yeah, I don't know about that one. I don't know how you even managed to do that. <sighs> Fresh fish heads for Mari. And Mari always gets fed, okay? Look, I may be late to stream, but I'll never let Mari's uh, health and hunger be uh, obstructed, okay? All right, let me log quickly back on my aura here. Do, 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 because we need to get going with the MSQ very soon, guys, very soon. Finally free from my meeting. How's Russ and chat doing? I'm doing pretty good, Rocky. Yeah, I'm feeling uh, energized. How are you? Uh, I use the eating on onigiri emote with red lights. I see. Yeah, I, I mean, I'll give you this. It's a very balming plate. So you were very imaginative with it. Yeah, it was just a... Uh, it was probably the sussest one we've had, though. I uh, really think about watching the next WrestleMania. I don't really know how. Wait, Dragon, I've just, I know I've, this is a really old message. I've just randomly scrolled up the chat to see that. But um, it's pay per view, right? WrestleMania. Honestly, I used to watch wrestling when I was a kid back in like 2000. And, oof. I reckon it's like 2004, 2005. Like that's when I used to watch wrestling. Didn't watch it until about like two months ago. One of my friends was streaming the, the Royal Rumble to Discord and watched that. And I was like, you know what? It's actually kind of fun. Like, you know, it's fake, but same with like movies and stuff, right? It's just kind of entertaining. Like the production value on professional wrestling is like nutty. Like it's actually really, really quite high production value. Like way more than, than I remember. But I guess like they've had tech develop almost 20 years since uh since i last uh, watched it right triple cream coffee all right i'll take one of them oh and an apple strudel all right i'll take that thank you wrestling is fun not only wwe yeah yeah so i i well i don't know like what wwe versus raw or anything like that but i just i just watch the big events sometimes like i watched a little bit with ponto when i was over his as well just watched a little bit of um 
uh what was the previous i don't know uh there was like another match since the royal rumble and i watched that with him and it was pretty good 20 years old yeah i'm 20 years older now what's up anna the banana long ass time no see how are we doing today yo 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 Cody losing night one, winning night two. Yeah, I don't even know who the wrestlers are, to be fair. <laughs> I just know that, like, it's quite fun to watch. And, and, like, now that when you know it's, uh, when you can just, like, be, like, cool and come to terms with the fact that it's an act, it's, it's a bit more like, oh, like, it's quite impressive how they, how they actually, like, do those moves without getting hurt and stuff, right? Um, looking forward to the graphics update. Yeah, I actually am all about. I'm not, it's not something that like, I feel like the game desperately, desperately needs, but it's obviously a welcome change, right? Graphics being updated, like who can complain at that? I think it's actually really good that they are doing that. I think that is important in like MMOs, especially, which generally run on like one engine for a lot of years, every like 10 years to do like a big graphic overhaul. I think that's really nice. And the players usually enjoy that. There's nothing like I'm particularly looking forward to it. Hopefully they fix the shadows though. Like the shadows aren't that bad here, but it's like um I know that in the uh the black shroud the shadows are pretty terrible. Like with the forest canopy above you and stuff. Um it looks really terrible. But that's like my biggest graphical complaint about this game. I really don't think it looks that bad, to be honest. Yo, Lucia, hello, hello, how are we doing today? Um They do hurt, but not all yeah, yeah, yeah. So I've been watching uh I've been watching sometimes it comes up on my speaking of YouTube recommended it comes up on my YouTube uh, on one of my I think it's on my VODs channels algorithm and uh, it's like an ex pro wrestler I can't remember his name like may mayhem or something like that I can't I can't remember his name but he kind of like he started doing like tier list of the most painful moves to receive in wrestling and stuff because obviously he's been a professional wrestler so he's been like Batista Bond and shit and he he said that one fucking collapse like that one is is not a fun one yeah Maven yeah 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 so uh he yeah he just puts out a ton of youtube videos uh, about his like wrestling days and he talks about like steroid abuse and things like that with like wrestlers and who's doing it well not who but you know if people did it and stuff like that um it's quite interesting to like get a little behind the scenes of it um because it's like i guess like a sport slash art because it's an act as well right the event's so dumb clive looked like he's been photoshopped into a low-res world <laughs> Yeah, to be fair, I think FF16 graphics are a little bit ahead of 14 for sure. Yeah. Shows they're committed long term. Yeah, that is true, actually. Yeah. Didn't even think about it that way, to be honest. Yo, what's up? No way, don't care. <coughs> How are we doing today? Right. Guys, by the way, we're going to start the MSQ very soon. It's nice to see so many cool, friendly, nice faces in the guild, by the way. I'm going to drink that coffee. And I'm actually going to fill up my water as well. Where is it? There it is. And my strudel. And my strudel, don't forget. No, 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 no. Right, I'm going to fill up my water glass because it's an MSQ day. And that means my voice is going to get shot. So I'm going to get myself prepared. I'm going to pour myself a big old pint. And uh, then we're going to probably get going, all right? I might need to swing by the... Um... I might need to swing by the gold saucer to pick up my cat pots, though. Eat an egg. Okay. We got ourselves a point, mate. Uh, he looks like a current geared character in classic. Well, <laughs> to be fair, I have not done any. I've not played any 16. And uh, what is the mount actually? How does the mount look from the uh, crossover? Because like people said, there's maybe a spoiler. So I'm maybe like kind of down to just like skip this one. But I also maybe just do it off stream or something and, and skip just to get the rewards and not actually look at the quests or something. Because if it's spoiled, it's a dog. Oh, if it's a dog, I kind of need that. Just do it off stream. Yeah, I might do that then. 
Cutscenes unskippable. Oh, <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, there's a spoiler cutscene you can't skip. Okay, yeah, I'll probably just do it off stream then uh, to get the rewards. It's spoilers for the first hour. Yeah, it's probably not that much. Okay. I mean, th that's fine. I don't personally care about it being a spoiler for the first hour of the game because I don't think I'm going to play the game anytime soon, probably one day. But I don't really want to stream it to people who are like here to hang out and they can't watch the stream for however long it takes me to do it because they don't want to be spoiled kind of thing. Uh, I did not play the demo, no. Yeah, that's fair enough. Uh, I mean, for me, I'll, I'll just do it off stream in, in that case, right? <clears throat> Going permanently in the glam plate. Nice. It's not the biggest spoiler. Yeah, it's from the demo slash first hour. So for me, it doesn't it doesn't really matter. Like, I, I don't... I'm one of those people that... So, like, I don't want to get spoiled for this game because I'm, like, streaming it and I want my reactions to be, like, genuine and stuff. But for me, like, personally, even if I did, it wouldn't, like, lessen the enjoyment but it would lesser it would lesser the lessen the like surprise factor, you know. It wouldn't lessen the enjoyment of the game for me. I'm one of those people like with media. If I know the ending, in most cases at least, a spoiler like doesn't mean that it ruins it for me. Like some people get ruined by spoilers, and that's fair enough, completely fine. For me, I'm just like, oh, okay. Well, I'll just find a way to enjoy it regardless. Like there's been movies where I know what happens, or if a character dies, or something like that, right? Um, but then I just spend the rest of the movie trying to work out how that how the storyline is going to take it in that direction anyway. So I, I make myself like a new little mini game anyway, and I find a way to enjoy it. I'd still probably rather like it's probably still better to not know in the first place, but it doesn't like mean that I'm like going to resent whatever spoiled it for me or something like that. Right. Yeah, it depends on the spoiler for sure. There's some things which will like completely derail the entire narrative if you know. Because of like plot armor and things, if you know what happens. But um, for the most part, it's usually fine for me at least. Right. <clears throat> um, mm -mm -mm -mm. Shall we get going on the. Uh, shall we get going on the MSQ, guys? Maybe it's time for a little gold saucer trip just to pick up my cack pots. Like, there's no gate. Look, wait, I'll even wait. For four minutes, so there's no gate to distract us, okay? Consider it a big spoiler. Yeah, fair enough. I mean, I'll just do it off stream in that case because I don't think I'm going to play 16 for like at least a year. Um, I'm good. How are you? How's life? Yeah, life's going pretty good, Anna. Yeah, much, much better since I quit WoW, to be honest. <laughs> um, And yeah, Seth Rollins is good. Also, uh, who's that other big bloke? The... Uh, Who's the, uh, wait, maybe I'm thinking of Seth Rollins. Yeah, the guy who's the undisputed heavyweight champion of the world or some shit. Uh, gate starts in four minutes. Wait, if you wait four minutes, the gate will be there. Oh, that is true, actually. Maybe I should go now, then. Yeah, maybe it's time. Okay, okay. Is there any new cuties in the guild that I need to check their plate, though, first? Like, I think we looked at, uh, oh, wait, I said I need to check, uh, Leah's pale. <clears throat> Madam. Nice eyes. Could you please turn? Whoa, that's skimpy. Jesus, how did I not see this before? Je Tail check. Whoa! That thick one, guys. Sheesh! No sniffing, guys! No sniffing, it's a tail check. It's a binoculars, not a sniffer. No, no liquor, just a binoculars. I mean, you, I guess you could type booba. Wait, what's that? Cock up. <laughs> Fucking Lala Bells, bro. Cock up. <laughs> but I love her. All right, as long as she gives me permission, okay? Look at this elf. Look at this elf lady. All right, Leah. It's a good tale. It's a good character right there. Who this? Oh, Renzo. Oh shit, Assassin's Creed collab came out today. Oh shit, that's kind of cool. He does actually look extremely Assassin's Creed, I'm not going to lie. That, that looks hella good. What that tail do? It's a tail, guys. It's just like, it's for a balance, you know, for dragon balance. I'm small. Yeah, I get that. I get that. Fair enough, fair enough. Okay, look, guys, the gate's almost gone, okay? Are you blocking? 
Is there a problem here, Voss? Are you going to blew me up? Are you going to blew me up with that starter pimp cane right there? What that cane do, huh? I'm the problem. It's me. <laughs> Voss and Blocken. Hmm. <laughs> I make horrible science puns, but only periodically. Does she know she's already used that one? <laughs> Why are you magging? Yeah. <clears throat> I feel like I've seen this. Did you not? I didn't have time. No. Fair enough. Fair enough. Recycled joke. Oh, wait, wait. Could we make a recycling joke there? Hold on. Toxic streamer for pointing it out. <laughs> Is that toxic? To just be like, yeah, I've heard that one before. I don't think that's toxic. <laughs> Killjoy. <sighs> All right. Whatever. Whatever. I'm going to look at this elf. Wait, hold on. I'm going to look at this aura first. Holy. Now that... She's kind of a goth mummy. You a cutie. Whoa. I do not mind being called cute by her. Holy. I take that, guys. You a cutie. Okay. Leap of faith is underway. Oh, which leap of faith is it? Wait, it's not the mushroom one because it's 20 past. <sighs> Guys, we might we might have to do it. It might be the rock one. It might be the uh it might be the leap, which is uh the easy quick one. Alright, fine, I'll wait six minutes or eight minutes or whatever, and then I'll do the cackpots, okay? The Lula. Nice outfit. God, there's so many cute auras in here. <laughs> Peepo Marble, yay! Oh my god, this old plate. Zero imagination. I mean, the background, but you've changed the the picture, right? You've changed the portrait. No, do the gate. Do the gate. <sighs> Fine, guys. If Keecha comes, I'll do the gate. No crimes while sleeping. Will you come do the gate with me? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Alright, let's do it, guys. To the gate. You guys can also come to the gate. Aura supremacy. True and real. All right. Oh, shit. Persephone. Oh, shit. I need to come back and check Persephone. Check my plate. All right. You know what, guys? I will check all your plates. However, well, not all your plates. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. We're going to do the MSQ after the gate, after the cack pots. Okay. Cack gate, cack pots, MSQ. Uh, I want to check. Uh, you know what? Maybe I'll just check your plates as, as I see you in the world today. Okay. And then MSQ. Okay? It's time. Gate first. Easiest gate of my life. Alright, it's this one. This one's literally a two minute run. Okay? Maybe a quick game of Fortnite. Wait, no. That says frontline. <laughs> no, no, no. Okay, gate. Cackpot. Oh my god, this one's a busy one. See, this is why everyone loves this gate. Because it's never up. Oh god, I need to be zoomed in a little bit. Oh my god, I'm so zoomed out. Maybe I need to do this. Oh, maybe I need to do this. All right, there we go. Okay. All right, two minute run, guys. Okay? Trust. Trust in the process. Why am I just going up and up? Uh, I guess we're going over here. Yeah, did I miss one? I hear it. I literally hear it. Huh? What? Oh, it's above me. Oh, I don't like it with the names off. It looks weird. I'm putting the names back on. It's actually really distracting me. <laughs> Why am I so zoomed out? What's happening to me today? Help, guys! What's happening to me? 
<laughs> I actually can't game this today. Oh, there we go. All right, we're chilling now. Fuck. Hmm. Just falling. <sighs> Fuck. Today. Okay, today is actually just falling. I I can't like look at. Okay, I'm looking at my character's feet now. I'm looking at my character's feet. Dude, is it? Not, it's not just me. Like Minnie's back here. I saw Bonnet there a second ago. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. All right, we're chilling now. Get that one. Get this one. Get that one. All right, there we go. Okay, we're back in it. We're back in the game. Dude, this way was such a waste of time, by the way, going up that thing. Okay, I'm on the ball now. Oh shit, there's a silver back here. Okay, I'm gonna go back for that one. I've gotta go down. Okay, I'm on it. I'm absolutely on it now. <sighs> now we're gaming. We're gaming, we're gaming, we're gaming, we're gaming, we're gaming. Is that the gold? Oh, that's the gold. Fuck! Dude, this one? This one's actually kind of difficult. Or I'm just being an idiot today. Don't you laugh? <gasps> oh. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Yo, uh, Smash, thank you for the follow. Okay, here we go. This is it, this is it, guys. This is the gold. Coming right up. Hallelujah, baby. Okay. It wasn't actually that bad of a run. Okay. The start was a little bit rocky. The start was a little bit rocky. But overall, actually only just over four minutes. Not the worst run of all time. God damn. Easy. Took my time. I really did take my time on this one. Hey, look. Gloomy. Hell yeah. I'm in your walls. <sighs> Honestly, I'm in every everything is living rent free in my head after that after that fate. After that gate. <sighs> I feel like such a subpar gamer right now. That portrait, yeah, it's cool, right? The little flip. That has to be the uh the V pose for sure. Dragoon V pose, baby. The bug girl made it. The bug girl made it. Good job. Up to no good. Napping. See, this is how you eat an apple, Owly, okay? You look cute while doing it. Alright? There's no strawberry eating. No no weird stuff going on. Alright? It's just a Lala felt eating an apple. You ping jumping. Oh, yeah. I imagine that's actually kind of hard. Yeah. Streamer late to the gold. Yeah, my bad, guys. Okay. I looked cute. <sighs> I don't know, dude. You looked sus. Okay, you looked sus. All right, has everyone made it? Are we all here? Holy shit, we actually got a shit ton of people here. Let's go. Gamers. All right, who's down there in the depths? Who didn't make it yet? I see Makina. All right, Makina's almost done. We have, uh, let's have a look down the other side here. Who's below us? I see Voss. All right, that's the ping. That's the ping. Hmm. Uh, who, who can I see down? Oh, there's so many people in this goddamn leap, by the way. I don't think I've ever seen one this busy. I guess it's just because um, uh, it's like quite a rare one to get, right? 
Like, usually in the mushroom one, everyone's just fucking in, out, because it's on like every 40 minutes it's done. You made it? Easy clap. 16 event. Oh, people need the MGP. All right, that makes sense. How much do I have now, actually? Uh, oh shit! I've actually, I've actually spent a shit ton on chocobo racing. <laughs> I had. Oh no, no! I bought the, I bought the FF uh, regalia, didn't I? I bought the for, the, uh, the 13, 13? 15? 13? 15? I bought the fifteen regalia. But then I also spent a lot on Chocobo racing as well. Yeah. 400. That's pretty good, Rocky. That's pretty good. All right. I'm going to I'm going to jump out, do my uh, thingies real quick. Thank you for coming to the gate with me, guys. I'm going to do my uh, thingies so we can start the MSQ, right? Cuz it's 1 hour 30 into stream now. We've stalled enough. Everyone should be in here. For the start of the MSQ now. I'm going to do the cack pots and then we begin. Sludge happy MSQ. It's happening finally. Sorry if you were waiting for MSQ. We are now beginning it, okay? Smash, uh, smash you new. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Um, and I said, I said thank you to Kane. All right, perfect. Mini cack pots. Surely today is a day I get a good ticket, right? I haven't had a good ticket for like, I don't think I've had a 10k in over a month. Surely it's gotta be. <sighs> Fuck me. All right. We go again. We go again. You got a 10k today? Smash who? Uh, Smash Inu. Smash Inu. Rip. Rip. Um. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Smash this. <laughs> this has to be it, right? Fuck. Dude, give me a good ticket. Okay. God damn it, man. Um. All right. This has to be it. Surely we can at least get seven, eight, nine, right? Ow, dude, my tickets have been so bad for so long. God damn it. Gold Sorcerer is rigged, man. See, this is this is how they get you in casinos, okay? You win early and then it's and then you're just done after that. Yeah, very much despair. Very much despair is happening constantly in my life in this game. Yeah. Jumbo Cat Bot looks to be in order. Alright. Constellation prize. What was it? Five, five, six, seven. Mm, I don't know if we beat any of those. Maybe one of them. Not that one. 1649. Come on. Rip. Rip. Alright, guys. This comes the best part of the week, okay? You guys get to choose my ticket numbers. Obviously, 1409 is the first. That's a given. One day we will win with 1409, okay? 1409. Alright. Give me some four letter digit codes, okay? Nine one three two. I kind of like that. I've done the three tickets one for oh nine, and it it hasn't worked yet. But it it would work. I mean, it would be real good if it paid off. However, then I'd have three of the chocobo rings, and I can't wear three of them, you know. Yeah, new chatter. Kick that ass. Wanting me to do a boob. All right, you know what? Because you said. I'm going to do one boob since we had a first time chat suggesting uh, 8008. All right. One boob. Okay, guys. And you can't have one boob without the other boob. So I guess we're going. No, I'm kidding. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take. Uh, I kind of like the first number I saw. I think I'm going to go with the 9132 from Voss, actually. I like that one. 9132, baby. Oh, yeah. Kick that ass. Thank you for the follow, by the way. 
You see, easiest follow of my life. You just got to put boob as a, as a number. I was going to do it already. <laughs> nice. All right, there you go. That's the numbers for this week. We will come back Monday and check. Hello, Volps. I'm checking plate. Oh. Oh. Little new portrait. Cocktail. Oh, wait. <clears throat> Cocktail, look away. Shh. Nice. Don't tell. Don't tell. Nice 3.3. .3. All right, now it's MSQ time, guys, okay? I'm going to go to... I assume we're going to the, the uh, manor. Yeah, we are. All right. Guys. We're going... to foundation. Cocktail mentioned. Kaiser, thank you for the follow. All right, it's 3.3 .3 time, baby. One hour 32 into the stream. I think that's a good amount of stalling for an MSQ day. Now everyone who wants to get into watch the MSQ from the start can be here, okay? The pace. He's on it. Grim, welcome in. That's the first time chatter right there. That's the first time chatter right there. The pace is on. 3.3 .3 is on, okay? It was tactical stalling all along. All I was doing was waiting long enough for people to be like, oh shit. There's a 3.3 MSQ today on Twitch. I'm going to go get me some of that. Okay. So now you can watch the whole patch. We are doing the whole patch in one stream. Okay, guys. I don't care how long it takes. We're doing the whole patch today. So strap in. Don't type copium. Strap in. Get yourself some snackies. All right. Because I'm going to be reacting. Big time. Stentoft. No copium. Decadence. Don't type sure. Also, hello. <laughs> oh, we're going to be pumping all right. Look, you need to know one thing about me, guys, okay? I've got a knot in my hair. That's not the thing you need to know about me. All right, there we go. Um, the thing you need to know is, hey, I do a bunch of stuff in the game where you might consider it stalling. But when we get down and dirty with the MSQ, okay, there is one thing we do. We pump. I am built to pump. When I pump, I goddamn pump. And the MSQ gets done. Owl Lala surely wouldn't have a sus plate, right? Oh, God. That's Lala energy. Not in hair. Yeah, it's it's sorted now, though, okay? If you finish uh, this patch before I decide to buy this guitar, I'm looking at. <laughs> okay. We've both got a big day ahead of us at Decadence because I know exactly the feeling <laughs> when you're like, oh, is it really worth it though? I don't know. Yeah, you're going to be sat there all day, okay? Yo, uh, go not gently. Welcome into the chat, by the way. And I'm finding the game very enjoyable so far, okay? I'm very much enjoying it. Today we're doing some MSQ pompage. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a good time. It's going to be a good time. But yeah, I really enjoy it. I quit WoW, started playing FF. Love it so far. Not going back to Rito anytime soon. Um, may check out the new expansion, but I actually don't really know. I don't know at this point, even if I'll do that. Maybe if Blizzard give it to me for free. If, if they want me to play their game, they have to give it to me for free. There you go. I said it. Yeah. What's up, Mido? Yeah, FF FF16 event is on, guys. Um, however, people were saying that it's slight spoilers, so just be warned if, uh, if, if you're going to go do it, okay? True and real. I missed part of the MSQ prog. Uh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. I haven't started yet. Okay. I'm about to start. This is the first quest of the patch. Okay. What's up, Irish? Hello, hello. Um, That's good. Keep at my own pace. Yeah, hell yeah. I got to go for a bit. I'll be back before you finish the patch, hopefully. Hattie, thank you for being here. Thank you for swinging by the guild as well. Good luck with the, your endeavors, whatever you got to go do. Errands, work, family, friends, whatever you got to do today. All right. Enjoy it, and I'll see you when I see you, okay? Maybe you'll be back in time. Okay, the man within, and I see a picture of Alfie. House for Tom's Knight has a message for you. You know what? Alfie, he is certainly becoming, he fucks up a lot of shit. I don't know. Alfie is really good at getting himself in a mess, but at least he's trying, right, guys? He's at least trying. I wish I had a time machine to unlearn everything I know. Yeah. I think a lot of people would enjoy like a second. I think you could still enjoy a second playthrough, even if you know what's coming kind of thing. But I guess that's why a lot of people like to uh, watch streams, right? And MSQ Vampire it and stuff. 
All right, the house for Tom's night. <clears throat> ah, mistress just stolen. It is well that you are here. You are wanted within. I believe Master Alphano wishes a word with you. The man within. All right, we're going in then, guys. I will see you when I get out. Welcome, Miss Mistress Just Stolen. How may I? Shall I show you inside the manor? Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Do do do. Let me put the BGM up a little bit. Ooh, Tataru's here too. What's she got to say? The Scions will find a way. I just know we will. So, okay. Spoiler alert, by the way. I don't know if uh, any Sprouts are in here that aren't up to this point. I'm going to be doing Heaven's Sword MSQ, okay? So uh, mute the stream or whatever if you don't want spoilers. You got five seconds before I'm going to give a rundown of what happened last time in 3.2. All right, so last patch, which we did last week, um, we did a lot of stuff. So we found Minfilia. And then uh, <laughs> and then we had a conversation with Minfilia. And then she exploded. Yeah, so apparently Minfilia dead. I've, I've, I wasn't really that sad, I'm not going to lie. However, I it's because... I don't actually believe she's dead, okay? I don't think that she's just going to explode in a dream and be dead, okay? I think that that was like a charade. So I think she's still alive. She's coming back. She may be dead, though. I don't know. And then what else happened? Uh, Kryle's awesome. What else happened? Uh, the went the 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 woman from the the bar. She uh she poisoned me, and then they had a rebellion. And then, uh, oh, we had character growth from Emma uh, Emana Lane. And then we also, that was pretty good. Although he's still a bit of a cock end. Uh, and then what happened? Yeah, he ordered shoot to kill or whatever. Although I, I still don't think he like, he really meant for someone to die. And she didn't die anyway, right? And they kind of kissed and made up at the end. And then Estinian came down. <laughs> I fucking speared um, uh, Vodofnir in the back. And that was pretty rough. And then all we know is the ending was death to Nidhogg. Death to Nidhogg. Death to Nidhogg. So, I think today, here's my prediction. I think we're going to go and find Ida and Papalimo because we keep getting small flashbacks or like we keep getting small glimpses of them in cutscenes. I think we're going to find them too today. My, my gal Ida, she will be back with me, okay? So I think, obviously, by the way, um, no spoiling or uh, wait. Let me let me do this. Let uh, uh, wait. No spoilers. Uh, if Russ asks stuff, just shrug. Um, let him cook. Um, also, please no. Or shadowing or alluding to things. All right. Let's pin that. <clears throat> All right, perfect. So yeah, if I if I say like, oh, is this thing happening? I'm just talking to myself. Don't actually confirm or deny anything, okay? Um, there's a pin there. Awesome. Um, yeah, we need a nice little stove to cook. Yo, Fenrir, how are we doing today? Hello. So yeah, blah to Nidhogg. And so I think we're going to find Ida. We're going to find Papalumo. And then we are going to go uh, chase down Astinian. And I don't know. Uh, deal with him. Or maybe that's next patch. But I feel like maybe today, you know. I will spoil. Don't you spoil, Nathaniel. Yeah, just shrewd at everything if I'm asking stuff. All right. Let's begin. <clears throat> Ah, Russ, there you are. Have you a moment? There is something I would fain discuss. I must ask that you recall the events which unfolded at the peace conference, though I dare say you would sooner forget them. My mind returns again and again to the moment when Nidhogg appeared before the crowd in the guise of Astinian. It was a sight to chill the soul, but one which gave me reason to hope that our friend might not be beyond salvation. When you described his fateful transformation as Islam, I feared him lost forever. But the mere fact that some semblance of his former self endures must surely count for something. 
Alas, I have no evidence to support this impression. <laughs> Thus did I turn to Yashtola and Kryl for a most empirical appraisal, and full glad I am that I did. For I, it would seem that there have been some observations of their... Oh, they, would ha they have some observations of their own to share. The ladies have saved us a table at the Forgotten Night. Shall we go straight back to the pub? Straight back to the pub, Tataru. Let's fucking do this. Come on then. Excellent. Let us not keep our honored colleagues waiting. She knows it. Tataru, she lives there, dude. She actually lives there. Yeah, straight up alcohol problem. She's got an eavesdropping and an alcohol problem. But you know what? We wouldn't change her, guys. We just wouldn't change her, right? Right, to the Forgotten Night. Let's go. Tadaru's helping before we go down the pub. Yeah. She knows the way. <laughs> down there. Boom. Just like me for real. For She just like me for real. <laughs> Maldrea. Ooh, that's a cool bow. Oh, it's a... Uh, uh, Shiva bow, I think. That's nice. All right. Down we go. <gasps> Oof. Kryle! Best girl. Best girl right here. Voicing? Nah, there's no way this is voice acted. We have kept you waiting over long, I fear. All right! Let's go! Already! Not to worry, Alphano. We had some rather fine mulled wine to keep us company. Truth be told, you could have delayed your arrival a few moments more. Oh, it's just a trend with the Lalas. Gibrion got the spicing just right this time. His latest batch is not only delicious and warming, but soothing to the humors. Sorry, it's kind of cute, guys. <laughs> Indeed. He didn't get a voice. That was not to soothe our humours that we gathered here. Oh, no. Quite right. The matter of that poor dragoon. Oh, the Azure dragoon. You have discovered something. A means to save him? Let us not jump to conclusions, shall we? Appease. Assess the facts presented, then make an educated analysis, as you were taught. Oof. Sit down, Alfie. Pray, cast your mind back to the moment of Astinian's transformation. Do you recall how you described it to us? You spoke of the sudden pangs which racked his body when he took up both of Nidhogg's eyes, and of how his form was twisted thereafter into a shadowy semblance of the Great Worm. Hmm. When he appeared at Falcon's Nest, the worm's eyes were fused to his mail. Yeah, he had one in his shoulder and one in his hand, right? Like on his wrist. But only his armor had been corrupted. Snaking forth from the eyes, I described dark tendrils which entangled his very being. His ether has been all but smothered. Be Two months, yay. So Rafi, thank you very much. Sorry, guys, I just had to pause it for a sec. Apologies. Um, Rafi, appreciate the two months. Thank you. All right, let's continue. Sorry about that. Yay! Then he is lost to us forever? This is not so yay, though. What did I just say about jumping to conclusions? Yishtola clearly stated all but smothered. All but smothered? As I later discovered, her impression matched my own. Though Nidhogg's presence filled my mind's eye, beneath his seething aura, I sensed the merest hint That's of good. something else. Asinian's still in there, guys. And after listening to Yishtola's observations, I became more certain of my suspicion that the something else I had sensed was, in fact, the trace of a different will, submerged in the sea of Nidhogg's rage. He's just being suppressed. You mean... Astinian? Yes, tis like that Astinian spirit yet lingers. Okay. Can we not wrest him from Nidhogg's grasp, then? Tear the eyes from the armor. Ooh, he's fused though. Not it's not that, that simple. Would serve to separate worm's soul from man's. None have ever attempted such a feat. Oh man. Should it offer even the faintest hope of success, then by the gods, I shall be the first to try. I gotta give it to Alfie. Astinian was only a dick to him. <laughs> the entire of Heaven Sword. <laughs> and Alfie's like 
Estinia's biggest fan right now. I don't know if he's like he likes get, he likes being pushed. Like he, he likes uh Estinia like challenging him because it, it makes him grow. But I respect that he like doesn't he doesn't resent Estinian at all after like Estinian's just been like a, a cock to him, you know? But maybe Estinian's just an edgy boy, you know? But yeah, I don't think it's gonna be as easy as just ripping the armor off. By all means, hold fast to your hope, but be mindful of the dangers. Even should you succeed in excising the eyes from the dragoon's mail, we have no way of knowing if your friend's soul would survive so violent a separation. Yeah, that's that so... is to say nothing of the possibility that his would-be savior might become Nidhogg's next host. Oh, I didn't even think about that. But what other choice remains to us? Should the opportunity present itself, I will tear those foul orbs from Estinian's armor and trust in the resilience of his soul, even at the risk of mine own. <laughs> all right, come on, Alfie. Chill your beans. Oh, they all nodded. Uh, I found you at last. He's like, I want to be Nidhogg. <laughs> I want the orbs. All right, this guy's a Chad. A messenger of the on a Roy. came to the on a some few hours past. The Lord Commander humbly requests the company of the Warrior of Light and Master Alphano. All right. I'll go see Amory. Hell yeah. Speak with us. Very well. Thank you, Onawa. Onawa. That, that little kid is such a legend. To it seem duty calls. Pray see to yours, and we shall return to ours. We're surely going to need Papa sure. Limo and Ida. Your words have given me hope where there was none. To take on uh, Astinian. Come then. Sir Emmerich awaits. Let's, let's go see Daddy. We have two daddies in this game. Sid and Emmerich. Alphano is allowing his feelings for this dragoon to cloud his thoughts. I worry he may do something rash. Keep an eye on him, would you? I'll try. That kid... I'm just his retainer. I, I can't do anything. <laughs> oh? <gasps> Shit. They think more of their friend's deliverance than their foe's defeat. Eh, eh, eh. I thought he grew up. Eh, eh, eh. Pepe gonna arrive. <laughs> I thought he grew up. He the does what he wants. Held at Falcon's Nest was to be a celebration of the reconciliation twixt man and dragon. Shit, didn't really go but down that way. Shade of Nidhogg. Clad in the flesh of the Azure Dragoon, did mark the occasion by spilling the blood of his own kind. That was pretty fucking nuts what A Nidhogg did, did actually. To remind the children of Ishgard that the Dragon Song War was far from over. Yo, Nerve. And when fear gave way to fury, the call to arms rang out anew. Death to Nidhogg. Death to Nidhogg. We're gonna go fuck him up. Let's go fuck him up. All right. Emmerich. Firm Albert. Good day to you. Good day to you. Alpha Tank TV. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Death to Nidhogg. Oh, shit. It's time, Keecher. We're going in. What news has Sir Emmerich to share with us, I wonder? Torrent Attire of Aiming. Uh, I'm going to take the casting one. Oh, yeah, I can take... Hold on. <laughs> mm. uh, we're good. Ooh, for Vidofne, yeah. Dude, I can't. I, I'm glad Vidofne survived, by the way. I thought he just straight up got rolled. 
Alphano is eager to hear what tidings Sir Emmerich has to share. Oh, and we get to choose a... Uh... I'm going to take the steak. Peepo bless. Thank you. Thank you. Hmm. Might Sir Emmerich perchance have received word of a Dravanian advance? Or mayhap they have located a stick. That's not to say. Maybe... Mayhap Nidhogg has been found. Yeah, it's not actually Nostinian. It's like he's just possessed. Like he's the host, right? Come, I would hear what the Lord Commander has to say. Let's do it. It's surely, this is surely also voiced. It's an Emmerich cutscene. It has to be voiced. Oh, here we go. Here we go. My friends, I thank you for coming. You're welcome. You have had news of Nidhogg? Alas, not. Our scouts range far and wide. Yep. But they have as yet found no trace of the Great Worm. I mean, he's kind of stealthy. We dispatched an elite unit of dragoons to reconnoiter the churning mists. But even they returned empty-handed. A pity. Fear not, Alphano. We shall see the Worm again soon enough. His words at Falcon's Nest attest to that. Yeah, I mean, he's going to kill all dragons Indeed, and try to reconcile. Indeed, he like to come sooner than we would wish. <laughs> I assume Ishgard's defenses are being bolstered as we speak. With all haste, I mean to call upon every able-bodied warrior at our disposal, from the Knights of the Four Houses to the men and women of the Watch. Hi, I I summon you to discuss strategy. Okay. What then would you have of us? The lighting do? there. I will speak plain. Now that Nidhogg is possessed of both of his eyes, no mortal force we can muster will repel him. That being the case, we must needs recruit an ally of equal strength. Enter stage left. Russ just stalling. Warrior of light. <gasps> Maybe I'm going to team up with the Warrior of Darkness. Because we keep getting a little, like, it just zooms in on him lurking in the background. Oh, we're going to team up. We're going to team up for sure, for sure. Yeah. Shrooge. Oh. You speak of grace, Velga. Oh. Okay, never mind. I was wrong. <laughs> we're going to team up with Hrace Velga. To whom else could we turn? Oh, yeah. He's got both his eyes as well, actually. That is Nidhogg's equal, I do not deny. Nor can I name another. But convincing the reclusive creature to do battle with his own brood brother will be... How shall I put this? It will be no small undertaking, yes. Estinian's report was most particular about Horace Velga's unwillingness to involve himself in the affairs of men. That's true. But we've since but made friends. Has changed since your visit to Somal. Yeah. And if there is even a chance that the dragon may be swayed, I must plead our case. I like Chris Volga. The dragon asks of me, I shall pay it. Such was my oath to defend the people of Ishgard. God, we love Amrick. Such a Come what may, my bloody friends, legend. The battle with Nidhogg will mark the end of my tenure as the acting head of church and state. Will you help me discharge this fight? Battle duty? with Nidhogg. Dude. We will, my lord. I have a Though really fear our involvement offers no guarantee of success. Come then. We will depart at your leisure. I have a Thank really you. bad feeling that Amrick's gonna die. The city is yours, first commander. My lord. We shall pray for your swift return. I really hope he doesn't. Like, it's just when he said that will be my last acting, like, that will be my last duty as acting thingy. I feel like that's, oh no, please. Please don't be fore foreshadowing. Oh, I love... Emmerich's so good, man. All right, you know what? Nothing's happened yet. Nothing's happened yet. All right, let's go speak to Sir Emmerich. King Frost the God. 
Thank you for the follow. Raven Roseblade. Thank you for the follow. Hi. As well. Shroosh. Oh, man. All right. Uh, it gives me... It, it grieves me to impose upon you in this manner. But you of all people understand the threat that we now face. It is no impo imposition, Sir Emmerich. To Russ and I, Ishgard is a second home. After the many battles we have fought and the bonds we have forged, the plight of your nation has become our own. If there is aught that we can do to aid in its salvation, then pray impose all you must. Oh, I need to get my uh, MSQ glam on. You are true friends. No! Dude, I hate being friends with people. You should never be friends with a warrior of light, man. Shall we be about our task then? We have no way of knowing when Nidhogg's shade will strike, but we must assume that time is not our ally. Stupid friends! <laughs> Indeed. With that in mind, I have taken the liberty of dispatching a messenger to inform Mistress Tataru that you will be escorting me to some Arl. I confess, I did not provide the exact details of our destination, as they are as yet known, unknown to me. We will summon Hrace Valgar at Zenith in the churning mists. Ere we begin our ascent, however, I think it's best we pray, pay a visit to Annex Shrine. Dude, I love the churning mists. You seek an advantage in the coming negotiations? I do. I would consult with Vidofnir. Yeah, if we get Vidofnir on our side and be like, look. If he goes, look. Look what your brother did to me. Alright? He literally stabbed me in the back. Physically. Like. You know. As a sign. A literal stabbing in the back. Okay? Surely that will sway Horace Volga. I propose this in part of our concern for her condition. Were she to succumb to her wounds, it could have grave consequences for our alliance. That apart, she may be able to convince insight into her sire's current state of mind. Well reasoned. To the Dravanian forelands then. Alright, let's do it. Let me get my glam on as well before we leave. Full thrust into the rear. No, into the back. I guess that is the rear. Yeah. No gods, no masters, no friends, no lovers. Stall cell. <laughs> oh, I need a repair. Where can I repair? Can you repair, Bernadette? Okay, I'm putting on my Dragon Slayer gear. I almost want to dye it red, actually. Hold on a sec. I can't even dye this. Oh, never mind. I can't dye this. Time for a peek. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think she's AFK. Can anyone repair me? Or is there a vendor here somewhere where I can do that? Uh, I just ate a fucking butt plug. Wait, what? Bro, I never said that. I have never said that. That has to be a quote that got changed somewhere along the way. Rust play, how low can you go with gear? <laughs> I really do. I really do. It's because we've been progging, right? Oh, pog. Guys, our personal armor smith has arrived. <laughs> Let's go. Thank you, Barry. <clears throat> Here's your booty. That works. Wait, did I just give you something really good? Ah, shit. <laughs> Wait, how'd you do that bow? That's different to mine. What bow was that? Quote behind. Okay, okay. What's up, Fido? Okay. All right. Thank you for the repair. Guys, we're back in business. Okay. 
We're going to Annex Throne. Goodbye. Whee! Basement Slav. <laughs> okay. Do you know what, guys? There's actually a secret technique. You can just fly up through the ceiling. Boom. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Today we learned. All right, Vidofnir. Chilling. He's learning. Fellow Aura. Hell, yeah, King Frost. What? Yep. Uh, I got a voice this cutscene, guys. <clears throat> I just need my dragon speak. Ah, tis the warriors of warriors and her companions. What bringeth you to mine abode? Pray forgive us for disturbing your recuperation, Vidofne. I hope your wound does not pain you overmuch. Didst thou imagine me close to death? The thrust was deep, but not mortal. I will heal in time. Full glad am I to hear it. You were the guest of honor at our conference, and we failed in our duty for, of protection. On behalf of Ishgard, I apologize unreservedly. I am a dragon, full grown, and thou thought to protect me, mortal? I was tempered by the fires of battle, ere thy great-grandsire learned to crawl. Thy words do remind me of a knight whom I called friend some thousand years past. He swore to defend me from harm of and hardship. Ooh, okay. Would that we could return to that era of peace, when man and dragon knew such comradeship. Would that our effort do, to do so were un, uh, not undone by ancient rancor. For a truth, there can be no peace while Nidhogg's shade yet lingereth. That much is plain, yet we lack the strength to banish him. Thus do we make for some Al to beseech the aid of your sire once more. Folly, thou knowst as well as I how he will answer. Prince Velga's heart remains unchanged then, a pity. But if it is folly to hope, I am content to die a fool. Oh, what a line. What a line that is. If it is a folly to hope, I am content to die a fool. That is a good line right there. As hath ever been the way with thy kind. Go then, but be warned. The shade's present hath driven its minions to frenzy. Thank you, Vodofnir. We shall disturb your rest no longer. Oh, we should we should get Vodofnir to come with. Chadmerick, yeah. We got Chadmerick, Chad Cred. Honestly, I am becoming a big fan of Thancred recently as well. In the last patch. 3.2 was good for Thank... They were, those were good days for Thancred. He's injured. Yeah. But it's not too far of a flight. But I suppose... Uh, she she didn't want to try and beg... Uh, Grace Velga to help us. Oh shit. Oh. Oh look. There's an EP baby dragon. Oh, that's hella cute. La la plus dragon. Do 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 do. All right, winning over the worm. Alphano seems eager to press on. All right, though I expected no better answer from Vodofnir, I take little pleasure from having been proven right. It would seem that our presence at Zenith will be every bit as unwelcome as I had anticipated. But what is the ire of one great worm to a trio of self-confessed fools such as ourselves? Let us begin our ascent. After you, Master Alphano. All right, let's go. Scout ahead if you wish, Russ. We shall join you outside Mogholm. 
Mark home! To Mark home. In all seriousness, um, I think we'll be next in line. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I think Alpha Node is like actually the main character. I don't think I'm the main character. I think Alpha is. <laughs> I'm just his retainer. Oh, here we go. The Zenith. I had heard tales of the world above the clouds, but never did I dream. One's mind paints a pale picture of its majesty. Few live to see such wonders. I am reminded of my first visit to this peak, when Estinian and Yasail yet walked to our side. Oh shit. That is actually true. We had Estinian and Yasail then. Oh, guys. Ah, if it isn't, uh, Mog, uh, Mog, uh, don't tell- Don't tell me you've forgotten my name, Koopa, after all we've been through together. <laughs> uh. But at least you remember me. Y y you do remember me, don't you, Russ? Do you remember the Moogle? <laughs> How could I forget you, Moglin? Of course I do, Moghan. <laughs> Apologies, friend. But all Moogles look the same to me. <laughs> Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Oh my god. Moogle racism. <laughs> what the fuck? I really want to see what, how they respond to it, though. I feel like it's so bad to say. Go for it, I dare you. <laughs> nah, this is Moglin, guys. All right, this is Moglin. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I really wish I pressed the other one. I am Mokan, the courageous Moogle who guided you to Zenith, Koopo. Shit. <laughs> He's the big one. He's that big motherfucker in the chair. Yeah. Fuck. Shit. <laughs> Mokan. <laughs> Turn around. Do it again. <sighs> you also picked Moglin? God damn it. I wonder what the response would have been to the racist one. Jeez. What's up, Katamaya? Welcome in. Dragon, thank you for the gift sub to um to Moghan, by the way. <laughs> Shit. But putting our shared history to one side, what brings you and your friends to Moghan, Koopo? Essaying? Ah, another audience with the old race Velga. Well, I hope you've brought the horn, Koopa. With the winds as gentle as they are, a good coot should reach the Great Worm's ears easily enough. Well, that's good to hear, Morgan. Thank you. And we had best proceed on to Zenith while the winds are in our favor. Can we bring Morgan? Moglin? Wait, which one was it? Is this Moglin or Morgan? I've actually forgotten already. <laughs> I think it was Morgan. Yeah, it is. Okay, okay. Now that was unexpected, Koopa. Chieftain Moglin will want to hear about this. All right, it's nice we're getting the the the, the Moogles involved. Oh, just a Moogle. <laughs> Mogsy! Continue down this 
this road and you'll get to a star. My friend Lugmont's guarding the entrance there. It takes a courageous pump to stand guard with all the Skylords about, Pupo. Alright. I guess we're going up to, uh... Up to Zenith, guys, okay? Let's do it. We're going to toot the horn for Hurry's Volga. Three was clearly the option. I kind of wish I picked number three now. And there's no way I can go back, is there? God damn it. Is that, can anyone tell me the dialogue line I would have got? You'll never get any post again. Oh, shit. Oh, any mail? <laughs> oh, yeah, if I chose option three. But I was safe, guys. The Moogles still enjoy me. Okay. Oh, this song is sad. <sighs> God damn it. You know what? They always put these, like, they always put these... Nice pieces of music which sound kind of sad before you understand why they're sad. Before I was just like, oh yeah, nice. This is this song kind of slaps. And now I'm like, shit. It's because we're here and we've lost Estinian and your sail. Since we were here last time. Fuck, man. Fuck. Oh, I see, Koopo. Then I suppose our time around the campfire meant less to you than I thought I did. It's Moghan, by the way. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Rush, you've really changed. At first, you loved the Moogles, every last one. And now you're castigating them in the streets, pushing them in the mud. Sad, man. Sad. Tub Scrubber, thank you for the follow. Best song in the game? Yeah, this one kind of slaps. Alright, let's have a little look. Doo -doo -doo. Quick, toot at the horn. I might. Oh, I'm literally playing that song. Sue Green Kook. Come on then, Harris Valga. Let's go, big boy. Oh, he is a cool looking worm, to be fair. He looks like a kind of like a dog. Like a dog lion head thing. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, I need to uh, do his voice. <clears throat> I need to translate real quick. You dare summon me again, mortals. Great race, Velga. It is not lightly that we beg this audience. Pray hearken to our words, for they concern the future of man and dragon both. Greetings, Bres Velga. I am Emmerich de Burel, acting ruler of the nation of Ishgard. I am come before you to parley on behalf of my people. To parley. Thinkest thou thy purpose unclear to me? Thou art come to beg mine aid in the battle against the shade of my brood brother. You foresaw mine intent. Ah, shit. But I read that which was written plain in thine eyes. 
Would that thou had wit enough to scry the answer in mine. My beloved Shiva did once build a bridge twixt man and dragon, a bridge which thy treacherous forefathers saw fit to tear down, as thou well knowest. I'm so sad! I've never seen my character so sad. Oh. Thinkest thou Nidhogg was alone in despairing at the murder of our brood sister? Thinkest thou mine own soul did not cry out for vengeance? Know that then a that know then that upon that accursed day my heart did wither in my breast and thy kind become unto me the harbingers of despair that is not a good title to have It is only Shiva's gentle dream that preventeth me from flying at Nidhogg's shoulder. Be grateful that I swore to abjure aggression ere I consumed her. I permit thy, my children to offer or deny thee aid as they see fit. To warn thy people of my brood brother's coming, that thou wouldst dare ask more of me, but affirmeth thine incurable arrogance. We are getting fucking roasted. Pardon me. We are getting absolutely roasted right now. <laughs> Holy shit. Like, it wasn't me, okay? It wasn't us, right? It was our fucking ancestors and shit. We understand that in your despair at man's betrayal, you seek only the refuge of solitude. But despite your he looks cool as hell. Faith, do you not still nurture the smallest flame of hope? Perceivest thou such light in the dusk of mine existence? I do. If you claim I see falsely, then tell me. Why did you consent to bear Rizel upon your back? Good point. He brought her up to Annex. Um... What's that place up in the sky? Uh, fuck, not Annex Trine. That's the that's where Vidofna is. Uh, Azisla. Yeah. Yeah, he brought her up to Azissa when she did the sacrifice, right? Hmm. Good question, Alfie. You sail. Piteous, deluded, you sail. The child did lament her past sins and sought to balance the scales with her remaining days. It was her unquenchable passion, so alike to that of my beloved, which did spur me into flight. Oh shit, that's kind of cute. This is blur. <laughs> And for mine own part, I would countenance no longer the hands of evil men to use my brood brother's eye for ill. Ah. So you do distinguish between those who acknowledge and repent their sins and those who perpetuate them. Interesting. Yeah. He said evil men as opposed to non-evil men, I suppose. It seems to me that you have not, in fact, lost faith in mankind as a whole. Rather, you weigh our respective merits by how we allow the past to influence our future. Ah, a little bit of gaslighting, Grace Valga. 
Hell yeah, let's go. <laughs> All right, we'll take that. Spare me thine idle sophistry, even were there a mote of truth in my reasoning. What of it? Wouldst thou have me slay mine own sibling to save a city of mortals? Should we suffer ties of blood to bind our hands then? Nay, if the crime is one of unconscionable evil, we must needs condemn it, even should the transgressor be our closest kin. True. He literally killed his dad. When my father corrupted himself and his followers with the power of a primal, I, I literally killed his dad. I light to slay him, an act alike to patricide. Yeah, sorry, I killed his dad. <laughs> he did not die by my hand matters little. If anything, it heaps greater disgrace upon my name. But had my father not fallen, he would have drawn countless thousands into a holy war of hellish proportions, which I hold the greater crime. Thus did I order his execution, sparing the lives of my people and yours. It's pretty nuts, actually. It's exactly the same. Alas, your brother Worm now prepares to murder those whom I sought to spare. What is more, he has taken my comrade's body for his own. But if I must slay my dearest friend to defeat my direst foe, I will not flinch from my duty. We love Amerik. Thou wouldst strike down thy friend, and by example of thy righteousness, persuade me to break mine oath and kill my kindred. Here he bloody is. <laughs> oh, he's going to grow up. Oh, shit. Here we go. I've got to get a deeper voice for this one. Tell me if this is fitting, okay? Heed me, my child. The servants of Heidelin envision a different outcome. They intend salvation, not only for Ishtar, but for the doomed dragon slayer as well. Thou the shade to be Nidhogg returned? It is not merely a manifestation of his vengeance, the shadow cast by thy brood brother's rage. I would not command thee, but ponder well thy course, lest it lead thee unto greater remorse. <sighs> what will I say? While the shade of vengeance remains, the future will ever be uncertain. Help us save our companion. I think the top one. Dot, dot, dot. <laughs> I hate the dot, dot, dot. Why is that a thing? <laughs> Aren't you Moglin? <laughs> I need to get back to Harris Velga. This is going to be hard with the voice changer. Nidhogg's transformation into rage incarnate is in part of mine own doing. I rendered unto him mine eye and empowered his revenge thereby. But tis the purity of my brood brother's wrath that leadeth him his all surpassing might.
Hast thou the strength of will to stand against so terrible a shadow, I wonder? Twould seem I must put thee and thy companions to the proof. Ratatoska. I shall await thee in the ruins wherein Ratatoska once dwelt. Heed well the words of my children, and hasten thee to the place of thy trial. We're speechless. Good old Midi. Off he goes. Oh, he'll help us for sure, for sure. What's up, Tegan? King Trude, thank you for the follow, by the way. Off he goes. Oh! We're being spied on! Hmm. God damn it, Moghan! Off Moghan goes! That's Moghan, guys, okay? I know now. That's Moghan. No, it's not Moglin. Moglin's the guy in the throne, the big one. That's Moghan. Okay? Wait. Maybe I'm wrong again. No, no, that's Morghan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moogles never forgive and never forget. <sighs> Lil Midi with the big voice. Yeah, that was a good... Uh, was it on point? Was my Midi, was my midi voice was there? He, he had a very deep voice, so... I just need to remember it's minus four, minus four on my voice changer. I'm a Moogle enjoyer. I've always been a Moogle enjoyer, actually. It was good? Hell yeah. What's up, by the way, yo yo -Zu. Haven't seen you in ages, man. How's it going? I hope life is good. I believe I spied a wyvern landing just outside the palace. It is doubtless one of the children of whom Freyce Felga spoke. Come, my friends. Let us not keep our escort waiting. Hmm. Look, I didn't say the last option on that. Whoa! Jesus Christ! God, that was loud. Fucking Ifrit music. Hey, cuties. All right, who's this? Imperious Wyvern. Well, this guy looks a bit... A bit crazy. <clears throat> Any waiters? Any cuties? Yeah. Uh. Oh, that's pretty cool. Jesus. All right. Let's see what he has to say. My broodmates and I will bear you to the palace of your trial. Make your preparations. Saw Kull now accessible. Oh, is this a Dungon? A Dungon. Oh, shit. All right. Now I see why the cuties are lined up, huh? It's a Dungon. He has some teeth. Yeah, you do. You do have some teeth. Let's go. Saw Carl. Okay. All right. Let's see here. Um, who have I not played with in a while? I like that glam vulps. What is this? Gunbreaker. Damn. Damn. But you know what? I haven't played with Lydia in ages. I don't think I've played with Tong in a while. And uh, I'll get Mutant. Because you guys were lined up front and center. Okay. Someone has to tank and heal though. It ain't, it ain't me. I don't have anything leveled enough. Yo, Jimmy McGee. What's up? All right. We need a tank. All right. Hold. We have two. Oh. We have none. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have two and now we don't have a healer. <laughs> Why is it perfect timing each time? All right, there we go. <laughs> there we go, guys. We got it. We got it down. All right, we're going to go uh, Dragoon, Samurai, 
Astro and Warrior. That seems like a good little parte going on, okay? So. What was it? Som Al? No. Saw Carl. Saw Carl. Of course. I mean, I level no echo, so we can see the bosses and stuff. <clears throat> Majestic and forgotten. Its existence unrecorded in the a in the annals of man. <clears throat> the palace rests atop the clouds in the farthest reaches of the churning mists. This skyborn this skyborn splendor was once home to Ratatoska, brood sister to Hrisvelga and Nidhogg. Until the treachery of mortals ensured that its stones would never again ring under the she worm's talons. The dragons named it Saw Kai. Oh, Kai, sorry. A grieving apology for their f failure to avert her fate. Oh, is that like sorry? Damn. And then they watched with infinite sadness as Ratatoska's empty roost was overrun by bird and beast. Fuck. All right. This is the place Horis Valga has chosen for your trial. Prove yourself in the faded shadow of one sibling and convince the Great Worm to aid you against the wrathful shade of another. Shit. Okay, this is kind of hype. This is kind of hype. He did it. Yeah, I almost... I almost slipped up, but we got it done. Okay, let's go. Just don't open my plate. Okay. It's our trial, guys. Where's the fourth person? <laughs> oh, it's me, Aimeric, and Alfie. Okay. Wait, if I did it with the duty thingy, with the NPCs, who would be the fourth then? Me. Some guy. Oh, it'd be the fucking dragoon from the vault, dude. <laughs> what was his name? Oh, shit. This, this is kind of a jammer. Yo, Malik, what's up? Let's turn that background music up, baby. Okay. Let's do it. John Heavensward? Yeah. Do, 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 do. There you go. There you go, guys. All right. Big damn, big damn, big damn, big damn. Cloud Gardener. Doo -doo -doo. Look at that little fan thing. Oh, that's an enemy. Enchanted fan. Okay. Love Dragoon AoE guys. Woohoo! Spamming one button. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Back in time for Sorkai. Yeah, baby. Doom Spike. Best AoE in the game. Trained. <laughs> Oh shit, Garden Melia. Okay. Oh, here we go. This is a big pull. Bigger one, bigger one. We take those. And the Enchanted Fan. Oh shit. My bad. A little bit of cleave. A little bit of cleave going now. There we go. 
Oh, oh, it makes a jump pad. Oh, shit. Whee! That's kind of cool. All right, maybe we use that later. Okay, we got demon cubes. They're not really stacked, so I'm just going to 1v1 them. 1v1 this bad boy. You get 20 seconds of haste. Oh, okay. That's pretty nice. Big damn then. Oh shit. That's Moglin. That's Moglin. Wait. Ch it is! Chieftain Moglin. Unsevered despair. Okay, it's actually him. Oh yes, let's go! Kill him! Captain Mogson! Kill him! Oh, he's so dead. Mercy, Koopo! This is Halloween. This is ha <laughs> You dare to confuse me with Wait. Oh my god, does he actually have the same mechanics? As the good king? Kill Pom Chopper. He's rezzing them. Hey, what's this? Oh fuck, it's shooting out shit. Okay, kill the black mage. I think it might be the same mechanics. Oh, he's so dead. Oh, Moogles. <laughs> no. <laughs> Who say that? Oh, he's so dead, man. He's so dead. Moglin, why would you oppose us? He's not actually dead, though, right? Kupopo, that's enough. You've made your point. This isn't a fight to the death, Kupo. All right. Okay, good. Okay, okay, okay. Thank God. He's good. He's, ch he's good. I didn't kill him. He said it isn't a fight to the death. Wait. No, no, no. I didn't kill him. I. Use my mate. All right, up we go. Do, do, do. He never asked for this, Koopo. <laughs> Moggle cock this. <laughs> right in the bum, Koopo. Whoa. <laughs> oh, wait, I need to eat my egg. All right, there we go. It's just a flesh wound, Q-Po. It's just a flesh wound. I wanna said that <laughs> right in the bum. <laughs> Dude, Moogles are the best. Moogles are the best. Anzu egg. Oh shit, okay. They're gonna hatch soon. Uh oh. Wait, can I stun it? No. Oh god. Alright, focus one down. We got one, we got one, we got one. Oh. I'll be back, Koopo. I hope so. I want to see Moglin again. Can I hit all three? I think I did, right? Yeah, baby. Do, 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 do. Okay, nice. 
All right, this is the actual, uh, this is the boss from, uh, thingy, Aros. Oh, I'm tanking it. Ah! Let's kill the eggs. Oh, wait, isn't that going to make it get really pissed? I think we killed the big guy. You got pissed off? Oh, maybe, uh, we're just getting low. Oh, I'm cleaving. I'm cleaving them all. I'm cleaving them all. Easy clap. You should see the live version of the Good King Moogle Mox song. There it's we go. Hilarious. I bet it is. I, I do kind of need to check that out. All right, remind me when I'm not in the middle of something. And I will check the Good King Moogle Mox song. <laughs> live version. Biggest damage. Breathwind, that's a front over shore. And there's treasure. I see treasure. I take treasure. Berserker's bangles. I don't need those. Although they look kind of cool, actually. Yo, tab target. All right, there we go. Big crits, big crits. React content? Yeah, sludge happy, baby. I haven't done some react in a, in a couple weeks now, actually. Need to bring it back. <sighs> Love a good react. All right, nice. Good job, good job. There's more treasure. A yoink. A yoink, 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 yoink. Oh, here we go. Earrings. Tanking? No, that's not tank. Whee! Oh, shit. Boss time. I think that's the boss. Looks cool. Looks cool. I am, I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Sounds like a boss. Do, do, do. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna I'm gonna change it up here. I'm just gonna use the LB one. Yep. Yeah. It's I'm just gonna get oh. That went off though. That went off. Okay, um Yeah, okay, that was touchdown. Oh, uh Okay. Do I wanna go in the middle? Getting pushed? Am I getting pushed? No! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, never mind. I, I got it I got the uh telegraph a little bit wrong there. Stand in the lance charge. It's fine, it's just one invuln, okay? One vulnerability. We're chilling. Okay, that's a that's a move away. Oh, it's gonna be an ad spawning. Nope. Oh, sh okay. Goes off afterwards. All right, we get down here. All right, I'm learning, guys. Fall off damage. Easy dodge. Easy dodge. Wait. Ow, this dot hurts. Ah! Oh, no. <laughs> okay. All right. Stand at the edge, but not quite in the water. You died. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I thought we were gaming. Turned out we were not gaming. Do the fucking mechanic. GG on the whole team for throwing. Yeah. I saw they were just looking at me and seeing what I did. <laughs> but wait, we could have survived with some healing, right? Or no? I think maybe. All right, I'm going to stand right at the edge. Maybe we do. Maybe we do just take it, but then big heals. No. 
But we stand right on the edge, like one millimeter from the pond. I don't know. I play WoW. <laughs> Vanat FFXIV, huh? Biggest WoW player there is. Just 10 KLB. I used it. I accidentally used it. Okay. Uh, you know what? It's fine because this was very Svelga's trial to us. Jesus. They didn't really put the shortcut very close, did they? Hello, table for four. Ah, the rust special. Burn the shit out of it. Look, I thought we were cooking. It's fine. I, I thought it was like we take a tick for a second and then and then we're chilling, you know, to dodge the uh, vun. <laughs> the vulnerability. Oh, oh, bless me quick. Jesus, as a long cup. Yeah, that was a long cup. Throwing for content. I didn't. I didn't. All right, let's do this. Thank you. Thank you. People bless. Cousin tight. Thank you. Thank you. Peepo cute. No. Well, screw you then. All right, let's go. Do do burning bright. Ow. Jesus, man. It's got them Pegasus. Okay. 50-50. I think it's going that side. Nice. Okay. I'm going to stand right here. Oh, yeah, yeah. But not but at the wall. So I can get pushed in the puddle. Okay. I didn't get Vuln. Nice. Easy clap. Mwah. It's trial and error, guys. Okay. Overcome and adapt. Learning. Burning bright. All right. I'm going to move out the way. Ow! Maybe it's directly behind. A rubber room with rats. I'm trying to sneak around, but I'm dumb and thick. Oh, no. What happens in the rubber room with rats? Okay, that moves out and it's going to blow up. Oh, we're owning him now. Freelancer, thank you for the 15 months. Welcome back. Hope you're doing very, very well. Ooh. All right, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Don't stand in the damage zone. Oh shit, okay, so okay. It'd have been harder that side, because we'd have had to go on go on over there, right? If it was coming from this side, we have to go over there. But here, it's fine here. Nice! Learning! Okay, now I'm gonna see. Burning bright, is it going behind it? Oh, it's just random. Okay, so that's a like spread. Okay, we learned. Now we're learning a new telegraph. Still, game is still teaching me. All classes. Ooh, this looks cool. Yo, let me get that glam game game up though. Holy. Russ is ready to become a mentor. Yeah, baby. Ultimate Raider in the making. Easy. Clap, baby. Yoink. No tongue. How could you do this to me? Race Velga Broodling. <laughs> Oh, big Demouche. Big Demouche. So in tutorial? Oh, yeah, for sure. There's many more things the game has yet to teach me, you know? Nice. Do -do -do. Defeat Horace Velga. Okay. We're going to fight him next. So wait, he just sucked. He like uh, fucking brainwashed the Moogles into fighting me there. By the way, that was such a good throwback to the Mogul Mog uh, music, by the way. His cheeks remain ever clapped. Moglin too now. 
105 ultimates. Froth Fantasia. Dawn Trail 2026. Uh, Dawn Trail 20... Yeah, 2026. Yeah. Yeah, Dawn Trail 2020. That these are all true things, by the way, that Voss just said. Oh shit! Okay, we get out of that. I do like the animations on Dragoon, like leaping up and down all over the place and shit. Hi, Urkal. Hello, hello. How are we doing? Ooh, more treasure. Man, I can't believe you yoinked, Tongue. Congrats, though. Berserker Bangles again? Blizzard Dragon. <laughs> Guys, slay Blizzard! Goodbye, Blizzard. <laughs> the last Blizzard Dragon I'll ever fight. Yep. There he is. Get him! <laughs> Oh seven. Twist his dick. Twist his scales. Yo, he he's got like fucking camo on there. All right, noise. Noise noise. More loot. Another one of these. Dude, it's not very varied with the loot. That means there's a chance there's a helm gonna drop again. It hog will spare the no clemency. And thus neither neither must I. Alright, that's fair enough. Let's go. Up to Zenith, I guess. Alright, let's fuck him up. But not kill him. We can't accidentally kill him. Oh, look, we're in the golden cup. <laughs> Alright, team, are we ready? There he is, the big boy himself. The pig on arrive. Come, warrior, show me what strength doth remain in thy frail mortal shell. I fucked up. Okay, that's a tank smash. Oh, he's uh, I don't have to do positionals. Nice. Alright. We dodged that. Holy storm. Move away, maybe? Nice! Poggies! Get out of that. Oh, it's a pushback from here, I think. Ow! Ow! Ow, it's not a pushback! Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Yikes. Okay, we're getting this. I'm fainting him, I'm fainting him. Alright, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Oh, it's a, oh, it's a Akmon thing. Right, that's a tank smash. <laughs> this song's a banger. Hallowed wings. I'm gonna go into this. Ah! Oh, I see, I see, I see. God, I am getting rolled. All right, it's fine, guys. <laughs> I can I can live again. All right, I'm moving away from that. Diamond Storm. Oh, no. Okay. Ah! Oh, we're fine, we're fine. Fine. Okay, we're chilling. We're chilling. Literally. Easy clap, baby. It's just too easy for the Russinator.
Alright, Akmorn. Oh, it literally says it on the cast bar now. Ah, I'm getting dicked. Hallowed wings. Alright, so that's on the right wing. Alright, so we move over here. Easy clap. I'm learning. I'm learning. It's all my scrutiny. Mayhap there's a chance. You're getting what? I'm getting it. Uh, yeah. Worm claw. All right, we, we get out of that. This tank's getting busted. Tank's getting bust. Nice. Okay, that's on the other side, so we're good chilling over here right now. Big, 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 big. Holy storm. I think, I guess, I guess it's just a raid wide, right? Yeah, it's just raid wide. Oh shit, yeah, the limit break. <laughs> Easy clap. Level up, baby. 66. Reaper will soon be mine. Easy clap, baby. Okay. I think I think he was like impressed. Action learn dragon sight. Okay, we'll get a screenshot in just a sec, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, Alfie and Aimerick back here. Nice. Wait. Uh, Lydia? <laughs> nice. <laughs> Little tent there, yeah. Um, you killed Raffle Gagger? No, no, no. Race Velga is gonna be on our. He's gonna be our mate now. We've proved that we're worthy, you know. Yeah, pitching a tent. Amrix pitching a tent right now. Who would have thought it? If only I could make Amrix look at Under the camera, the you know. They came. Oh, that looks so good with the thing in the background that tongue did, actually. That makes such nice lighting. Uh, let's also do one from this direction. Lydia will be poking out a little bit. <laughs> nice. B L B L B L B L B L B L B L B L B L tent tent. Yep. B L. Alright, nice. Tongue will get a good G pose here. Are you good, truck? Are you alright? Um cute sword, yeah. Yeah, that fight was sick though. And I did learn the mechanics. Okay, I took three vulnerabilities, guys, however. I learned, okay? So the bit I fucked up, he did the shooty shooty down the middle and then there was like a dot 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 and that meant it was going to go forwards. I realized that now. It was like boom, 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 like a bombing run, right? So I needed to stand at the back and then move into the middle to dodge it, right? So I didn't realize. I'm learning. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Noted. Exactly. It's going to be on the test, okay? Um, oh, with a titan song. Blah, 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 tent. <laughs> tent. Tent. <laughs> Damn, how could the TTS not know what you meant? <laughs> uh, yeah, wait, have they updated that fight? Oh, okay, so this was a new and improved for its vulgar. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I want you in my room. <laughs> yeah. How rude and uncultured of Brian the TTS guy. God damn it. 
Uh, my first tanking for us went well. Yeah, honestly, you did fine, Mutant. You did good. You did good. All good. Uh, and you only died, to be fair, when we all, like, sandbagged. Well, <laughs> you guys all sandbagged and I did the wrong mechanic on the second boss. So, I mean, you know, you died on a full wipe. It's nothing to be uh, ashamed of, you know? It wasn't your fault. It was me! Exactly. All right. Let's wait for Tongue to get the G-Pos in real quick. Good dungeon. Nice music. Good aesthetic. Good bosses, to be honest, as well. All three bosses were pretty good. I, I don't know. Maybe, I mean, Mo Moogle Mog. Sorry. Moglin. I don't really know what was going on, but I obviously liked the song. So it made it a good boss because we got to hear the song again, you know? Don't know if there was actually much going on or if we did it horribly wrong or something. But, you know, it is what it is. So I'll switch your thumbnail and I thought you cleared the ultimate. Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, uh, we're just, we're just chilling at Zenith. We're doing a uh, Horace Velga's Trials. Uh, they nerfed the fight hard for the trust system. Really? I feel like there was still quite a lot of mechanics going on there, Mayhem. Yeah, for sure, for sure. I saw another first time chat a second ago. <laughs> first time chatters get sniffs, by the way, guys. Make sure you say hi if you would like to. If you'd like to. Also, feel free to follow the stream. Right. We're, uh, we're going to... Are you good if I go out? You, I'll stay on your G-Pose, right? It used to be platforms. Oh, really? Kind of like um, that one boss in Crystal Tower, I guess. Pan Pan Nom. You feeling cozy today? You feeling cozy? <laughs> okay, I'll follow. Nesset, I appreciate that. Honk Saber EX. <laughs> Sniffer for you. <laughs> All right, fine. New chatters get sniffs and new followers get kisses. Nessit, mwah! direct RL. Mwah! Thank you for the followers, guys. Yeah. Sniffer the new chatter. There you go. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, you can go. All right, perfect. Tongue's going to get us a nice little screenshot. I'm going to check it in the screenshot channel soon. All right, let's get out and see what's going on here. So many new... Yeah, to interact with. Yeah, new new bloods to uh, interact with. All right, let's see what's going on here. Here I am. I mean business. They're not cult members, okay? It's not a cult, guys. We're a nice, cl chill club, all right? Yo, the sunset setting is real nice. Look at that screenshot with the boys. <laughs> Even bereft of an eye, my brood brother was a fearsome foe indeed. But having tasted thy strength firsthand, full well can I imagine how thou didst bring him low. The dread title of Azure Dragoon is no empty appellation. Very well, I shall trust in the seed of man one last time. By thy deed shall the flickering hope that lingereth yet within my heart be kindled anew, or extinguished forever. No pressure. No pressure on us right now, okay? Seed of man? <laughs> oh, who this? All right, that's for Dolphinir. Let's go, team. Who's that on the left, though? That you yet stand is ready proof of your determination, mortals. Let us fight as allies then, and together banish my brood brother's vengeful shade. On my oath, the wrath that once was Nidhogg shall meet its end. 
Death to Nidhogg. Death to Nidhogg. Death to Nidhogg. Let's fuck him up. This I swear on the memory of my beloved Shiva and on the soul of lost Yasail. Let's fucking do it. Let's fucking do it, lads. Let's go. There's a riot in chat. Okay. Oh shit, my UI. <laughs> nice little Drake there. Nice little red Drake. Watch out for Stinian. That's kind of a good voice. Kind of like your voice, though. Aura Gang. Okay, both our voices are kind of based. It's time to talk to Alfie. Um, based. Kind of feels sad for Nidicol, he was just angry because the elves killed his sister. Yeah, I know, I know. I mean, it makes sense. It does make sense. Like, the dragons are rightfully angry. Let's not, let's not be around the bush. Like, it was man that fucked up, you know? But it's also man who's trying to fix it. I suppose. Oh! Oh, my poor ribs. That was a painful reminder of a great worm's might. And had he truly meant us harm, we would not be standing here now. Plainly, his intent was to teach. His onslaught forced me to recall my training about the speed of the dragon, his balance, his blind spots. It was, in short, a very thorough lesson. Oh. There he is. I'm sorry to do this to you guys. Poor Mog Hand, dude. That's what you get for being a snitch. Yep. Triple shifts. Our negotiations proved rather more strenuous than I had anticipated, but the results seem well worth the effort. Yeah, true. We did get it done. The battle was indeed hard. We always get it done. Thank you, my friends. I would never have earned Trace Belga's cooperation had you not seen fit to grant me yours. Morgan is married. It was your stalwart heroism 
that moved the heart of the great worm at the last. Any gratitude I can offer is but poor reward for your continued service to Ishgard. Marry Moghan. <laughs> Twould seem our final reckoning with the dread worm is at hand. I only wish we had some inkling as to when he means to strike. Tomorrow. Oh, right now. Literally right now. Never mind. Right now. Oh my god, the whole oh sky is going black. Oh, here he is. The boy. The cry endeth his coming. Nidal's shade hath taken wing. It has begun. We must away to Ishgard. To Ishgard. Let's fuck him up. What about Ida and Papalimo? Sorry, Daddy. Sorry. All right, take the potions. Two ish god, huh? Holy shit. An end to the. Wait. Dude, what a short patch. Okay. An end to the song. Amrik is desperate to fly to Ishgard's defense. Ishgard will not last long against Nidhogg and his horde. We must away. Oh. Away we go. Do, 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 do. Shit, here he comes literally right now. Oh, wait, no, never mind. That's Ray Svelga. A pig on arrive. Screenshot button. All right. Know you then. What is this raw pod or tenth? I must return to my city without delay. Then we shall lend you our wings. Let us meet with Nidhogg on the field of battle and together bring an end to his wrathful song. Let's fucking go, team. Bum, 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 ba -da -dum, bum, ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum, bum, Yo, who's this metal dragon on the left? That one looks so cool. Let me ride the dragon. We're all gonna ride the dragons to Ishgard. He's a big dragon as well. Like, this is the biggest boss of the dragons. Look at me go. Whee! He's not a bad dragon. This is a good dragon. Astinian's riding the bad dragon. Oh, fuck! Wait, why are we killing? Oh no, these are these are the bad dragons. All right, these are these are these are Nidhogg's dragons. On the bridge again. Dive bomb. Yo, there he is, Artwarol. Legend. Lucia, another legend. Ooh, let's go. Oh. Remember your training. We hold fast until the Lord Commander returns. Hell yeah. Mother? Sorry. I've bomb aware. Good block. We must hold. Hold this. Sorry, 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 sorry. 
Lucia, my beloved. Oh, she's kind of, she's kind of on it. Those shields are fucking big. There's so many. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> 07. Yo, suspect, what's up? 07 to those guys. Holy. Oh, no. 07 to these guys. There's my boy. Fury. That one is the size of Nidhogg. That is Nidhogg. No, it's me. It's me. It's Race Velga. Let's go. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Look at the boy jumping down. That's that's the literal boy, but look at that boy. Lord Commander. And me, everyone's favorite You're gal. Late, warrior of light. <laughs> oh, look at that smile, though. All right, that's the screenshot. That's the one. I got it, Amatoria. Do, 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 do. There he is. Donk walk. It's fucking time, bitch. What the hell? What's those light beams? Uh, you're late, Warrior of Light. Yeah, A6S took fucking ages, but we did kill it, guys. Oh, fuck. Wherefore standest thou with these vermin, brother? Abandon this war shade. The suffering thou sowest serveth no end. The traitors' pro uh, progeny have learned of their forefathers' betrayal and seek now to make amends with our kind. Never shall our grief be as, uh, assuaged, nor our loss forgotten. But reconciliation may, may yet halt the spread of this plague of enmity. Forsake thy vengeance and be at peace. No, bitch! What soft-headed ramblings are these? Thy dalliance with the vile maid hath robbed, robbed thee of thy wits. Mayhap her cloying perfume hath made thee forget the stench of our brood sister's lifeblood. Thou darest speak thus of my beloved. Nidhogg gone fucked up now. He done fucked up. 
Ah, so the flames of rage may yet be kindled. I feared thy heart's fire had long since gone out, brother. But waste not thy, thy fury on words. Thou shalt have need for it. <coughs> but waste not thy fury on words, brother. Thou shalt have need of it for the battle. I can't believe he said that. God, I look cute. Ooh. Versus mode. He's pissed. And he's got his eyes, so he's going to be real strong. Let's fucking go. Alright, to be fair though, Race Velga plus a Warrior of Light versus just Nidhogg. Like, if they're equal in strength, we have the upper hand for sure. Oh god. Alright. Okay. He has a light ball versus a fireball. Oh, he's going to break the bridge. Wait, what? He's going to make it fly. No way he's going to slam that down on him. All right, get the fuck out of the way. <laughs> Why didn't he move? I saw that coming. Legend. Oh fuck, our people. All right, they need to go help their people. We'll, we'll take care of Nidhogg. Guys, I got to give it to it. This is kind of cool. Heaven Sword might not be mid after this. Oh, fuck. Six years, my guy. Sorry. Sorry. I didn't know it was going to be a big cutscene, okay? Apologies, apologies. I do apologize. Sorry. Don't worry, it's a quick one. Wait, what the fuck? Oh! Wait, he's like empowered now. Fuck! No way. Shit. He actually just fucking ripped Bozoed. Jesus Christ. Oh, he's up. He's up. He's up. He's up. He's good. He's good. He just lost a wing. He's chilling. Gah! <laughs> Yo, Livera, appreciate the six years, bro. I hope you're doing well. Thank you, thank you. Sorry, it was just bad timing on the alert. That was my bad, guys. Sorry, I I, I forgot. I didn't realize there was going to be a cutscene. Uh, had a big one, and I forgot about the alerts. I will uh, I'll mute them for a sec. Sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, I'm going to mute them now. Give me just two seconds. Okay, I'll just mute alerts for the stream, okay? Until it's like done, so. Apologies. Um, how do I do that again? Pause alerts, mute alerts. All right, both. I've done both. Paused and muted. So hopefully, no, uh, no interruptions. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Apologies. Apologies. Sorry. Uh, Lavera, appreciate the resub. Sorry, it's just at an inconvenient time for the cutscene. We're all good, though. We're all good. Sorry, guys. Can we react now? All right, guys. <clears throat> Immersion. Resume, okay? 
Thou art weak, Hatebrace Velga, a slithering worm who falleth on the vermin who should be rightly, who should rightly be his prey. For a thousand years I have fought without cease, and thou didst think to prevail against me? That is true. He's a little bit rusty. He's a little bit rusty. Glory not in thy victory, Shade. The battle is not yet won. My power and my hope have I entrusted to another. Oh, shit! Oh, fuck. Okay. He gave me the eyes. I assume me. Thine art. Oh, that was kind of good. That reveal was good. Thine eye, what hast thou done? It's me, bitch. It's Britney, bitch. Look at me. Me in a dragon's eye. As a dragoon. With the gay bulge. Holy. Come on, then. Fool, thou wouldst trust a mortal with thy strength? Oh shit, we get the, the real music with lyrics and everything. Twas thou who didst intrude upon my lair, and best the half of me. But now I am whole, and naught in creation shall deny me my vengeance. I am gonna best you. And free my friend! Okay. I guess it's a trial. The final steps of faith. The final steps of faith. Well. Are we about to take this motherfucker out, Feline? Isn't the song a banger? Yeah. It's nice. I think we heard it on the end of like Base Heaven Sword credits, perhaps. Um, you know you're mandated to wait for the party finder for 15 minutes and enjoy the music. I'm down for that. I'm down for that. Hell yeah. This is the dragon song. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she's also new. Nice. Not alone. Wait, what do you mean, uh, Hazard? You showed up at the right time. This shit. Yeah, dude, that cinematic was nuts, by the way. Okay, I can see. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm starting to see why everyone loves Heaven Sword, guys. Dare I say it. <laughs> Dare I say it. He's starting to believe. Mid. Look. I said 3.0 was not that, not as crazy as I was expecting, okay? Still mid though. I mean, a lot of people in the YouTube comments said that, not me. I never said it was mid, guys. Look at that screenshot right there.
Look, we have some random in the background. Woo! Yo, Jackot. Z, Z dude. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Jackot Sue. <laughs> Get sniffed. The main expansion is the setup for the patches. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. How goes the MSQ? This is where we're at. This is where we're at. Um, yeah, but the, to be fair, in my YouTube video, guys, remember, I did say I'm not going to judge the, pa the, the expansion as a whole because I haven't played the patches. I straight up said that, okay? I said I'm not going to judge Heaven Sword, okay, because I haven't done the patches. So I never said it was mid because I hadn't done the patches and I said it would be unfair to, all right? Sure. I said 3.0 ending was a little bit of a letdown. And I preferred 2.0 ending to 3.0 ending. That's the only comparison I made, okay? That's the only comparison I made. Ah, oh, he's going back to WoW. No! <laughs> 3.0 mid. Yeah, 3. Okay, 3.0 was not even mid. It was still good. Thor Dan. All right. Thor Dan hard mode MSQ style was mid there you go there flip it that's what's mid that's what's mid he hates america <laughs> he's going to do an asman and stop after heaven sword did you ever think maybe there's a reason he stopped after heaven sword guys hey no, i'm kidding i'm kidding near the dungeon uh it's all good it's all good yeah the dungeon was fun i just took uh i just took i mean there was a few people that didn't get into the dungeon anyway so not necessarily that you would even got in uh miyuki he stopped chasing the algo i think he said uh i think from what i've heard he um he got uh he got a little bit put off by the community pushing pulling him in what which what direction you know which fa is fair enough to be fair um denki nice streak by the way invite the random Maybe I invite the random in. You know what? That could actually be kind of fun. This chat was being insufferable. Yeah, I can totally see uh, that being a thing. <laughs> Hello. Do you want to do the trial with us? I'm asking. I'm asking. Yo, Joe, what's up? Yeah, Glam's still on point. Feline is always on point, guys. Plate two, I bet. Guide us, almighty fury. Yeah, I'm doing it min-eye level, no echo. And the random doesn't know that yet, if they even come in. Oh, we could. I'm in a party with one more friend. They can join too. Oh. But we are going to do it at min I level, if you also want. Sprouts. Is it a four or an eight person? It must be an eight, right? Let me uh, spend this one real quick. Fine, however you want. Hell yeah. All right, we're getting in. Uh, can I have leader to invite? Ah, oh, nice. They gave me lead. Thanks. I will right, we'll get some peeps in. All right, baby. Gonna need party finder. Yep, 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 yep. We're gonna party finder it. Okay. This song does go hard, guys. 
3.3 stream, uh, stream hook really is working. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'm going to party finder this, okay, guys? I like how that guy is stepping on our friend over there. <laughs> Yeah, I hope he is okay. I like how, uh, Steffies? Yeah, party finder? No, we're gonna do party finder and then we'll, we'll sign up like normal, right? All right, party finder, private, recruit members, uh, what was it called? Trials. Podcast. No, that's the final steps of faith. Just Russ group. Okay, guys, you need to click this. It's just going to be first come, first serve, all right? First four people to get in, we go with, and we're going to... Don't don't matter your role, your job, okay? This is going to... The password's 1409, all right? So click hard, click fast, and type 1409 real quick. You know what? Actually, I'm just going to re remove the 1409, okay? Actually, you know what? No. You have to type 1409. It's part of uh, the uh, how you ascend, okay? Yeah, so you'll have to click this little button here, this little refresh button as soon as I post it, all right? I'm going to post it at, uh, at Eorzea time, 4, p 4 a.m., okay? So look at the clock, and that's when you hit refresh, all right? Okay, then it's fair to everyone. We'll sort out the jobs and the roles and who's doing what when we get in, okay? It's all in the randoms. Oh, they're not in a rush. They're chilling. They're just like, yeah, it fits the story. Like, we're, we're just chatting. We're chilling. At 4 a.m., I'm going to post it. So then you click refresh, okay? Wasting two people's time. Yeah. It's like 15 seconds, guys. Yeah. I was on the star, but dragon slaying, trying to become... <laughs> Yo, these randoms are nice. Guys, we have to big up the sprouts if you get in the party, okay? Okay, in three Aeolzia minutes, all right? Get ready. Oh. Wait. Oh, never mind. We're good, we're good, we're good. Hello, gamers. That was so satisfying. I was going. <laughs> All right, perfect comp. Yeah, we got two. We got two <laughs> tanks, two healers, and four deeps. Double dragoon, double warrior, double scholar, baby. My body is ready. Yeah, Hackerman's password entry. I've watched plenty of streamers, and it's always nice to see how fair you make it with community to join the duties. Very cool. I do try. I do try. Yeah. Okay, I try to give a uh, give as much warning and easy, you know, about as as good as I can do, about as fair as I can. I think. Yo, Mahal, what's up? I'm scared now. Are you in here? Yeah, Hattie. All right. Okay. Uh. All right. Everyone, ready to kick some dragon ass. Uh, who's? Oh yeah, Schmirk. This is a uh, this is a uh, Hayen's friend, I think. Heck yeah, heck yeah, hell yeah, let's go. Yo, Telfindos. Oh shit, sorry. The alerts are currently off for a sec because we're doing um big MSQ moment stuff. 
But they'll pop uh, when I turn them back on and un unpause them, all right? Telfendos, thank you for the five gift subs. To her Trixie, anom Anomalous Gamer, Last Choco, Samurai Cade, and Emu 2. All right, appreciate those. All good. 07, 07, five gifties for taking care of the community. I do try, I do try. We, we're building a strong community up in here, okay? It's time for the dragooning. Look, yo, this sprout is going to fit in. All right, I, we have to tell, before we finish, we have to tell them about the stream because they're going to fit in. Time for the dragooning. Hell yeah. I couldn't have said it better myself. We need to get them in here, guys. <laughs> but after the duty, okay? After the duty, we need to tell them. All right. Trials. The final steps of faith. Minimum eye level, no echo, baby. Time to goon, baby. It's time to goon. The music kind of slaps, though. Remember, guys, sandbag, okay? Remember to sandbag, even with the sprouts. <laughs> Yo, Yama, what's up, by the way? Rip. Race Vulgar. All right, we're going to be empowered by the eye. Why did he give us only one, though, not both? Or would we have got corrupted as well, then? Let's go. Ice portrait. Okay. Um... I'm going to eat an uh, egg. <laughs> ah! Egg. Okay. What are we doing? What are we doing? Oh. Okay. We want to get out of that. That's a wing slap. That's what they call a wing slap. Okay, get bus back up. Nice, tank frontal. Get my get my chaos thrust going. Oh dude, Volps is getting absolutely shredded right now. Do the fucking mechanic. I'm trying, I think I did. Okay, we move out of that. Probably move into this. All right, he's back. He's back, baby. We restart the combo. He desynced. My goddamn uh, Gaskogel, though. I drifted. All right, ads. There's a third guy who's not being picked up. That's not good. All right, someone take the Shadow Dragon. Boom. I'm gonna... Okay, I guess we'll just kill them at the same time. And the Shadow Dragon at the end. Alright, we're chilling. Wait, is he... Is he on... He's just... Does he just randomly attack people? He's just hitting a... Schmirk. <laughs> He's hitting Schmirk! Alright, fuck him up. Fuck him up, team. He doesn't know. I don't know anything. Oh, let's get a big, big hit. Fuck, I wasted my god on life surge. Okay. Look upon the fool who dared embrace my power. Witness the darkened wings that beat about his shriveled soul. Oh, fuck. Wait, what? That's Estinian. He's winged. Jeez. Holy shit, Giga Chat mode. Nidhog human form. Holy shit. Oh fuck. Get flank going. Get behind him.
Yo, I'm waiting for um, Chris Velga to do something. Like he's gonna get up or something. Okay, those spreads. We go over here. Oh fuck! Okay. Oh yeah, we're chilling over here. Res Lumi. That's a tank smash. I faint. I faint. I faint. You're good. You're good. Easy. Okay. I'm going to move out. Oh, that doesn't look good. That doesn't look good. Ow. Ow. I took a dot. I took a dot. Oh. Okay, so it places uh, AOEs. I can't find this. Oh, he's getting slapped. Too easy, too easy. So you want me to turn BGM up more? All right, there you go. Enjoy. Get out of that, get out of that. Whoa! Oh, he's big and red now. Do, do, do. All right, that's a big Akmon. Shit, balls. Soaking? Can't soak it. Oh shit. Okay, get out of that, get out of that, get out of that. Get up his arse. Hot tail. Alright, get out of that. We're doing the dragooning. Ah, come on. I faint this one. Big damn, big damn, big damn. Do we just do we just do the LB? Unless he has a secret phase? Easy clap, baby. Let's fucking go! Get rolled. All right, that was sick. I feel like he was just about to do like some crazy mechanic though. I feel like we skipped something. All right, here he is. He's mad, he's pissed. GG's. Yeah, the music really timed perfect. That's why I went for the LB because it was getting so like. Da -da 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 -da. And then I was like, All right, I have to send it. Like, we have to kill it on the fucking drop. <sighs> yeah, I won't unmute yet. Don't worry. Don't worry. You guys can tell me when it's safe to unmute alerts. I can watch DSR. Yeah, true, true. Oh. Good shit. Let's get a. Screen shot. Do we have the uh wait no Oh wait Hayen's in here. We lost uh Hayen's friend. Oh look, Hayen knows. Hayen's not in the stream, right? <laughs> How did they know? <laughs> hmm. I mean, their friend left. Hmm. You know what? It's fine. Because it means they got to the exact same MSQ point. Time to drop the link in pie chat. Oh. 
Um, uh, the friend's still there. Oh, we missed. Oh shit, we should we should get one with Astinian as well, actually. Afterwards, Mari's cooking. Mari's cooking. Say cheese. Let me do a Jibos as well. Oh, I got like a Skogel on the on the ropes. We're doing the dragooning. The sprout right in the middle, baby. It's all about the sprout. Uh, score removes. Yeah, yeah, I know. Uh, Devonair. I just like having the names above people's heads. Look at Feline go. Who's the Namazu? That's a uh, Lumi. S tier dragooning. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh shit, we got helmet on now. It's transformer bun. Yeah, Feline actually did drop the link in party chat. <laughs> the bad dragon ice cream. Hey, it's all good. We're going to hopefully get some more cinematics in a sec. I think Harry Svelg is going to get up. I also want to maybe get a screenshot with Astinian over there. Huh? Add them to the stall. Sprout been doing PvP. Hell yeah. Oh shit, yeah, the V pose. Oh, dude. The dragooning. <laughs> Hold on. The synchronized leaping. You know what I'm going to do? There we go. What a what a gamer picture right there. You can barely see me, I blend in. Mari's looking up. <laughs> Alright, nice. Change the lighting. Yeah, I could, but I, I can't be bothered with all the crazy G posing and all that. I'll get better. We'll get better ones. Look, here's the one from uh, here's the one from the dungeon, by the way. Or one, sir. Look at those. Look at those starry lights. Look, look right down the eye of the lance, right there. Lydia in, under in the tent. Very nice tongue. Very nice. Is Mari's one with a much higher quality than I can do. It's a stormy day on the steps. Stormy day on the steps right there. Oh shit, hold on. We have another. Damn. That's one big sink. What the hell does that mean? Yo, Pookie, what's up? Hello, hello, how are we doing? Suniko, what's up? what's going on as well? Color's a bit too much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all good. Everyone's got their preferences and stuff. That's one big sink. Look. Are you meaning this chasm? Because I would not piss off that. 
Okay. Big hole. <laughs> uh. Oh, shit. Here we go. Yeah, should we all sweep up Astinian here? <laughs> Poor guy, man. He got absolutely rolled. Yeah, I'm doing good, Pookie. We're about to, uh, well, I don't know. This patch, I don't know. Maybe there's more to go. Maybe there's like Ida and Papa Limo at the end because it's been really short otherwise. So I guess we're going to see. But we just kicked Nidhogg's ass. Easy clap, baby. Stop bullying my boy. Well, he shouldn't have been a bad dragon, should he? He shouldn't have been a bad dragon and he wouldn't have to get swept up. The fight? The fight was sick. Obviously, I can't wait to do that one on extreme. That will be nuts. Got to clean up the place. Yeah. Are we, we sure took out the trash. <laughs> we sure took out the trash, baby. I'll show you a bad dragon. I bet you will, devil bird. Yeah, you can hide the portal cafe with the... Um... Here. Here. Oh, sorry, the uh, alerts are currently paused for a sec. But the subs obviously still go through and whatnot. I think you go down to uh, here. And then you can uh, take off um, object, I think it is. Let me double check. Yeah. Or a <laughs> All right. Rain Tep, thank you for the gift sub to Pookie, by the way. Appreciate that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Bad Dragon, the final, final Fantasy community go insane. Astinian, what as? Oh, on, on the Bad Dragon uh, piece of merch? Yeah. Yeah, they kind of would. All right. Oh, wait, what did Hayen mean? Battle litany is up, baby. Are we having a lovely day? I am indeed. How are you? Have How are you doing? Hi, Rain. All right. Probably cinematic time. Or cutscene, I guess you call it. GG's. Thanks for playing with us. Alright, guys, it's time. Hayan means peaceful. Oh, okay. Peaceful era. Guys, it's time. Assemble! Assemble! There he is. Estinian! Estinian! He's still got the eyes on him, though. It ain't over yet. Alright, he's gonna pull them off. Hey, is this to be my end? Oh, he's actually fucked then. He's actually. Real weak. Me. I will not allow it. I am of the first brood. I am vengeance incarnate. I am Nidhogg. I am Nidhogg. Thou shalt die by my hand. Oh, phase two, baby. No. Oh, come on. Estinian is pulling out of him. Wait, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> Astinian's taking control. This is not your hand, worm. Let's go. Sorry, I didn't mean it like that. 
Don't strangle yourself. Just pull the uh, eyes off. Oh. Oh, fuck. Internal struggle. It's a streamer. One last favor of you, warrior of light. Finish me. Now, while I have the beast subdued. No! Oh my god. Sorry. 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 There's an ad, guys. You waste your time. Kill me. It is the only way. Ending Nidhogg will be my final duty. Let me just pull this down here. I'm just going to wait. Sorry, guys. Of course there fucking is, bro. Twitch! You little bitch. We are waiting for ads. Sorry. Guys. Sorry, dude. I can't catch a fucking break today, man. Sorry, if I'd have caught it in advance, I would have been able to turn off. That's probably on me, to be honest, guys. Apologies. God fucking damn it, bro. Okay. Every... Okay, remind me. Every time we're about to go in the cutscene... Oh, I don't know. Like, okay. I just, I just need to get better at it. I just need to remind myself... Hattie, thank you for those. I just need to remind myself, if we're if I think there's going to be a cutscene, I make sure I play ads before. Okay? Yeah, check ads for us. XFFing. Sorry, guys. We're waiting. It's done in five seconds. Hattie, appreciate the five gift subs to Revic, uh, Cotio, Curated Papaya, Lumpy Sh Shranicus, and Mo... Uh, and, uh, sorry, I missed that. Uh, Mojo Joey. Dr. Mark, thank you for the gift subs to Ermengile, Just Geordie, and Marnie Dog. <laughs> Guys, there's no ads anymore. <laughs> Voss, thank you for the gift subs. All right. I'm Vittoria, thank you for the gift subs. I'm going to read all these out in a sec. Tongue, thank you for the gift subs. Damn, that's a place to pause. Sorry, it's because there was an ad. I wanted to wait for the people to be done with the ads before I continue it, okay? All right. I'll read the subs out in a second, guys. Appreciate those. Make sure you thank the gift subs. We're back from ads. Apologies about that. Okay, I really do apologize for that, okay? We're not going to kill Astinian. All right, sorry for the ads. It's the only way. Ending Nidhogg will be my final duty, okay? Astinian, we're not going to do you like that, bro. Surely. Please. Alfie couldn't. No, you can't die like this. I won't let you. Just pull the eyes off him. Ah! Do it! Oh, wait. You sail? Yes! Let's go! Here she is. Uh, how's she? Yes! Let's go, boys. Come on! Can we eat them off the cliff? <laughs> Save our boy! Let's eat them! Actually, no, we should probably put them in a box. Ooh, that's pretty. Yoink. My screenshot now. Off he goes. He's actually dead this time, for sure. To heaven. Undone by mortal will. Wither now? Alright, he's truly gone. Unless someone gets hold of the eyes again. Off they go. Duty is fulfilled. Oh, they're just powerless now. And he's still alive. <laughs> Fucking Alfie, bro. He's alive! 
He's breathing. The eyes. Cast them into the abyss. Oh, we're actually going to eat them. Yeet! Go, go, go! <laughs> no way they actually did it. Bye-bye. Dude, imagine someone at the bottom of there finds those. That's a boss for in 10 years, in 10 years time, man. Yeah, just throw them away. I thought we'd lock them up or something. It would make more sense, right? Pre-watched? <laughs> no, I just thought it'd be funny if we eat them. I didn't think we'd actually do it. <laughs> he lives. Yes, baby. Oh. Astinian, my ill-fated friend. I didn't even think about maybe Astinian dying. I thought Aimerit was gonna die. At once, Lord Commander. Let's go. Aimerit lives another day. Astinian lives another day. We already did lose two people in this expansion. It would be rough to lose more, right? Allow me to do this much, at least. Yeah, he really needs to clean his armor. Oh, in daddy's arms. Rip. The Horde have sensed the fall of their master and scattered to the winds. You have my gratitude, Resvelga. Your deeds this day have saved a great many lives. Then our alliance hath served its purpose. Thou didst wield the power I granted thee well. Twas thine own skill and not mine eye which earned thee victory. We should probably give it back to him now. Wait, he's just going off? Wait, I'm just keeping the eye. One in nest eek on. I wish thy companion a swift recovery. Fare you well, children of man. Should we? Do you not want your eye back, bro? Oh. I guess I'm just even more powerful now. I got five, six crystals of light and a fucking dragon eye. Dude, I am getting powered up. I can see why. I guess that's. No more for Estinian now than bear him home and wish him well. Even as Racefelker did. The rest we must trust to the hands of the healers and the grace of the gods. You know, it kind of like makes sense how your character gets more and more powerful the more of the game you play. Because they actually like, you actually acquire these like kind of forbidden big ticket items basically of like obscene amounts of power. They like kind of make sense why you power creep as you level up kind of thing. I kind of like that. I don't really know any other game that does that. Yeah, like really unique items. Because like, usually it's just like, oh, you have more experience in combat. You have more... Um, yeah, like more combat experience and you've leveled up and you've played more and stuff, right? Oh, shit. Hello. By the way, guys, I really do apologize for the uh, ads. I, I That was completely my bad. Sorry. And... um. Sorry that I had to pause the cutscene for it. Uh, but thank you for the gift subs. I really do appreciate those. They come to collect taxes. Here's the team. No sweat. Yeah, I really feel bad about that. Sorry, guys. I need to get better at that. I need to get better at that. I feel like I just like ruined the last cutscene. Wasn't too bad. I, fi I feel really bad. 
Give us the feels. Yeah, stream of baiting the gifts. That's not even it. Like, uh, I actually just paused the cutscene to wait for the ads and, you know. It's a silly one, but it's cool. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Um, same, same for the other one as well. I didn't realize, like, when they flew into the sky, the pre-cutscene to that one, there was also uh, going to be sub alerts. Yeah, my bad, guys. Uh, uh, yes, please. Yeah, yeah. You can just, uh, you can just, burp, like, you can just let me know if I, if there's ever, like, we can learn from this, right, guys? If there's ever, like, uh, if there's ever, like, a moment, like, without it being like a spoiler, you, because, like, if it's a cutscene, you might just want to be like, turn off ads for this, you know? So just like at me in chat and spam away and be like, make sure there's no ads, or, like, play ads before this or something like this, right? Like, give me a heads up. It doesn't need to, it won't really like spoil anything. Just let me know so I can like either you can say like make sure ads or turn up like if it's a long big cutscene make sure I turn off or pause alerts or something. Yeah, yeah. Then we can at least use this as a learning experience. So my bad. We usually do. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. Like I, I should have checked as well. Like going out of the end of a of like a trial or going out the end of a dungeon, I should usually check. Right. Turn off ads. I mean, it's not quite that simple. Twitch Twitch has a way of playing them. You know. Like they just play, so uh, I I can at least control them to to my best uh, to my best ability. I can't just turn them off. It's just not a thing, unfortunately. Yeah, they will get ads regardless. So come up with a safe word to mute notifications. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that should be fine. That should be fine. I mean, you can just like like trucks gonna DM me. Uh, if you guys also tell me in chat or something, then we'll try and we'll try and keep on top of it for everyone else who's not subbed and stuff. Because I want to keep it fair, right? I don't want to be like, ah, only subs get to watch the cutscenes. Like that's a bit, bit gatekeepy, right? Uh, I just want it to be as good of a viewing experience as possible for everyone. Anyway, Jakotsu and Amons, thank you for the follows. Sora, thank you for the gift sub. Tung, thank you for the gift sub. Amatoria, thank you for the five. Vos, thank you for the five. Doctor Marks, thank you for the three. Hattie, thank you for the five. And Rain, thank you for the gift sub. All right, appreciate you guys. Sorry about that again. I feel really bad. You want to pause them in some because they auto. No, well, that's the thing. I can, I can pre, I can like, I have a button on my side where I can. So they auto run, ads auto run. But I can pre auto, I can, I can pre play them like specifically by pressing a button so they don't auto run for like an entire hour. Like if I run a three minute ad. There'll be no ads for like a whole hour. So if I know there's a lot of cutscenes coming up, I can pre-play a three minute ad and we can just I can just go AFK, go pee or get a drink or something. And then we'll come back and have like uninterrupted for an entire hour. Yeah. So like I can I can try my very best to like place the ads where they're least intrusive, but they will there will be ads regardless of, of what, right? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I see what you mean, Abish. And that's why, like, some like sometimes I can hit space and it will pause the cutscene like until the next dialogue line. But sometimes the animations and stuff play in the background, so I couldn't like just pause it straight up, right? Which is annoying. That an alarm ring every. I mean, I could have them play every hour, but I rather have them play like every thirty minutes or now, and then I just auto play them when I know there's like cutscenes and stuff. Darth Shaman, thank you for the follow, by the way. Right, what kind of cuties do we have here in game, huh? Thank you for coming out to, uh, I guess this is kind of, this is literally where we started Heaven Sword. This is where we started Heaven Sword. This is where we finished 3.3. In the exact same spot, walking up the ramp. Except now everyone's a little bit worse for wear, should we say. You know? This guy's injured. This guy's injured. I'm glad we got to uh, see uh, Yasei on the house here again. That was nice. That was a nice little touch. The power of friendship prevails. Yeah, just a couple left for three. Wait, sh is there gonna be more cutscenes? In which case, should I do ads again? Like, should I should I do them soon? Like before we go in? I'm gonna hang out here for like another ten minutes, or like another few minutes anyway. Yeah. Okay. 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 In that case, I will run some ads before we do that, but they're not for like 15 more minutes, so. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look at these cuties for a second, maybe get a screenshot or so. Feel free to come on down to the Aetherite guys if you would like to be in some screenies. I guess we're not truly at the end yet, but I might just take a couple pics since it's a kind of nice setting, you know? 
And as before continuing, I will do. Okay, thank you. Thank you. James from Bible Studies. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> Hell yeah. Look, we got a little uh, yapping Lala here. Yeah. Oh, you guys are cute. Thank you for coming out. Thank By the way, just in general, thank you guys for like coming and seeing me in game through like all my streams. You know, I mean this when you come to the guild at the start of every stream. When you come see me at my MSQ moments, I do appreciate that. It makes it makes it feel much more like a community thing and much less like a, I'm just playing a game. I feel like I'm part of something bigger, I suppose, because you guys are always showing up. So thank you. Uh, let me let me try and uh, you know what? Let me let me get a couple. Beep. Lovers. There we go. Beautiful. Let me get a G. Should we get a G pose, guys? Can we get a G pose by the crates here? Wait. Let, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna get a multi-level G pose. I'm gonna do a sit. We're gonna get a line in front. The leaners at the back, and we got the sitters at the back too. You know, and the standers. Uh, C pose. Yeah. Let's let's get a line here in front. we get a nice little picky here. On my way. All right, all right, all right. Uh, giving me... Me giving up peak crafting time to say hi to Russ and EU friends. Thank you, Rocky. I'm here in spirit. All good. Is the PC uh, shenanigans on the rise, Amatora? Is it, is it fixing up here? By the way, guys, make sure you do thank uh, anyone who gifted you a sub if, if, we, if you got one today, okay? I know the alerts are paused. They'll, they'll get unpaused when we're, like, done with 3.3. Um, but that's not yet. So, yeah. You found the issue. That's good. What was it? Had to log out for work and productivity. Yeah, you did get the guild hang. You did get the guild hang. All right. Minnie's here. Lot of meat. Shiro's and Alice are there. All right. This works. This works. Oh, shit. There's stupid guys in the way. <laughs> Oi! Random Lancer! Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. All right. I got all the names in there. Let me G-pose it. Look at the cute Lala's. Ugh, I don't want to block anyone, but this stupid Lancer guy is. Sorry, Smug Dragon Girl. All right, I got you in. I got you in. Nice. There we go. Boom. All right, I'll let someone with better G post skills take the real one here. You can turn off. Oh, I can turn off NPCs. You're right, actually. Wait, what? Nice. Fuck that guy. All right. <laughs> Boom, baby. Yeah. Let's go. I completely forgot about that. Eat shit, Lancer. <laughs> Oof. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, nice. We all look hella good, guys. We all look hella good. Mari's cooking. Dula Peep's cooking. Nice. Um, how about taking selfies? You're helping that guy out. He's clearly wounded. Look! He's fine. If he was really in dire need of attention, he would have uh, gone he would have gone to the pub by now. Look, he's he's got a shoulder injury, alright? He's only bleeding slightly. This guy, though, that better not be Firm Albert. I hope Firm Albert's fine. Either way, he's got a cast on, so we're, we're kind of chilling, right? It's kind of fine. War veteran. Get deleted, yeah. His shoulder's been hurt? Yeah. Yeah, since 2015. That is true. He, he'll live. He'll live, guys. That sword looks so cool, by the way. Both of these two. I need to get Dark Knight, guys. Over the next couple weeks, I want to get Dark Knight. I want to get Monk. And it might be time to get Reaper. I'm level 66 now, okay? It might be time to go get Reaper. Push to 70, get Reaper maybe. But I do want to pick up Monk for sure. Gunbreaker? It's not on my like immediate list. I, I think I prefer to try Dark Knight before Gunbreaker. 
I'll try it eventually. But yeah, Gunbreaker is just not one of like, it's not something that I'm like, ooh, yeah, I really can't wait to play it. Bard arc when? I definitely will pick up Bard. I want to do Bard when I when I have access to T. Because I want to get the bow from T. Fish, bash, bosh. In, out. Quick, quick T clear. Pick up the bow real quick. Boom. Then I'll be a real Bard. Okay. Monk is way too much fun. Yeah, I've heard it's really, really fun and good. All right. That's a... Uh, copium. <sighs> Man. Quick, a quick T clear, guys. All right, let's go up. Uh, I'm going to quickly, while you guys do some G posing real quick, I am going to run the three minute ad since there's... Wait, is there, how many, is there a lot of cutscenes? Should I do it? Should I just turn them off for an entire hour? Or like 30 minutes is fine. Full mm -mm. hour. All right. Okay, guys, don't go anywhere. Just in case I stall last cutscene. Oh wow, okay, all right. Let me uh let me run a three min ad. Actually, yeah, let me run a three min ad and uh go pee, and then we were gonna go watch the cutscenes, all right? Monk's fun to play, real big brain at high levels. Yeah. So like from from my understanding is it's like setup, setup, setup. Uh you gotta like push certain buttons, get like a power bar charged up, and then you go like <gasps> And you do like a massive overhead slappy boy. Yeah. I'm, I'm kind of hyped to play it and try it out. Right. I'm going to pee, feed the dog, and fill up my glass of water. There's going to be a three minute ad. And then we're going to continue the cutscenes, guys. The MSQ vampiring can uh, continue then. There will then be no ads during cutscenes. The alerts are still off, so hopefully the alerts will not pause. Uh, the alerts will not happen during cutscenes. So hopefully, no cutscenes will get ruined for the rest of today. Okay? Apologies again. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make sure the dog's okay as well. All right. Let me play the ad. I'll BRB. BRB, okay? You guys want, uh, all right, you guys want a dance break as well? Stare at the uh, stare at the ad enjoys as well. All right, one sec, guys. Brb.
Sorry, guys. Ad sh should be over. All right, guys. Ads off for one hour, three minutes. Let's get some fucking cutscenes going. Let's get some goddamn cutscenes going, okay? Look at the crowd right here. Beep. Cozy cutscene time. Let's fucking go. Okay. Thank you, adventurers. It's time to speak to Alfie. See what he has to say about this whole shenanigans stay. All right. It is time. Uh, if you're already finding the dragon busy, uh, you'll be more overwhelmed by monk. Yeah, I just want to try uh, try a bunch of stuff out. Uh, I just want to try all the jobs. I'm not like quitting Dragoon or anything, guys. I'm just uh, just want to try some other jobs. I, I, I've, my plan has always been to switch to Reaper at 70, like since before I even made my character. Um, but I don't, I don't like hate Dragoon or anything. All right, let's talk to Alfie. Let's see what he says. Um, where's my, all right, this is fine. <clears throat> Through the haze of pain, I swear I sensed, but no, the past is done and we must look to the future. At long last, Nidhogg is gone. That's the second time we killed him, though. His foul spirit cast out once and for all. I only pray that Estinian survives the ordeal. I hope so, too. Hates Dragoon. Classic. Heavensward is mid. Dragoon is mid. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guys, keep fabricating these things. Alphano seems distracted. Heroes of the hour. Your battle with Nidhogg's Shade will beget many an epic ballad, Russ. And rightly so. It was without a doubt one of your more epochal victories. Though I must admit that I took greater joy in seeing you emerge from the experience unscathed. Hey, it's all the power of the race of Hogger's eye, baby. And not only for your own sake. Had you not been there to aid me, those infernal eyes would still be fused to Estinian's mail. Yeah, to be fair, like, I guess then uh, Nidhogg would not have transcended. He would have just, like, laid dormant in Astinian until he got powerful again. Yeah, that would have been kind of fucked. But now, just Russ is mid. <laughs> Yet, even with Nidhogg gone, I cannot help but wonder how much of our friend remains. Yeah, true. He might just be, like, kind of fucked up now. Let us pay a visit to Lucia and beg news of his condition. All right. Brave adventurers, I must depart to Lucia's workshop. All right. We're going to go find out what happened to Estinian. I'll be back. I'll be back. Let's go. Oh, I'm being doted from range. Up we go. Yeah, Estinian might not like be all there now. Or he will, like, be uh, empowered. Like, maybe he'll keep... Since, like, obviously, it kind of, like, went through his veins and stuff. Oh, Firm Albert's fine. Nice. Yeah, cause, like, it was, like, literally fused with his soul. Like, maybe he retains, like, a portion of the power. Russ, Master Alphano, my honored friends. As if winning Horace Volga to, to our cause were not enough, you took it upon yourselves to rid us of his brood brother. I know not how to thank you. My own contribution was hardly noteworthy. The true saviors of the day were Russ and Astinian. One triumphed over Nidhogg's shade through strength of arms, and the other through strength of will. That is, yeah, that is true. That is nice, actually. And speaking of Astinian, what news of his recovery? The Azur Dragoon was conveyed to the infirmary, where he now resides under the care of our hospitaller captain. Hospitalia, Captain. I am told he has yet to regain consciousness. But as you know, Estinian's mind and body were held hostage for many days. We must be... <laughs> it's been many days. It has been a lot of days. <laughs> it's been many weeks. I'm sorry, Estinian. When did I finish 3.0? 
Uh, I think it was like almost a month and a half or something ago. I think it might have been two months ago. It was in January, I'm pretty sure. Was it the end of January? Yeah, it's many days. We must be patient and allow the process of healing to begin. In the meantime, you would do well to rest and recover from your own ordeals. But surely... Sir Aymeric is never long from Estinian's bedside. And will send you word the moment there are any developments. Now, if I have satisfied your concerns, I believe Lord Edmund and his sons are most eager to celebrate your return. Yeah, let's go. Let's go see the Count. Very well, First Commander. Come, Russ. It would seem that we are awaited at Fort Tom's Manor. All right, let's go see the boy. Do, do, do. Moghan? <laughs> oh, he was fine in my game. Yeah, maybe maybe the quest line, maybe maybe history changed because uh I, I did spend quite a while doing Alexander since since Estinian was taken away. Hey look, this bush is called Verum Clavis. I hope you're having a great day. I hope you are too. Chat, I hope you're having a great day. Everyone. Welcome, Mistress Just Stolen. Shall I show you in sh inside the manor? Yeah, very cute cat boy. Let's do this. Oldest VOD on Twitch with a 3.0 podcast says two months. Oh, God. I got found out. I found you out. All right, this one's got to be voice acted, right? Surely. The heroes of the hour Here we go. <clears throat> Here we go. Assemble. We but did our duty, my lord. It was the memories of fallen friends and not our heroism which saw us through at the last. Oh, he looks pissed. I gave every ons of my strength. But mine efforts would have counted for naught had the warrior of light not arrived to challenge the great worm. As a sworn knight of oh, Ishgard, come on, man. I hope to do more for my city. Don't beat yourself up. Our twirl is. Well, we cannot all be heroes, dear brother. Let us put away our pride for a moment and revel in the valiant deeds of our comrade. His voice does not match his face. Service to Ishgard, we salute you. Thank you. I'm happy. And while we're on the subject of valiant deeds, I believe I myself have earned some small measure of recognition. Under my watchful command, the ballistas of the Outer Ward struck down a veritable swarm of Dravanian invaders. My lord's command was certainly watchful. <laughs> he bravely oh, watched as the siege crews took aim, and continued to watch as countless <laughs> wyverns met their end. Indeed, the ward's defenders proved so well drilled <laughs> that my lord had little occasion to stop watching. Get rolled. Do I love Honowa? He's also dressed in armor right now. Rip Bozo. Amana Lane, you stupid little <laughs> Yeah, Only shut the fuck up, pussy. To determine who is most deserving of recognition later. Our friends are doubtless weary from their exertions. I had chambers prepared in expectation of your return. You are welcome to retire at your leisure. I am most grateful for your hospitality, my lord. But I believe I shall pay a visit to the Temple Knights Infirmary. Pray excuse me. Alright, we're gonna go see Asinian. Alfie's in a bit of a rush. I, he is like really beat up about the Asinian thing. Alfino has grown. Yeah. The plight of his stricken brother in arms pains him more than his own hurts. Yeah. In which respect he has come to resemble you, warrior of light. Go then, visit the Azure Dragoon, and grant him what comfort you may. I'm convinced that Alfie's the main character, and I'm just a vessel to grow his character storyline. I think the whole game, yeah, the whole game so far has just been about Alfie becoming less of a snobby-nosed little kid. <laughs> That's it. Alfie's retainer. I do my duty as Alfie's retainer to have to give him character growth. And progression. Yeah, everything I've done so far 
has been so Alfie is just slightly less of a little little bitch each time, you know? You started playing Air Art at the voice. Uh, I quest voice in that one too. Uh, later into the Air Art uns Unsweet Tea Gang, later into Air Art, they are voiced, yes. Um, but the voices change when you get into the next expansion as well. Uh, but some of them are important. What like really important cutscenes are voiced, and uh, but most of them you just got to read yourself, sadly. But they they definitely increase the budget when you get to Heaven's Ward and onwards. And apparently even later they increase it again because obviously they get more money, right? Um, let me check. Look, dude. Okay, biggest bosses of Heaven Sword so far. Definitely this bloke, Atwarl. I really enjoy him. Uh, honestly, Alfie. Has got has got pretty good, and um, Honowa definitely one of the biggest bosses. Who else? Obviously, Amaric is a fucking badass. We love Count Edmund. Dare I say it? Even this guy is not quite as annoying as at the start. However. I do like how everyone roasts him all the time. <laughs> Matoya, Kryl as well. Um, Yastola's been pretty good. I'll give her that. Dude, all the character development has been really good in this expansion. I'm not going to lie. Uh, yeah, Hilda. I mean, Hilda, she didn't really do that much. She's she's good. I like her, but she hasn't really done that much crazy stuff. Like She's just kind of been there looking good, you know, in the side, which is all right. She's alright. But definitely I wouldn't put her as like one of the biggest bosses, you know. Oh, Thancred. Thancred has to be, yeah, one of the craziest character developments in such a short period of time. For sure. Matoya is so hot! <laughs> right, let's see what they have to say here. At long last, Nidhogg is gone. No true son of Ishgard could wish for more. Yet scores of my brother's knights fell in battle, and I find my joy tempered by their loss. Go, warrior of light. We need not begrudge your time spent at a comrade's sickbed. Uh, without the gu guiding hand of yours truly, House Helianar's famous dragon killers wouldn't have killed half as many dragons as just now. As I shall be sure to tell my lady when next we meet. Who is his lady? What? If my lord's impressible optimism were ever to fix upon something about which he had uh, cause to be optimistic, I dare not think what he might achieve. The manservant. Once more, you risk your life in service to Ishgard. We are forever in your debt. Right, that's a bit generic, mate. But to be fair, he's just a servant. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Alexander Goblin Girl. Uh, which one? There are so many. Uh, fuck. Yeah, what's the, uh... Hey, look! Hey, Anera. Uh, the lady... Oh, that lady. Yeah, yeah. Uh, then you've got, yeah, the goblins at Alexander. Even the, uh... Who was the main woman from Alexander as well? What was her name again? Yeah, there's Round Rock. She was best gobby, for sure. Midday. Yeah, Midday. She was pretty cool. Right, where are we going? Back to Amrick's place. Mid. <laughs> no, come on. Alexander was good. <laughs> yeah, Midday was great. All right, here we go. My boy. Oh yeah, Lucia was also good. Dude, all the characters were really good. I'm finding it hard to think of ones which aren't that good. Russ, my friend. What can I do for the savior if Ishgard? You seek Master Alphano. Ah, yes. He came to retrieve, relieve me of my vigil a short while ago. When he begged to sit at Astinian's side, I could not well refuse him. Dude, Alfie just sat here the whole of he he Heaven's Sword getting shat on by Astinian. He's like his biggest fan. So he would sooner faint than admit it. My boy must be exhausted by Harris Valga's trial. And all of that followed. Astinian is blessed to have such devoted comrades.
Yeah, we're doing quick things uh, tomorrow. A7S tomorrow, guys. Wind up Aymeric. Hell yeah. Dragon Song Orchestrion. Oh, is that the Count's Clothes? Oh, shit. Oh, that is swag. That's dripped up. The drip, baby. All right, here we go. Oh, I've got to voice these myself. My own friendship with Astinian began some 10 years past, shortly after we joined the Temple Knights. I learned his name soon enough, but Astinian barely registered my existence. Classic. Classic, dude. And now he's his fucking leader. I was less a fellow recruit and more a shadow which occasionally darkened his path. And so I might have remained had fate not seen fit to intervene. While out on patrol, our company was set upon by a dragon, and we were the only two to survive. The experience forged a bond between us, as such life-threatening situations are wont to do. Despite our friendship, he remained an intense and solitary youth, wholly obsessed with claiming vengeance against Nidhogg. Revenge was ever at the forefront of his mind. Revenge for the death of his parents and revenge for his younger brother. I would venture that in Alphano he sees something of his lost sibling. And in the urgentle childlings of Estinian, and gentle child ch uh, chidings? Chiddings of Estinian, Alphano has found an elder brother that he never had. Aww. Kinda cute. Yeah, what about Alice? <laughs> yeah, but the, I guess it's like the brotherly bond, brotherly love kind of thing. Truth be told, Estinian's tactless observations have saved me from disaster more than once. And I can well understand Alphano's affection for him. He is a friend for whom I would gladly... Oh, shit. Lord Commander, your presence is required in the infirmary. Oh, shit, that's not good. Is he... Tell them I'm on my way. Quest accepted. Shittings. Quickly, Russ. We must go to him. Let's do it. Upon proceeding to the infirmary, several cutscenes will play in sequence. We've got no ads for 46 minutes. All right. Perfect. It is recommended that you set aside sufficient time to view these scenes in their entirety. Yippee! All right, guys. Assemble. Get the popcorn. It's movie time, baby. It's movie time, baby. Ar Ar yeah, I really hope a stick is not about to die as well, man. Or Amrick. Dude, if he randomly gets, like, stabbed or some shit. What the fuck is... Dude, there's a ghost. Oh, he's got no helmet. Estinian. <laughs> there, we finally see his face. Nice. He's going to say something out of pocket. See something you link, boy. It grates my ears. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, idiot. <laughs> Forgive me. When I saw you awaken, I could not... It was such a relief. We feared you might never wake up. Yay. Now, now, Astinian. If Master Alphano thought any less of you, you would still be Nidhogg's plaything. Or dead. Damn. Aww. My height was but a jest. I thank you, Alpha No. And you too, Warrior of Light. Quite how you managed to persuade Hraesvogger to aid in his brood brother's downfall, I cannot imagine. But full glad am I that you did. It is an honor to share the mantle of Azure Dragoon with one such as you. They said the line! 
This whole time playing Dragoon was worth something. Let's go! <laughs> I, for my part, owe you an apology. When last we met, I did willingly loose an arrow at your heart. Can you forgive me? Oh, yes, yeah, shit. He did. There is naught to forgive, Hamerick. You had acted in defense of Ishgard as is your duty. His gay balls is red. Any less single minded about it, I would not follow you into battle or trust you at my back. Legend. Besides, I had come to the self same conclusion that I would have to perish for Nidhogg to be stopped. So let us dispense with the hand wringing. I have heard enough mewling for one day. Hey, and we got him out of it. Oh. Fucking Astinian, bro. Never change. Wait, don't die, though. The tendrils of okay. Nidhogg's foul presence bound up every fiber of my being, usurping my senses. But I yet retained some trace of awareness. Getting zoomed. Worm's mind was as a vast and tumultuous sea. Endlessly, its black waters churned. His grief and despair at Ratatoska's murder never calming, never receding. Driven by this surging current came wave upon wave of unrelenting rancor. If he was, was the pissed. Very image of my own heart. There I saw the dark reflection oh. of the hatred I felt after Nidhogg slew my family. When no path remained save vengeance against Dragonkind. They're actually perfectly suited. It's going to be a bit less edgy now. Neither one of us had a choice. But I was blessed with something Nidhogg was not. Comrades and teachers to console and admonish me. It's kind of cute. Had I not had them to gainsay my obsession, it would surely have consumed me as Nidhogs did him, and we would have been in all respects alike. Cage. <laughs> Though his shade is banished, his spirit scattered upon the sea of clouds, I feel no joy at his passing. Where once I craved vengeance, I now crave rest. You deserve a break, Astinian. That must have been pretty horrible to live with day by day. Like that much hatred and shit, you know? Wait. Lord Commander, my hunt is at an end. I would lay down the mantle of Azure Dragoon. Oh shit. You can't just do that. He has to teach someone. Oh. Stop making me think you're dying. <laughs> he has tired himself with too many words. <laughs> okay, he's just sleeping. I doubt not that he will make a full recovery, but he okay. must be allowed some few days of quiet. All right, thank God. He keeps passing out mid cutscene. <laughs> it's worrying me. <laughs> I've watched too many movies, man. Where they're like, oh. <laughs> oh, seven. <laughs> Look at me taking charge, leading the way out. We needed to let him rest. But who becomes a zero dragoon? Me? I guess. Nobody? If you're not a dragoon, then nobody? I too must see my path to its end. Hmm. Sleep well, my friend. Dude, Aimerick, can you stop saying shit which makes you think you're gonna die? Please. Following the battle with Nidhogg on the steps of faith, oh yeah, the Jerry new Archbishop. An assembly, that he might make his final proclamation as oh shit, Nidhogg. yeah, I think Atwarel's gonna be the new Archbishop. It must be. It was there. With one decree, 
that the thousand-year rule of the archbishops was oh. ended, paving the way. Never mind. No archbishop. Nice. The governance of Ishgard would now be placed in the hands of high and lowborn alike. Their ranks represented by the newly founded House of Lords and House of Commons. Hey! Church was separated from state. The foundation for change had been carefully laid. We have UK the democracy. By Ishgard's <laughs> new government passed into law without incident. British. His duty done, Emmerich de Borel gladly stepped down from the Archbishop's dais, only to be raised unto the highest seat in the House of Lords. Fair enough. But why should any seat be higher than the other, huh? The the unexpectedly strident voice of the Count de Durandere left him little choice but to accept. And so it was that the winds of gentle revolution came to stir. God fucking damn it, bro. Everything with the ads. Everything with the alerts. Didn't account for the fucking doorbell, did I? God fucking damn it, bro. <sighs> Prominent among the many honored guests at Sir Emmerich's investiture were the ambassadors of Dragonkind, a fitting symbol of Ishgard's... I want to know that left dragon. Who the hell heck is that? I need to know that guy's name. Who are, who are you? Surely we're going to find out. Oh shit. Emmerich's just going to ride him away. Let's go. The people looked on in awe as he soared through the heavens on Dragonback. And by their cheers did they hail him an Azure Dragoon for a oh. new age. Damn. Wait, hold up. So now he became the Azure Dragoon. But like a different kind. Is the boy. My liege. <laughs> yeah, boss. That's what it feels like. Oh, I'm, and I'm flying up on uh, on MIDI. Thus were the notes of the dragon song rewritten. The din of war giving way to a rising litany of peace and hope. I want, I want Midgard Summer to fully evolve. He looks so fucking badass when he's fully evolved. <laughs> Grown up. Off I go. Escorted her. Wait, did his wing grow back? Oh, no, 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 no. It's like a part of his front wing. Yeah, it's like a little piece of his front wing. He's lost it now. From the memoirs of Count Edmund the Fourth Arms, Heaven's Ward. We need to give uh, Midgard Summer a rare candy, guys. Yeah, two on the left, three on the right now, yeah. Oh, hello. Does that say Heaven's Ward? I think it does. Heaven's Ward. He wrote the fucking book! Oh, 
Oh man. Yo, what's up with the like emanating or oh, maybe it's just the graphics. But it's like emanating power and shit. Nice. That was good. Hell yeah. Yeah, the Azure Dragoon doesn't make the bed. I think it's more about Astinian not making the bed. Alright. Heaven's Sword pretty good. Heaven's Sword was ending pretty good. Yeah. Dare I say it, guys. It got better with the patches. It got better with the patches, okay? I'm not done? Okay. Alright then. Back to Amrick. <laughs> this one will be a voiced one, I guess. Oh no. <sighs> I was gazing out of the sea of clouds in an all too rare moment of idleness when I chanced to behold a certain hero wandering her way towards the city on Dragonback. Welcome home, Russ. That be I. Chilling with my boy Midgard Sorma. You know, that fucking massively powerful worm that took down the Agrius. Yeah, he's my boy now. We're just buds. I ride him now and then. In dragon form. In the sky. Alright. Nay, t'was no grave matter that moved me to greet you in person. Between... <laughs> That one was unintentional, okay? That was my bad. I didn't mean it like that. I just meant, like, I ride upon him. Is that worse? Is that the same? <laughs> good, good for him. <laughs> um, <clears throat> nay. It was no grave matter that moved me to greet you in person. Between you and me... I merely sought respite from the pressures of office. No sooner do I surrender my role as temporary head of state than I am burdened with a position of more permanent responsibility. <laughs> Midgar Russi. No, not Sussy Russi. No Midgar Russi. All right. Sorry. I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> In the sky? My bad, my bad. I fancy that it echoes in small, in some small measure the way you must feel when your improbable feats of heroism are rewarded with still more impossible challenges. <sighs> we slay the dragon, not lay the dragon. <sighs> I didn't mean it like that, guys. The myth which guided our society for generations lies in tatters. Am I then to be scorned for building upon the system of nobility that I once sought to tear down? And what strange jest is this, pl is, uh, is this that places me at its pinnacle, an archbishop's bastard at the head of the House of Lords? Politics in it, mate. Ah, but these questions are for me to answer. It is not the, in man's nature to change overnight. This I learned through painful experience. And it was this hard lesson which convinced me to take a path which we now follow. Even as we, be, we rebuild the bridge between man and dragon, so must we reimagine Ishgard. One carefully placed stone at a time. We must remember that it is not for us that, uh, that we lay this groundwork, but for the men and women that our children will become. May their towers rise proudly from the fundament of our legacy. Hell yeah. For the future. 
Build the world you want to see tomorrow and all that. I hear word from Captain Whitecape that Astinian had vanished from his sick room. His willfulness survives undiminished. <laughs> Classic. You know what? He took flowers, didn't he? I wonder where he went. I think he may have gone up to Zenith to say uh, to put some flowers for your sail. Because, you know, they had like a little bit of tension, you know? Why is he so short and so cunty? Who, Aymeric? He's tall and not cunty at all. What? <sighs> oh, maybe it's Halshafant. Maybe it's for Halshafant's grave, actually. Thank you, Russ. And please, convey my warmest regards to Master Alphano. Goodbye, Aymeric. Speak with Alpha Noah for Tom's Manor. All right. There's something optional over there. Do it for a gilly. Wait. Gilly. Who's gilly again? Sky Pirates? Dude, we still got optional Heaven Sword du Dungeons and content to do as well. Do, 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 do. Let's go here. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mum's the word. Dinner for four. What were you guys doing in there? What were you... What were you guys doing in there? <laughs> Alright. Uh, well, enjoy. Welcome, Mistress Justolin. Shall I show you inside? Oh my. Oh my. Yo, Takunin, what's up? How are we doing today? That's very concerning. Uh, <clears throat> Lobby, Saurus, and, uh, and Trucorazia. Hmm. Welcome. <laughs> Let's see what Tataru's got to say. You're sa you've saved the day again, Russ. Not that I ever doubted you would. All right, let's see what's up here. You spoke with Sir Emmerich? I do not envy him, his new position. Yeah, that sounds like a bitch. Not gonna lie. Scatter. <laughs> Ishgard has chosen a new road, but one littered with the detritus of a thousand years of broken faith. Yet though her people may stumble from time to time, I know of none better than some Emmerich to deal, to lead the march of progress. That is true. Hell yes. Emmerich lived. Emmerich lived. Unless... You know what? I need to stop thinking so pessimistically. I feel like randomly he's going to get stabbed because he's at the, like, the leader of the House of Commons and someone's still going to be pissed at him, you know? But for now, Emmerich lived, baby. As for us, there remains the small matter of ushering in a new dawn on the shadow of inscrutable Asian mach machinations and a seemingly endless procession of primals. But we too must walk our chosen path, no matter how treacherous the footing. Here we go. Easy. We get the drip, we get Dragon so Song, and we get a little wind up to Emmerich. Hell yeah. And is that it? Boom! In the wake of Ishgard's governmental reform, new airship routes have been sanctioned. You may now travel to a section of distant locales from the landing in Ishgard. Oh! Okay. Interesting. How's your fan? Who's this? I was about to say, I think we're going to see the War of Darkness again, but... I agree. Don't do it. Is he talking to Nidhogg? Oh, he's on a link pole. Oh, no, he's going after the eyes. Dude, I knew... <laughs> it... See? We should have locked him in a fucking box, bro. We should have just locked them in a... Oh my god, it is actually them. 
At least they're not on the moon now. Thank you, Blan Hayes. Nay, you need not remain there. We shall rendezvous at the usual place. John Final Fantasy. Pre-watched? It's not pre-watched. It was just... It, like, throwing, throwing the eyes off a cliff was never going to be a good thing. All is proceeding as expected, then. Aye, there is naught to concern us, aside from one overly curious mouse. Alice! She's been spotted. Tancred? Let's go! This way! Him again! It is of no moment. They will pray they will play their part, and we will play ours. What's up, Rena Kanane, by the way? Welcome. Dude, the scions are the scions leveled up so fucking hard into Heaven Sword, it's nuts. They just had no abilities at 50, I think. And thus did grey mist give way to azure skies. Man and dragon rise above. Voices joined in song. But beneath shrouded bows, beyond the scope of light, shadow stirs. Asians! Floor the horde. So is that it? That's the end of 3.3. Great patch. Honestly, all the patches were good. One, two, and three. 3.3 3 done. Damn. Filler content now. Well, no, it's like lead up to... So it's lead up now to Stormblood, I guess. But like... There's still so many open, open things. So we got that. Warrior of Darkness. Alice. Alice saw... Uriange talking to Elidibus and Elidibus to Warrior Darkness. So Alice has got the link. Thancred's now saved us. So now she can tell Thancred that. With Tan Thancred can tell us. We still need to save Papa Limo and Ida. We also still need to go see what the fuck's going on with like Nanamo and Alda and like Raulban and stuff. I feel like I feel like we left the storyline randomly in limbo there at the end of 3.0. There was also one more thing. Uh, the Isle of Val. I mean, we kind of worked out what happened with the Isle of Val now. It just got blown. I still don't know why it got exploded. I don't know really what happened to it, but it blew up and Cryo got saved by uh, by Heidelin, right? We know at least a little more about it, but we still don't. We still don't really know why. <laughs> uh, Hildy. Yeah, we still got loads of Hildy to do. Yeah, we've got loads of Heaven Sword content to still do. Like, I need to finish Alexander Savage. I need to finish the optional dungeons. Um, I mean, Hildy will just happen when Hildy happens. I'm still an ARR Hildy at the moment. Alliance raid as well. Yep, yep, yep. Dark Knight, Reaper. Yeah, there's so much to do. When's Hildy? Yeah, we've also got some more trials. Yeah, some more extreme trials and trials and stuff as well. Floor the Horde. Yeah, that actually kind of was a well reference. I didn't mention it. They're late bloomers. Yeah, Yastola got way better. Thancred got way better. I wonder... You know what? I wonder even if Papa Limo and Ida might get better. Who knows? <laughs> Minfilia got better as well. <laughs> actually true yeah <laughs> uh, asking a bit much yeah i mean don't say anything it's all good tataru got i mean tataru was always great stop picking on minfilia <laughs> 
She'll be back. She'll get better as well, you know? She'll get better as well. Same with Gaius. Surely Minfilia and Gaius are going to skip into a cutscene holding hands. It's not the Minfilia hate. She's already dead. <laughs> She can handle it. And Philia and Gaius are in love. All right, then. 3.3 Dunzo, baby. That was good. That was a good patch. 3.2 was great. I re yeah, yeah, dude. Okay, I need to. I still need to get to the end of uh, 3.55, though before I'd make a tier list. I could definitely, I can definitely see what's going on with my tier list at the moment. It just wouldn't be a complete tier list, right? Because like, I don't know what's going to go on with like Uri and uh, Alice. Am I going to do the 16 event? Um, Probably do it off stream because um, people told me there's spoilers that they don't want to watch. I don't know. Maybe I'll carve aside some time and do it on stream and just say spoiler warning. Close the stream if you don't want to do it. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I, and so how long is it around for? I don't have to do it anytime soon, do I? What happened in 3.1 and 3.2? Uh, so 3.1. We... Uh, I feel like we kind of like united the dragons and people there. Or we like worked towards it. Was that was 3.1 when we went back into the vault? And then we we like saved that girl who was getting who was falling off the cliff. And then people saw that the dragons could actually be kind of nice. Mood AF. I mean, I remember enjoying it. That was three point one. Uh, that was when we went back in the vault. Um, who did we chase into the vault? Uh, oh yeah, the kind of like mad priest guy, right? It was like the priest dude. Who stabbed Amaric? Yeah, Amaric got stabbed. Um, then there was like the crazy priest dude. He went and threw that girl off the top of the thing. Uh, what else happened in 3 1? Yeah, the evil priest. Yeah. Yeah, he got shanked. Yeah. yeah no, 3 Brent 1 was. Well, not Alex. Alex was side content. That's not even a, not even part of MSQ. Um, 3.2 was like the whole com uh, communion thing between the dragons and people. And then the Stinian going nuts, right? May the 8th, one month. Oh yeah, I got I got loads. Yeah, the event's live, Takunin. <clears throat> uh, hang on, is there a Minfilia slash Gaius fiction? Or can I... I can read somewhere. Or oh, do I have to cook? Yeah, you might have to cook. I don't know. Maybe there is. Who knows? Fuck knows. I'm just pulling shit out of the air here. Don't forget the Raoban battle. Oh, yeah. That was that was 3.2 as well, right? The the Grand Melee. Yeah, we did that last week. The Grand Melee. That was sick as well. Dude, 3.2 was really good. I really enjoyed it. And then we had, like, the good voice acting from the bar wench woman. You know, like, the, uh, the rioter. That was great as well. Um, and we had like a mana lane having some character growth as well. That's 3.2 with his old debacle thing. Yeah. Ah, uh, yes, the bar wench. When I once again got poisoned with that massive cup of cocoa, I really need to stop drinking cocoa. Alenian's getting punched in the face. Yeah, I'm wondering, like, hmm. I think the next. I think the next quest has surely got to tell me where Astinian went with the flowers. But I don't want to do that today. I mean, I want to do it right now. I, I actually want to keep going with MSQ right now. But I, I want to keep it to like a patch a day. Or a patch a week at the moment. Since we're still kind of doing other content at the same time. I think, I've, I, think I might be getting hooked, guys. I think I might be getting hooked. I kind of want to do... 3-4. <laughs> the quest line in the manor. Oh, is that for that quest? How long is that quest line in the house? 
Does this mean you'll continue MSQ? I kind of want to do a patch a week at the moment. Wanna react to the Good King Moogle Mog video? Um, potentially. I can't remember. When's Death to Nidhogg Extreme? Oh shit! Yeah, Nidhogg Extreme, baby. Okay, we're gonna still be in Heaven Sword for a little bit longer. I know we were supposed to be starting Stormblood in April. <laughs> But I still got, I've still got quite a bit to do in Heaven's Ward. The Hog Extreme. AAS when? When we kill AA7S. A7S tomorrow. AAS uh, probably next week. So Brute Justice Savage, minimum eye level next week. Providing we kill, yeah, I mean, probably, yeah, actually. Not even stalling, just experiencing the game, you know. It isn't too long, but uh, you want to time it because it's a chain quest. Yeah, it might be like, is it? Do you reckon it's like a couple hours? In which case, probably, probably not one to start right now. Dawn Trail 2030. Dawn Trail will be 2026, guys. All right. But Shadowbringers 2024, baby. All right. Play through it without knowing. 90% safe. Didn't see the final few scenes. Yeah, yeah. Apparently, there's like an unskippable cutscene at the end, and that's. But apparently, it's just for like the first hour of FF16 lore, so you're not spoiling like some crazy storyline, but it's still kind of a spoiler, right? Hot chocolate. All right, I trust you, Bernadette. I trust you. I could drink your hot chocolate. All right. <sighs> One gulp. One gulp, baby. It's all it takes. I'll believe it when I see it. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. Is Ponto joining me for BJ Savage? Um, different BJ, but yeah. Uh, anyway, um, no, he's he's. We're, we're gonna go in with the static that we have. You know, my usual static. Uh. <laughs> If you play the trial of ever 16 you'll be safe. Yeah, yeah. Apparently so. If you played the demo, you're probably you're probably chilling. Soup nasty. <laughs> Who is this? Soup nasty. Ew. First we need to kill A7. I really think we kill A7 tomorrow, guys. I don't think it's that crazy. Like I think we've basic like we just need to get the cages down and I think we're kind of chilling, right? The cages are like the main part of the fight, and then there's like the balls that roll around and stuff like that. I could be, I could be wrong. Maybe, it, maybe it gets even crazier. He hates hand jobs. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Um, thank you, Russ, and everyone who visited Oceana. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna go Oceana stream on Friday, by the way. But yeah, tomorrow still we have a stream doing uh, a A seven for sure. Let's get seven and eight done tomorrow. I don't know if we can get uh I don't know if we can get brute justice done tomorrow, you know. By the way, guys, me mechanized gentlemen, thank you for the follow. I noticed that we have a lot of new people in here today, or not a lot of people vampiring right now, okay? Firstly, welcome. Secondly, if you want to, feel free and consider following the stream. Hoggers, if you're having a good time, obviously. I appreciate that. Helps grow the stream and whatnot. Helps you get notified when we're going live again for more MSQ and things. What's the theme for the Glam Contest? On Friday, Glam Contest worldwide. Anyone can join. Big prizes. And uh, yeah, it's going to be an Oceana. And the theme is mythology. Specifically outside of FF game, like at least outside of FF14 mythology. I don't want to know anything about the mythology of the game because I haven't encountered it yet myself. So if you can do... Um, other games mythology, fine. You know, themed around other games mythology, themed around IRL mythology, anything like that. So literally any culture mythology in general. Just super broad. So there's a ton of different glams you could do for it. Hey, look! Hey, an error is back. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
Yeah, look at the new chatter. Slothman, thank you for the follow. Manual P second. Thank you for the follow as well. Yeah, let's dote the bun girl, guys. Uh, did I, I have not done the FF16 quest yet. No, no, not yet. Uh, I'll do it at some point, though. Through, uh, like, I'll probably do it before it goes away, right? Because I kind of want the rewards and things. What's going to be uh, in a town or an open zone? Um, probably an open zone. I'll probably pick a. I'll probably pick a nice space. It won't be up in the guild or anything. It'll probably be like out in the world somewhere. Um, and we'll just pick a nice little spot and we'll do it there. I'm thinking, where is there a zone? Is there a zone which is like kind of mythology themed? I suppose we could. Hmm. I guess not. Yeah, we did Costa del Sol before, but when it was a beach contest, right? I feel like I want to try and theme it around. I mean, you could do like the Sea of Clouds, I guess, but Mordona could be good. Um, Altar of the Twelve in the Shroud. Yeah, I think that's where we did the other glam contest, right? The church. Yeah, I think that's where we did it last time, right? On NA. Yeah. Yeah, we could do that then. Yeah, we just go back there. It was kind of a nice arena. And then everyone can come, right? Like, um... Because it's in a starting zone as well. Is this laugh? Yeah, churning mist could be nice, but I think we'll just go in the... Well, churning mist could be good because there's, like, background music. I mean, somewhere... The only problem with, uh, doing it in the Black Shroud is there's no, like, nighttime music. And it's gonna... We're gonna be there a while, right? Is this blah? Yeah. Mm, mm. Good question. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. I'll I'll make a uh I'll make a post about it in Discord as well later. By the way, guys, feel free to join the Discord. We have uh like two thousand people or something, and it and it grows every day. Okay, the Discord grows every day. Just stream music. Yeah, that's true. I could also do that. Um. Let's see. There's a. I put a uh, nice little link in the chat for you guys. All right. Uh, I should unpause the alerts as well now. Blah. Yo, Tweety. Yeah, join the Discord, guys. Links in the chat. We've got many nice people in Discord. Look, it pops off. It pops off all the time. We've got people always in voice, making friends together, streaming their POVs and whatnot, streaming their MSQ, chatting it out. We've got a uh, scatter. We've got a nice little screenshot channel here where people post nice little G poses they do and pictures that we have in game as communities and stuff. We have clips, general chat, react suggestions. Whoa, look at those got that Jesus. Whoa. Booba. Holy tits. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so we got that screenshots channel guys yeah you know <sighs> they were very large that's one way to show it jesus <sighs> yeah my bad my bad i didn't know that was the most recent screenshot all right guys <laughs> Oh dear. Oh dear. All right, there was one more thing I wanted to do. Um Kind of nice chilling here doing some uh are we songbirding right now. Oh yeah. Songbird enjoys. I think that emote is on offer by the way, guys. I think it's like 89 pence. If you like the songbird dance, I think it's on offer. Hello, yo, direwolf. Did you just tune in? You missed all the action. You don't have the emote on the other alt? Yeah, sadly, sadly. I, I don't like how you have to buy emotes for, like, per character. I guess it's kind of encouraging, like, having one character, I suppose, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm
One second, guys. Yeah, uh, nothing I'm going to share with stream, but I just got a really heartfelt DM. So, uh, yeah, I don't know if uh, who sent me is watching, but I appreciate that. And uh, yeah, I'll get back to you after stream, right? Um, yeah. Um, 60 mail. Oh, is that from like sub rewards, sub rewards and stuff? Yeah, I get like four. I get four mail, four males when I make a new character. Yeah. Right. Um, I'm thinking is there something that we else can, that we can do today? Can we make a list of like content? Actually, I think truck has truck is making me a list, right? You're are you sending me that today or whenever you have time? It's no rush. It's no rush. Truck. I think I think truck told me people were cooking in uh in voice chat of like stuff. Stuff that I have left to do in Heavensward. There's quite a bit to do. Like, I've got optional dungeons. I've got um, two patches. Three patches? Two patches. Two patches. Optional dungeons. Finish the raid. Alliance raid. Dark Knight. Maybe pick up Monk. I guess I could pick up Monk sometime during Stormblood as well, I suppose. Rescue Gilly. Yeah, rescue Gilly. 3.5. Oh, so there's three patches. So 3.5 and 3.55. Okay. Um, Fairfall, thank you for the follow, by the way. Trial. Oh, yeah. We've got Nidhogg Extreme. We've got some, I think, like two or three other trials or so, I think, that I've heard. Uh, a trial series. Uh, wait, there's 3.56. Yeah, two and a half patches. All right. Uh, do before because Law and Shadowbringer overlaps with the monk law. Oh, really? Oh, is this? Are we having another little, uh, <laughs> another little play dragoon for Heaven Sword? All right, am I playing monk for Shadowbringers? Okay, uh, not Shadowbringers. Stormblood? Yeah. Made a screenshot when you cleared 3.0. You saved it on your Discord. Oh, yes. Yep, 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 yep. I do actually have that in my private Discord, yeah. So, epilogue. Trials, Alexander, Alliance Trade, Optional Dungeons, Treasure Maps. I guess we've done a fair share of Treasure Maps. <laughs> uh, okay, we've done that. When the bow wakes. Okay, so these are... Oh, Sky Pirates is Alliance Raid. Okay. All right, nice. Thank you for that. Let me, uh, let me unpause the uh, alerts, guys. Okay. Let the shit show ensue. Many gift subs are about to go through. Thank you for those, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Here we go. Many memes be unleashed. Enjoy the memes. Hi, I'm new. Fairfall, what's up? Welcome in. Welcome in. Alerts on. Guys, time to gift subs. The alerts are back on. Woohoo! <laughs> Buckle up, baby. <laughs> uh oh, stinky. <laughs> Don't tell Ponto. I will not. Okay. All right. Your secret is safe with me. Actually, it's like one of the first days I haven't seen Ponto in my chat, unless he's lurking, quite uh -oh. potentially. Stinky. Oh no, the ads just started. That is actually kind of funny timing. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Guys, stare at them. Stare at them right now. Yeah, he might still be sleeping. It's, uh, what is it? 6.30? No, it's 7.30 on local time. He's up late. Yeah. Thank you, guys. I appreciate the gifts. I'm sorry. The names have well gone off my uh, chat by now. But if you did get gifts of sub today, make sure you thank uh, the sub gift is okay. You need appreciate you guys. Shut the fuck up. Sorry, I will shut the fuck up. My bad, my bad, my bad. Um, yeah, there's maybe like... Uh, we could do Uno map now, guys. Or maybe like a little chocobo race. You know? 
<laughs> Maybe like one choco? Uh. Yeah, let the memes play. Let the memes play. Wait, why is uh, why on the thing is the stare like wearing an Easter bunny suit? Oh no, chocobo! Peepo marble. It will not be one. Yeah, that's the thing. It might not be one. A little chocobo race as a treat. Dignity. Why are you laughing? God damn it! <laughs> here, here, here we go. Oh. Overlays always seem to be a bit behind. Oh, and the chat. Hey, this is the automatic Ponto AFK response. Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Z Three point three was real good. Um, I'm gonna have to make an update video, aren't I? On my uh, Heaven Sword opinion now. Easy, like easy views, guys. Help me come up with a title. This is what I really think of Heaven Sword. <laughs> and then I'll just put in the thumbnail, mid, <laughs> for the click. <laughs> <laughs> Just like full caps, mid, and then my face going. <laughs> Just being like really pissed. <laughs> Heaven Sword is still mid. <laughs> I was wrong about Heaven Sword. Oh my god. He's actually here, guys. What the heck? How did you do that? How did chat do that? Was that at my desk instead of the floor? Let's go! PC fixed, Amatoria? Ten reasons why Heaven Sword didn't live up to the hype. <laughs> I could make that. Actually, yeah, I could probably think of like two. Two reasons, maybe. Hell yeah, Amatoria. Good shit, good shit. We made a summoning circle. Yeah, everyone la everyone got here and did uh and did Songbird. And then someone mentioned Ponto's name three times in chat and he's here. Okay, what? What, Kukcha? Wait, what? Blah. Gobbies ruined Heaven Sword. No way, dude. Gobbies could not ruin Heaven Sword. Gobbies are amazing. Is this clickbait? Click to find out. <laughs> Why Stormblood is insanely underrated. Now that is a video that may well happen. Maybe I'll do a little recording today. I finished 3.3 and my mind is blown. <laughs> Did Heavensward really deserve MMO of the year? <laughs> Stormblood over Heavensward. Oh, that'll get people. That'll get people riled up. Look, I'm going into Stormblood when I do go into it with absolutely zero. I'm going into it like ARR. I feel like I've heard more bad shit about Stormblood than I have about uh, ARR. So I'm going to have even low expectations, which means I'm probably going to enjoy it even more than ARR. That's just how it works in my brain. That title would bang. Yeah. Did Heavensward really deserve MMO of the year? <laughs> Cabot Honey, thank you for the follow. Um, yeah, I like Stormblood. How could you see Giga Chad? Just a picture of Giga Chad as the thumbnail. Um, the areas in Stormblood? Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Stormblood, good. No, tell me Stormblood... Guys, you're doing it wrong. Tell me Stormblood sucks. Okay, everyone just tell me Stormblood bad. And uh, it only gets better after Stormblood. Okay, tell me that. And then I'll drop all my expectations through the floor and I'll probably have a great. It's ass. Stormblood bad. Stormblood mid. No, say bad. Stormblood is bad. Stormblood is the heaven sword of Final Fantasy. <laughs> Stormblood is as bad as 1.0. Thank you, Zavolo. Mwah! Kissy for you. 10 reasons why Heaven Sword is overrated. Number three will make you <laughs> fart, right? Number three will make you fart on your dad. Jesus. 
Jesus. Stormblood is bad, but redacted is best. Stormblood is the Shadowlands of Final... Oh my god, imagine if I put Heavensward is the, fi is the Shadowlands of Final Fantasy. I think I would probably get cancelled. <sighs> so much anger. Yeah, I think that would probably be like a danger. I think that might be how to get death threats in the FF section. Cancelled from both sides. Yeah, people are like... Oh my god, he's making a comparison to Final Fantasy. That furry game. That weeb period. game. Fight me. Yeah, Mr. Malo, I reckon... I think... I have this inkling that I'm going to be a Stormblood enjoyer. It's not bad. It's actually good. I reckon it's probably going to be good. But I'm going to go into it with no expectations. That's my defense mechanism at this point. Yeah, lower my expectations as much as possible so it can't, so it exceeds them as much as possible. Does that make sense? She storms my blood until I heaven sword. Austin? Are you all good back there? Are you all good back there? <laughs> I can't believe I need Storm blood was adequate. <laughs> <laughs> Silver Dragon's name is Vaidfonir. He is his first general. Uh, Silver, uh, Vaidfonir. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Nice. Thanks, Solitaire. Did we ever get introduced to Vaidfonir? A new game, new game plus of Stormblood. I didn't really watch the cutscenes, but I've begun to enjoy them. Yeah, do it, Kami. Do it, and also do it before I do it, and then you can watch them again when I do it. Easy clap. Easy clap. Uh, did you did you read the book? Uh, no. Wait. What do you mean? Out of game book or the, the book that, that the Count put on the desk? Can I read that? Uh, when's Sexy Dragons? When sexy dragons? Why isn't Hrais Volga like Alex Straza? Yeah. Dude, imagine if they had human forms. Like, I guess kind of Astinian did, right? Like, kind of Nidhogg did. Also, he was like buff version of uh, Astinian. Yo, Nazragath. Oh, Nazragath. While you're here, I can add you. E or NA. Uh, Hrais Velga's heart. I mean, Hrais Velga's hella cool. Uh, like, uh, am I just keeping his eye, by the way? Like, what the hell? I guess we'll find out. Maybe I'll give it back to him in a patch. Like, next patch, potentially. But I kind of feel like I, I just have it now. So that I can be really powerful. Cat. <laughs> but she's an aura. Oh, no plate. Just keep it, I guess. It's a good eye. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. It's got power in it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. He had both eyes when you were flying with him. Wait. Did he? Oh, did I give it? Did I give it back? Are you Odin logging in now? Okay. Um, come over to, uh, Spriggan, and, uh, I'll add you on my other character. You'll just need to tell me the name. Fuck Chromie. I wish death of Chromie never happened so she could actually be dead. Wait. Wait, Chromie died? Dude, to be fair, this is the thing. With WoW lore, I just have no fucking clue. Because I've played WoW for 18 years, and there's, like, shit that I just don't know. Because it's told so badly in the game. I'm on Odin too. There you go. Easy clap, easy clap. Yeah, I'm going to add you on Russ just gifting. Odin gang, assemble. Yeah, that is true. He had both his eyes, so I guess I just gave it back to him. That sucks. So wait, my entire, the entire shit I was saying about, I like how they, uh, they give you these like, not like trophies, but these like really giga powerful items. So it makes sense that your character creep works. It was all BS. I was just 
I was just cooking something that wasn't there. Heck you. Isn't WoW Law outsourced? Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of books. There's a lot of books. Just another day. Stick to crystals. <laughs> no dragon eyes for me. I was thinking it wouldn't make sense if I wasn't a dragoon, but it kind of made sense because I was a dragoon, right? Odin gang assemble, followed by four players. Woohoo! Odin gang! Yippee! Is Odin really dead? Odin's on light, right? Yeah, Odin light. The difference between hungry and horny. Where the cucumber goes. <laughs> I did not expect that from Yuki. I'm not gonna lie. Jesus. Order is important. Yeah. Uh, why would you, a light weave, a light leave light and go to chaos? Um, you know, to come see me, of course. Smile. Yeah. That one was a that one was a ha huh in for sure. <laughs> Concerned about you. Yeah, Alice got it right. Yep, yep. <sighs> those are literal food goods, okay? You should just be eating those. That should be their purpose. A quick wash and you can eat the cucumber as... <laughs> Do not eat the cucumber afterwards, okay? God damn. You guys are down bad. You guys are down bad. There are better options. Yeah, exactly. Sheesh, Hattie. Hattie finally comes out of their shell. <laughs> what are we at? Day two? Is it day two? Day two. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> now that is a good 20th message. Wait, hold on. Oh. I knew I'd get kisses. If I knew I'd get kisses, I'd give him more bits. Oh, sorry. I forgot about that. My bad. My bad. You can't stop me. Good time to tune in. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, what if you peel the cu- You know what? We're not gonna- We're not gonna go more in depth with the cucumber, guys. All right? <laughs> Fuck. I did not mean it that, that way. God damn it! I did not mean it even to, to be a... You know what? Never mind. <sighs> I meant we're gonna change subject. I meant we were gonna change subject. Okay, my bad. God damn it. <laughs> it's honestly incredible the way you do this yourself. I, I have a knack for it and it's not even intentional. I don't know how. Like I'm the I'm like I'm like the funniest person not trying to be funny. And when I try to be funny, I'm the least funny person. I'm so I'm so not a funny person except by accident. You know? Naturally sussy. Yeah. I guess. Uh, cuck scene. Co no cock, no fuck. I, when did I say that? What quote is that? I've never said that. <laughs> God damn it. All right. I need to log on to Russ just gifting here. All right. I need to log. I need to log the uh, Lala real quick just to add uh, someone for gifting some prizes too. Two seconds, guys. I will be back. I will be back. I'll be back to the foundations. Mm -mm. I see to add an Azragath to give them the prize for the uh, Star Trek thing. Tell me when you're on Azragath and your name. Okay, and I'll add you up. Not all quotes are sus. Some are wholesome. Yeah, maybe a couple, but a lot of them, I get baited. 
You said it this year, mate. Yeah, but but when though? I know like when, but give me the context, you know? Where did your kneecaps go? Look, they're right there. Right there. In my big big old boots. Quote 100. All right, what's that one? Quote 100. I love kissing boys. It's based. Oh my god, it's just me and Alka in here. True quote. Quote 100 is just all of us. Yep. It is what it is, man. It is what it is. I mean, Amerik. Kissing boys, I'm in. Yeah. Should we have a boy kissing party, guys? Woo! <laughs> Alright, uh... Add my Lala. Lazrogath. Lazrogath, sorry. It's Russ just gifting. Alright, add me up. I'll, uh, I'll accept. We just need to be on the same uh, server to add, and then we should be good. Hi, Aranea. Wow, you made it here quick, huh? Is it an OP leveling machine? Yeah, I guess you can round stuff up, right? So, this is why they call you the Azure Dragoon. This is why Reaper is going to fit me so well, guys. All I heard about Reaper... I shit you not, this is all I know about Reaper, the job, okay? They wear blue lit stip, lipstick, and they kiss boys, and they're kind of edgy, and they play a little bit like a demon hunter, and they have a, a portal they can fly backwards and go back through. That's literally... And they use a scythe, and that's all I know. They just like me for real. My husband sit, uh, switched from Dragoon to Reaper and never looked back. Easy clap. And that turns you on, correct? No, I never said Reapers turn me on. I just said um, I want to play one. Like, I want to be I want to be that, you know? You know? It's great. Pretty accurate. Blue lipstick? That's what I heard. Something about blue lipstick coral number five or something. <laughs> coral blue lipstick number five or something. I've not done the crossover yet so far yet. Not yet. Pickle Queen, thank you for the follow, by the way. Reapers turn Russ on. Noted. I never said it turned me on. That was somewhat, that was a leading question from chat. When did I say it turned me on? You want to be the turn on. Yeah. It, true. That's true. You want to be the turn on. Based. Hattie, that's hella based. I haven't played Reaper and I've kissed zero boys. Coincidence? See, I guess Reaper's just for me then. Yeah, do the spooky slice, yeah. Right, uh, cat name. Do, 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 do. Be the turn on you want to see in the world. Those are good good words, actually, to live by, boss. Character in it has full graphical update. It looks so good. Really? Because I heard someone to so. Silfaria, I've heard you say that the character has a graphical update and looks good. And I've also heard that it looks like a port to a previous uh, a previous generation. So I don't know who to trust now. If the character looks good or people are like, it's a downgrade from 16, which I think is on a completely different graphics engine, so it makes sense. But are they using the new models with the graphic update that they're putting in Dauntro then? Yo, Pickle Queen, been watching you on YouTube. Guys... New YouTube frog spotted in the chat right there. New YouTube frog right there. Welcome in. Glad glad that you're here watching live, by the way. And I'm glad you've been enjoying the YouTube content. In case anyone watching the stream for the first time today didn't know and was not already aware, guys. I have a YouTube channel which is fairly consistent at pumping out content. Um, it's on the revival at the moment. I'm posting like two to three times a week right now. Um, there's a bunch of videos here to binge of my escapades so far. And, uh, I also have a VODs channel if you ever missed the VODs as well. All right. That's incorrect. Two to three. Two to three. It is, no, no, no. It is pretty consistent at the moment. Last week was two. Maybe this week might be two. Maybe three. And maybe next week will be three. You know, we'll see. We'll see. Uh, it, it posts when it posts. Let's be real. It posts when it posts. But... 
This one might be of particular interest to you guys if you want to check out the YouTube channel. This video kind of popped off. It um, didn't really ruffle some feathers. A lot of people enjoyed it. This is basically my thoughts on the game after having played for about six months. A little bit more than six months. So if you want to hear a WoW player's and, and Sprout's opinion of, uh, of your favorite game after having given it a decent shot, it's in that video. All right. Boom. I trust Maori more. Me too. <laughs> it's a downgrade from 16, um, but near impossible to react. Yeah, yeah, to recreate Clive. I, I think that's pretty much uh that's pretty much it, Sailor's here. Wow is life. Wow used to be my life. Now honestly, I think I have a good balance of uh oh, sorry. I have a good balance of uh Aw. Look at us! Perfectly planted. Perfectly planted there. Yo, Loon Loon. Thank you for uh why is it not popped in chat? So cute. Oh, there you go. Ooh. Uh oh. Thank you for continuing the gift Stinky. sub from Fenrir. Fenrir, if you're here, appreciate you doing that gift sub in the first place. Loon Loon, appreciate you uh, converting. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So cute. I used to play WoW for six years. Happy I swapped. Me too. I played WoW for 18 years. Happy I swapped over to uh, FF. WoW was a good part of my life. I feel like now I have a good balance. Like I play FF and think about F Like I play FF on stream. I think about it a little bit off stream. But I don't try and overthink it. And it's not like... It's not like when I used to stream WoW. Because I would stream WoW. Then I would go off stream. And then I'd play WoW. And I just... All I was doing was everything was like WoW related. And it kind of dominated my life. And it's a bit... It's a bit despair as well. So yeah. Oh look! Nazoth Regath. Boom! Okay. Let me, uh, let me, how do I add? How do I add you as a friend? Oh, I've got one here. Nice. Thank you. Perfect. I will uh, send you your gifts and I'll be in touch. 18 years fixed in 100 days. That's pretty, that's pretty incredible when you put it like that. When's the last time I logged into WoW? Right, so I play classic WoW off stream now and then. Which, so that would be, uh, I played for about 20 minutes yesterday. I logged in, I did like three quests and I logged out on classic WoW. So that's the last time I played that. Last time I played retail was before I started playing FF. I mean, I, I logged in to check my mailboxes because my account, I thought my account got hacked the other day. Apparently it wasn't, but I don't know. Bit sus. Um, but yeah. I, uh, last time I played Retail WoW was like August last year. So I'm actually kind of cured from Retail WoW. But yeah, I, I play some classic with my friends off stream. Off stream Dark Knight leveling. I think I want to do Dark Knight on stream, right? Because I heard Dark Knight is, is like a really uh, good quest line. So part of me is like I should... Part of me says that I should like level up Dark Knight and do all of the job quests in a row to get like the full storyline. And part of me says that I should um, just like level it up on stream and do it a bit at a time kind of thing. Dark mode. Yeah, I heard the story is really, really good. So I kind of want to like level it up without the abilities and just kind of uh, sandbag <laughs> my, my duties and then uh, and then go do all the quests together or something. Yeah, I'll be missing abilities, but it would probably still be playable, right? Feral M, thank you for the follow, by the way. Um, 3.3 is done. Yeah, we finished it. We finished it. So it will be in the VOD if you want to check that. That VOD will probably be out in a couple of weeks on the VOD channel. It's um, it's about two. It's about ten days behind in VODs at the moment. Um, but they're all scheduled, so they're just coming out one per day on the VOD channel for the next like ten days, and then we'll be back up to date. Um, uh, playable? Yes. Enjoyable? Don't know. Right. First time viewer, long time Reaper, and boy kisser. Let's go. New boy kisser in the chat, baby. Let's go. Hell yeah. 50 to 60 is sort of whatever, but the rest of them are good. Right, okay. Nice. Yeah, it was really good though, Dula. 3.3, we enjoyed. We enjoyed 3.1, 3.2, and 3.3. And 3.0. But Thor and Normal sucks. There. That's my critique. That's my analysis. All right. Heavensward is not mid. It's just a little bit worse than a Realm Reborn. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, 
I do think it is probably better than a Realm Reborn. Yeah, but that's not to say Realm Reborn is bad. So I guess I kind of think highly of it now, huh? I guess how times change, man. How times change. All right, let me log back in my aura now that I've got my ad done. Thank you for that, Nazrogath. Let's get back in the aura for a sec. I need to songbird. He said 14 is bad. He hates all expansions. Just say that you want to go back to WoW. I don't, guys. Okay, if I wanted to, I would. Arrow's just a slog. Uh, I think it's good. I think it's good. I, I didn't really feel like it dragged. The only part, maybe, Aero dragged. There's two, two parts. The Titan quest line. And the leading up to uh, Castro and Sentry. That's it. That's the two only times I think that it dragged. Maybe a, a tiny bit in Koathas. With like finding the... Uh, uh, the Enterprise, maybe. But even then, I think it was kind of fine. If Reapers are boy kisses, what do I need to uh, to main to kiss all genders? Anything. You can do anything. You can just switch job for that, uh, Hati. Yeah. We have some, uh, you know, we have people in the chat who kiss all genders, so you should be good. Scholar. <laughs> Alka knows it best, huh? Dancer. Oh, hell yeah. I love Dancer. Um, especially since Thorda and Extreme is super good. Yeah, yeah. It's weird that Thorda Normal didn't get adjusted. Yeah. That's what we were talking about yesterday. Like, because Asian Prime got adjusted, it's weird that Thorda and Normal didn't. But Thorda and Extreme is really good. Yeah, I thought Asian Prime was kind of cool. I think we one shot it, but it was kind of cool at the time, right? Hell yeah. Uh, the company of heroes and getting the right crystal to fight Garuda. I, actually, the getting the crystal for Garuda was pretty quick. But finding the Enterprise, that took ages, I remember. And uh, it was all that, you know, when you first get to Mordona and you're going backwards and forwards to like Castrum Sentry a bunch of times to like infiltrate with the Imperials. It was cool when you got Maggie and stuff. But there was a bit before when it's like going to like make the suit of armor and going to learn the salute and all that kind of stuff, which I get is kind of like lore reasons to kind of fit in and whatnot. So it wasn't the worst thing ever. Like I still enjoyed it, but it definitely was like maybe a couple quests too long, I suppose. If I heal them, I better be able to kiss them. Just kiss everyone, guys. It's just that easy. Um... Finding the Garuda Crystal. There was, like, all I remember about finding the Garuda Crystal was, uh, it was like, we did this thing, like, we went up to, uh, Thanalan, was it? Talked to the guy at the bridge. Then we investigated something. Then we killed a Spriggan. And then they were like, oh, no, this is, this is the one for fire. And then he was like, just kidding. It's actually the one for air. That's all we need. All right, we're good. Yeah, I think the pre-Titan was the, the longest part from my memory. And it was like, because it was like, you go to... What's that dude who wears the uh, leopard skin uh, pants? Fuck, Trash Tomb. Trash Tomb was like a little bit of a troll. And then after his whole troll quest line, you then had to go to like Costa del Sol and do like 50 more quests. I think the wine port bit was good. Uh, the bit where, like, the whole Wineport quest sign and saving Wineport and, like, getting the ba the Baka, the Baka, the Bacalach, uh tree and coconut or something. That bit was good. Um, but, the, like, and I, and I like Brave Fox Longstop as well. That was good. Um, but, like, all the, there was a, definitely a bit they could cut there, but it's also fine with the inn, right? It's kind of fine. Oh, yeah. Yeah, glad that for me, the only part I got stuck on MSQ was at level 49 to 50, and I had to do one dungeon, and then I leveled up, and then it was fine again. They should cut it. I think they should just maybe shorten it, if at all. But yeah, that would probably be like the biggest gripe. And because it's quite early on in the game, I think that might be where people... Like, Titan is like a big payoff. Like, if it's good, it's like a first uh, fight, but it's quite easy. I feel like to push the... To cut a little bit of the Company of Heroes part so that you get to fight Titan. Like, it doesn't... 
Because some people probably quit during that quest line where they're like, all right, fuck this. I'm kind of over this. And they never get to see Titan. Whereas if they got to see Titan, they might be like, ooh, okay, this is kind of kind of get get like popping off now, you know? Like it's the first like good fight that you have. So if they remove some of the scuff before it, more people will make it to the good fight. So more people will like get to get to Titan, like, and then they'll get hooked at Titan potentially, right? Yeah, I think ARR as a whole is good though. That's had the same in voice chat when you got to that bit. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So it's just like, all right. I think that's I think that's maybe where they can fix ARR. Maybe that's a YouTube video, guys. How to fix a realm reborn? <laughs> yeah, it dips. It's like a quit moment, right? Have you ever heard like Just Strive Hayes talking about quit moments in games? Like where you just log out and it might just be the last time. Like you want to take a, like you feel like you want to take a break. And that could just like any of those times could be your last time. Or it could just be like, all right, I'm done with this. I'm over it now. Like you don't want to have those. And like that is kind of a quit moment. And you haven't had a, a exposure to the game enough to like be like, oh, it's one of these moments again. Because that's the first time and you haven't. Like if Titan was, if if he fought Titan and then you did that quest line, you'd probably just be like, ah, it's fine, because like I just had a cool moment, like I gotta get to the next cool moment kind of thing. But you haven't had a good fight yet. Like if it was was alright, but like he was cool, lore wise and stuff. But the fight, like he kind of fell over, right? And his room is cool as well. Patch quest dragged out, right? Yeah, yeah. Post era was worse. Yeah, I wonder how much of base they got rid of then. Yeah, I think I think having those moments is fine, but having them early might put off new players. I guess that's how I would encapsulate that. Exactly, Voss. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And that on top of the combat is a bit like, oh, I'm struggling now, you know. I found it fine because I'm doing it on stream and I can just chat with you guys and we're like memeing about it. But I can see as like a new player playing off stream, it might be a bit... A bit annoying, I suppose. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, I think, guys, we are going to. We're going to throw a raid, guys. Um. All right. No, not a rave. A raid. Well, I guess we can do a rave as well. <sighs> Heaven Sword. It was pretty good overall. It was pretty good. Today was fun, guys. Today was a good stream. Tomorrow, we're going to come back, kill A7 Savage. Alexander, quick things, all thoughts. Savage, cage boss, okay? Why duck ass, baby, in the chat right now? Why duck ass in the chat? Um, And then Friday, Oceana, open to everyone. Glam contest. Be there or be square, all right? I'm going to raid uh, D Nile, all right? I'm going to raid Denial. All right. He's doing some mental roulettes on OC. All right. So feel free to go say yo in his chat. Feel free to go uh, get, get involved on Oceana potentially if you'd like to. Um, thank you, Amatoria. Congrats on the PC being fixed, by the way. And guys, yeah, go say hi in the chat. Even if you got to pop off, do something else. If you got to pop off, uh, enjoy the rest of the evening. Check out our different stream, closing Twitch all together, going to make food, all that good stuff. Make sure at least put a little hi in uh, Dina's chat, okay? And um, I will catch you guys tomorrow. Thank you very much for the new follows today. Welcome in. Feel free to follow if you're new, by the way. Thank you for the gift subs. Thank you for the resubs. Appreciate you guys. Thank you for just being here. Thank you for chatting. Thank you for lurking. All right. Thank you for getting involved. Welcome to all the new frogs who came over from YouTube as well. All right. See you back here tomorrow at 2 p.m. sharp. Okay. All right.
Go say yo to denial, okay? Egg. All right, GG's on completing 3.3. Thank you. It was fun. It was fun. All right. We will be back tomorrow, okay? Go say yo or be a circle. Yeah, be there or be a circle. We're doing some savage raiding tomorrow. Maybe maybe I'll swing the eye tracker on optional mode or something, you know? We'll see how it goes. But thank you, guys. All right. All right, guys. Nice little rave to end the stream, huh? As always, just remember, if you took one thing away from today's stream, <sighs> Heaven Sword is not mid. Love the nose piercing. Thank you. I've had this about a year now, actually. I'm going to get my ear done next. I'm going to get this one done. Yeah. So brave. So brave. As always, guys. Peace. Peepo, bye. See you in D9.